ladies and ladies, gentlemen and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. I am Tim. Almost an entire year ago, I did the starting room challenge on every single Treyarch Zombies map chronologically with one YouTuber, one Zombies YouTuber joining me per map. So what was cool and what was unique about that video was seeing not only 30 different personalities, 30 different Zombies YouTubers in one video, but also just seeing the evolution of COD Zombies from World at War all the way up to Black Ops 4. You guys enjoyed watching it, and I enjoyed making it. I love nothing more than making these types of videos. So what I've been drumming up for the past couple of weeks behind the scenes is what you're about to witness. Instead of doing a starting room challenge this time around, however, I'm going to be doing a 1v1. I am going to be 1v1-ing 30 different Zombies YouTubers. Now you may be wondering, Tim, how could you 1v1 somebody in Zombies? It is a cooperative game mode. And to that I say, very good question, and here's how it works. Whoever downs first, loses. It's a completely normal, it's a completely standard game of Zombies, it just so happens that whoever downs first, loses. It's definitely going to be a different dynamic than a regular game of Zombies, that goes without saying. And I will warn you in advance, these are all experienced Zombies players. Hence why they're YouTubers. So you're going to see me take my fair share of L's, uh, but also W's. Ultimately, though, I couldn't really care less who wins or loses. This is purely for entertainment. It's for the entertainment of you, myself, and all of the participants in this video. And if you were wondering what the criteria was to be featured in this video, well, most of these guys are just close friends of mine, people I frequently collab with, or are just cool guys that I either reached out to or they reached out to. To me. Some of these guys are bigger in the community and some of them are smaller. We have some new faces I'm competing against today, such as NoahJ456 and Codename Pizza. And we have some returning faces like Mr. T Lexify, like JC Backfire. Also, before we get into this behemoth of a video, I highly recommend going down into the description and picking up some pretty cool stuff I got down there. I have merch. I have brand new merch, Tim Privilege merch. I also have some G Fuel. Use code Hansen for a discount. And the posters, very high quality, super affordable, you're going to love them. If you tweet me a picture of you ordering any of this stuff, I will follow you back. And if we can get to 10,000 likes on this video, I will be doing this again for you guys. I hope you enjoy the competitive nature of this. I hope you enjoy the conversations my friends and I have. And I really, really hope you pay attention and appreciate the evolution of Call of Duty Zombies unfold right before your eyes. 1v1 me, bitch. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first one. Of course, we're starting with World of War Nocturne and Toten, and I am joined with my buddy Rumor. And as you guys know, we're going to go chronologically. It's going to go Varukt after this, Shinonuma, Doris, and so on and so forth until we get to Black Ops 4. Again, this is a 1v1. Whoever downs first loses. Rumor, you are the very first impression for everybody, so don't suck. I know. Okay. I'm going I'm to I'm do my best to beat you here, okay? <laughs> All right. All right. All right, yeah. friendly all right. competition. So Let's just all keep that exactly. in mind. This is such a bare bones map, dude. Like literally just. That's what it was meant to be, and I love it. Literally, yeah. No perks, dude. Just weapons. And, <laughs> the uh... World of War characters are so spedly. Hey, go over I there know. and watch me. Watch me run in the air with my fucking. Watch this shit. <laughs> <laughs> look at me. Look at me. Watch. <laughs> That's the funniest shit in the world. I wish they still do. They still have that in Black Ops Three or Black Ops Four. So I I don't know. Um, also, this is World of War, so it's gonna be really difficult. The zombies are really glitchy and inconsistent, and the guns aren't all yeah. that good. I mean, we got a ray gun, but other than that, yeah. even even that it has like a ton of splash damage. Basically, rumor we're gonna die probably around like round 10, 15 if we're lucky. <gasps> no mule kick. Nope. Okay. That's tragic. So. I'm gonna I'm gonna be that person and make you open all the doors, okay? All right. I mean, that's, that's on this map, I I'm not even like, you know, on this map it's kind of like whatever because there's only fucking two doors anyways. I don't know if I want to buy the Olympia or wait, is that the Olympia? No, it's not the Olympia. I'm oh, an idiot. Car 98. Yeah, oh, we're not in Black Ops. We're gonna edit one that yet. one out. All right, so M1 carbine. No, Tim, don't do that. I knifed I him and almost good. got sucked into him. Oh, look okay, at that! Look at that weapon. snipe. Look at that absolute snipe. Oh, that hit Dude, the you. the carbine shreds. I oh threw a goodness. grenade and it hit you instead of my actual target. Yeah. Or maybe you were my target. Oh. Ah, fuck! Fuck! <laughs> eh. 
All right, I'm getting the heck out of here, mate. I'm gonna go. Hey, can I open up this door? Thanks. I'm gonna go spin the box. He he he. Come on, Raygun. I'm gonna try and. Where am I? All right. If you get Raygun first, set. Oh, okay. I got the bar. bar? Okay. Box uh, spin number two. Since we can't do anything else. Come on, Raygun. I mean, we could go get the. Uh, <sighs> what, what gun is in the uh, is in the 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 the, the cabinet? Thing. The, the cabinet, scoped yes. Car 98K, which is pretty much only like 50% better than the regular Car 98K, and it's like yeah. more than triple the price. So you be the judge. What are we gonna do? Are you planning on training or camping? Cause like we're enemies, and, and okay, I think I might try to camp and just see how that goes. I suppose. Yeah, it's just the two hit. That's the only thing. That's the only reason why I don't yeah. want to, to train. But like, well, in World of War, they're a little more forgiving. Like you have a bit of time to react. Yeah, let's pull out the gear. Such a weird name for a weapon, the gear. It's actually it's pronounced Gewehr. Oh. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Not gonna lie, I watched that go down, and I was <laughs> I was gonna let you die there. When you get hit, the hit markers, they're so aggressive, like for no reason. Yeah. It's like getting slapped by Jesus. <gasps> oh, STD. Oh, my. oh, okay. As long as we don't open this debris right here, should be fine. <laughs> this is going to be an interesting dynamic here. Are there any character quotes on this map? I just noticed that. There are in the trailer. I don't actually know if they're in the map. I did hear them okay. talking. I know in they're the in trailer. the I know Richtofen's in the tutorial. The character what the shit one. just happened to that zombie? <gasps> I don't know. Oh! <gasps> Oh shit! Oh, no. We'll see. The ray gun is good in Black Ops One, but not quite. Forty. Not quite reached its potential here in World of War. So, we'll see if I kill myself with the splash damage before anything else happens. What about the MP40? I don't Wait, know. Wait, you can't dive? Oh, you can only prone. You can't dolphin dive. My cat's gonna try and sabotage me here. He's trying to get on my lap. Isn't it crazy to think that this right here, this ray gun? This, like, not-so-great wonder weapon is the best thing at the time. It was yeah. the thing that everybody just creamed themselves to see in the box. Alright, bar is not cut through right now. Oh, WAIT, okay. I KILLED MYSELF WITH A GRENADE! <laughs> <laughs> what?! <laughs> oh, God. Wow, that just right. ended by me killing myself with my own grenade. I thought I would kill myself with the ray gun before I ever killed myself with a grenade. Jesus Christ. All right, well, that's Wait, a great way to start off the video. Down. That was interesting. Um, you have any uh, final closing statements for the lads? Uh, make sure to change your underwear. Yes. Hey, we're on Verruckt now. Uh, lost the first one, Nocturne Toten. Thanks, Rumor. Uh, and we're going to play an even harder map. You ready for Verruckt, my friend? <laughs> nope. I'm so nervous. Oh, my Especially God. Especially on yeah. World at War. Especially on Verruckt, too. We got a culmination. We got a big storm here. Just at least we're in the same area. Fuckery. That's is what that this good is. Good or bad? Uh, it could be either. It could be either. Oh, this was also not our first choice. We were forced to play this map. <laughs> yeah. I wanted to do classified, and then yeah, my account. I I ran out of PlayStation Plus. Really? Ah. Oh. It's I unfortunate. It's real unfortunate. But hey, I mean, you get uh, you get the full uh, challenge experience. You know? Yeah, I guess so. You get the bare bones, uh, World of War. <laughs> Nobody else wanted to touch it. Experience. <laughs> I'm terrified to knife. This game sucks at knifing. Yeah, the zombies in this engine, man, they're super glitchy. Speaking of glitch. Yo. All right, round one done. Goal number one is to get a gun that you can keep a safe distance with. I think that's goal mm -hmm. number one. Goal number two is, of course, power, then jug. No pack a punch on this map, unfortunately. But uh, yeah, we have we have some hope on this map. Uh, but not a lot. Wanna open the door? Right, I'll get it, I'll get it, I'll get it, I'll get it. <laughs> yes, I get the tops in. Oh, tops Thank in. you, Glitch. Yeah, three wall bison. Thank you. You know, Glitch, you're an interesting guy in the zombies community because you do tutorials, but you do good tutorials. Uh, I've actually followed a couple of your tutorials, the ones on oh, yeah. uh, Black Ops 4, and that's, that's pretty cool. They're easy to follow. Ooh. Yeah, I really like Ooh, them. Cool, thanks. Yeah, that's how I found you. It's not like I created fast guides. They right, were there before yeah. me, but I think I just uh, kind of brought them to people's attention when they needed them most. In Black I Ops guess. 4, yeah. A time, yeah. A time where there are infinite parts to grab and mm -hmm. many a things to build. Glitch was there for all of us in the trenches. Let's stand right here for the rest of the game and not move. Shower challenge only. Yeah, I feel shower that. Shower challenge. It's not even a shower. It's just a drainage no, no. leaking up. It's distorting my vision. How many uh, new people are you having in this video? Oh, no! Not yet! 
Jesus Christ! I don't know Christ. why I protected you. I just killed that zombie. What the hell, I'm, I'm man? I'm taking pity on you. That's what I mean. It's fight. so easy to just get caught off guard. To get caught fucking slipping up. Let's go up to the power. Let's yeah, do I'll open up a door or two. I've been kind of nah, slacking. No, no, don't worry, man. I got it. I've been kind of slacking. Christ. Invite me to your video. Make me open up all these goddamn doors. <laughs> Great. Well. I, dude, I could have. Power's open. No, I, I don't even want to hear it. This would have been my weapon, whatever you get. Oh, you can actually take that on. Is that what you want? You want the M1 Garand? Nope. Nah, I'm good. Ah, uh, okay. It did I the am ping. running out of ammo. It did the ping noise. Okay, I got enough. I got enough. Ping. Ping. Oh, no! No! <laughs> what the fuck, Hell? man? Hell I got... yeah, brother. Dude, it, I... <sighs> Round five, my guy. I Come literally on, got stuck to the motherfucker. It's not even fair. Oh, your face. All right, hey, so... I can... Here's what we I can, can do. Pick you up, man. I'll, yeah, I, yeah. I'll forget about it. Res I'll me, about it. res me, and we'll go out like gentlemen. We'll uh, take a grenade. Where do you want to die? You want to die in the showers? Like we, we got to die uh, the way we lived we in got, the showers. We got toilets over here. Let's go over this. Toilets. Way. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, I got stuck to the zombie. Go fucking figure. That's how World of War works, man. I just. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they. Man, I'm salty, but um, that was come a here, GG. I'm just gonna blow right myself here. up. Yeah, yeah. As oh, a custom. And you're down. Yep. Here, hold on. I'll pick you up real quick. Let's see. And... Oh. All right, oh. you're up, dude. Go! That's another tally in the L column. Another loss <laughs> for Tim. Good God. Oh, man. Well, it's looking like I might come out with more losses than wins in this video, which is really... A, just a really grim thought. All I want to say is that was... That game was worth it. Yeah. The amount of time it took us to get into that lobby. We spent think, twice uh, the amount of time getting into the lobby than the actual game itself. Yeah. In that That was great. Yeah. All right. On to Shinonuma. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Shinonuma. I'm joined with Claystar. Claystar has a nice little history on YouTube of playing Shinonuma. I, I've been to a lot of your live streams where mm. you're grinding out World of War Shinonuma because of how ridiculously easy these high rounds are. But we're not yep. doing high rounds today, ladies and gentlemen. This is a 1v1, of course. Uh, what else would it be? You know what we should do? What's that? You should go for around 1,000 on this map. How long does that take? I know that's really easy, but how long does yeah. that take? That's quite a time would, investment more than anything. I would say it's like 11 hours. So you could probably do it in a day. Ooh, not too bad. I think Shinonuma is probably one of the most underrated maps of all time. I think oh, people, for sure. people hate it so much for pretty much no reason other than like it's a swamp. That's all I ever hear. Yeah. Which I get it. Atmosphere and, is big. That's a big subjective thing. If you don't like the swamp, yeah. you don't like the swamp, but uh, me and Shrek be chilling out here. Last time we did this type of video where we did the starting room challenge, you and I did Blood of the Dead, which is obviously a map that like neither of us are very fond of. But now yeah. we got, I don't know if Shinonuma is your favorite, but it's got to be up there. It's got to be better than yeah, Blood of the my, Dead. It is my favorite, yeah. Yeah, so this like, is a pretty good Dude, pick. I cannot aim with this. I cannot aim with this. What is that? It's going to be all maneuvers. Is that the Gewehr? I don't know. Yeah, it's like, my sensitivity <laughs> is fine when I'm just running around, but when I try to aim in, it just gets super high for no reason. I can't even aim. Oh, fuck. That's a crawler. I almost just died to a crawler. <gasps> <laughs> wow. Okay. All right. Yeah, never underestimate the power of crawlers. Whoever gets the Wonder Waff combined with Jug is like automatic win. <laughs> so, does the Wonder Waff disable Jug on Shino, or is that just a Doris no, thing? No, no. That's only on Doris. Oh, thank God. Thank God. Yeah. You know what? I don't even think I'm going to spin the box. I don't even want to risk it. I think I'm just going to go for, like, the Thompson or something. Yeah, that's why I did. As a Shinonuma fan, what are your thoughts on the Chronicles remaster of it? Did you enjoy it at all? I thought it was just kind of meh. Yeah, I kind of felt that way, too. I don't know how I felt I, about the one. I liked it more than the Blackout. I, I, this might be a hot take or whatever, <laughs> but I did not like the uh, Blackouts 1 remaster. Oh, really? I thought nah. it was decent. I, I, I do think I like the World of War version the most, but... Yeah. Black Ops 1 to me was, I mean, it's basically the same thing in, in a lot of ways, except for you can't really get to around 1,000. Yeah. No, I mean, that's like the only reason I like this map so much. My friend a long time ago, when we were a lot younger, used to flex on me and be like, look, I got to run 100 on Shinonuma. And I was like, <laughs> oh, oh, which version of Shinonuma? Because that, that matters a lot. And he shows yeah. the World of War disc. I was like, oh, yeah, you're a bum. The dog rounds can be tough. I'll give you yeah. that. The, t the yeah, dog, dog rounds, rounds are the only skill part of it. But you can get the trench gun probably for that. Well, the thing is, trench gun's a two hit once you get to later rounds. Oh, we got speed call over here. That's. Okay. Eh. I don't know how I feel about that. You know what I'll I just noticed? On what? PC, 
they have the price on the perk machine, 3,000. Yeah. But on console, they never do that. Well, they, they have it. Uh, I remember I made a video where I was like, it's like worst things about whatever. And I was like, I don't know why they don't have the price like in the, mm -hmm. like as the text, but they do have it in the machine, it turns out. Wow. Okay. This is scary. I'm actually really terrified right now, quite frankly. Uh, yeah. I got the trench gun. Fuck. Fuck. No, no, I'm gonna let you die. <laughs> Don't you dare. Oh. Okay, I, I'm, I'm actually gonna die. I'm actually gonna die. Woo! Woo oh. I'm red, I'm red, oh. I'm red. Okay, oh. Oh. I changed my mind. I'm oh. sorry, Jim. Oh, yeah? Yeah, you come back? Yeah. No. No. They're so angry. I think they're well, on. Okay, why do I keep missing? Why do I keep missing? Oh, we survived it. We survived it. Honestly, <laughs> that is the achievement. That's the highlight of the game so far. Oh, yo, missed up. Okay. Oh, okay. quick revive. That's totally useless, actually, in this challenge, especially. Oh. There is, like, an infamous insta-kill round, right? On World of War, yeah. where the engine yeah. sort of just cracks, and then there's, like, insta-kills. What round is that? 208. 208. God damn. And how frequently, yeah. do they, uh, how frequently does that happen? Half and half. Wow. So, so every other round? No, no, it's kind of weird. So it's like random-ish. So it's it could be two rounds in a row. Mm -hmm. It could be one round, then the next round not. But it can never be three rounds in a row. Oh, okay. Like vice, vice versa. So it can never be not insta-kill round two uh, three rounds in a row. It can never be an insta-kill round three rounds in a row. So it's just unpredictable? Kinda, yeah. Come on, come on, Jug. I can't, I, I can't, oh! Oh, I shouldn't have done, oh. Oh, we got Jug. We got Jug okay, where, in where the... Okay. Oh boy, I don't even know what this place is called. I think it's the Doctor's, doctor's quarters. quarters. You're doing this too? You're over <laughs> here too? <laughs> and there's the comm room. I'm just coming over here to distract you. Okay. Take okay. your mind Take your mind off things. <laughs> oh, actually, I'm going to go get Speed Cola pretty soon. That's what uh, I was over I, here I feel for. like you're going to... I feel like you're just going to naturally I die from natural causes, so I'm going to try to get away from you. Natural causes? <laughs> <laughs> I'm too old. I can't continue. I feel like it'd be kind of like super weird, super cheap and unfair if I just kept hanging the box with the wonder off. So I'll at least try to get speed cool at first. Hey, you do you, man. This is a one v one. But you know, yeah. I, I I appreciate mean, the courtesy. But uh. Yeah. No. Hey, I've well, I've never lost. So I mean, I think it'd be interesting to put myself at a disadvantage. When you say you never lost, does that mean you've done many one v ones, or are you just have you never done a one v one? Never done a one v one. Doug and speed cool are the only things that are useful in yeah. this. Yeah. Double taps like, eh. Depends on the weapon you have. Yo, I got the Panzer Shrek. Should I just off myself with it right now? <gasps> dog round? Oh. No, 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 no. This is not a good thing to have with a dog round. Not a good thing to have okay. with a dog round. I, I think I'm I think I'm good. But... Oh, bar. Okay. Okay. Like, I, I feel like I've mastered the dog rounds if I have the Wonder Waff. Like, that, that's, good. that's the main challenge. You gotta just practice dogs with Wonder Waff. Mm -hmm. There's so many. Oh my god, I can't aim with this trench gun though. That's why I need the Wonder Waff. Oh, I see that glitch you were talking about when you walk up to them and they kind of like whisper yeah. back. Well, I'm red, I'm red. Oh my, I was red. Oh boy. Gee, I wonder what yeah. this perk will be. I'm gonna go to the car. <laughs> I will take it. Take my money. I want some root beer. Something good, please. I heard I heard that the ray gun or <laughs> no wonder wall oh no you know what I'm talking about that really stinks <laughs> down when you get the yeah. wonder weapons yeah the jigs up I can't hide it he's already on to me I, I I don't I'm gonna let you guess though which one I have I mean you wouldn't be that like secret if it was a ray gun I don't think so it, I feel like it's the wonder wall yep yep <laughs> it's over it's over who no, knows I'm man I can still very easily die. Yeah, you know, yeah. I'm not counting it out yet. Ow. Ow. Yeah. Ow. Yeah, Ow. Gonna... Ow. I, I got stuck to them. I got stuck to them. That's what World of War Zombies do. They, they, they stick to you. I don't know what I'm looking for. Maybe pee, -pee. That'd be good. Oh, I got pee, pee Dude, that's crazy. I literally just walked <laughs> in as soon as you did that. It's so weird how Shinonuma is so bugged, but the other three maps aren't as bugged. At least with the high rounds. Like, how is that? How does that happen? How How is it just... Shinonuma, but not not What do you mean by that exactly? Like the the round cap, is like, is well, there a round cap you, on the others? No, no. Doctor Raton, uh, it's like world records are in the thousands too, but Shinonuma is just like the optimal one because it's the only map with the the, the Wonderwolf. 
Oh. And it has traps. Where Nocturne Totem has doesn't have an infinite damage weapon. Verukta has the traps, but it's harder to stay alive in that map. I'm feeling a dog round. I'm feeling a dog round. Yep, I'm I am too. Ooh, yep, there it is. All I'm right. gonna stay by you. Betty's! Betty's! Everybody get into positions. This is war. How did I miss? Oh, oh yeah, god damn. You just shoot directly at them and they just don't even die. What? Oh, you, how, do you, how do you zap me? The dogs. Alright. Dude, you zapped me somehow. That's what weird. the heck? What the heck? What the heck? Uh, ah! uh, I'm, stuck. Ah! I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. This is not good. Oh, no, no, you're in the way! Oh! What? <laughs> what? I got like. What? Bro, I keep shocking myself. Oh, well, you know what? I'm gonna finish out this yeah. round. I'm gonna revive yeah. you. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be. That's. I'm just gonna revive you. Be respectful. And like, I don't uh, think I was. It's. A, I wasn't red at all. I wasn't in danger. I just downed. Yeah, shit. Yeah. World War is real boogie. <laughs> I was about to say I couldn't even revive you. There we go. All right. Well, here's what we're gonna do, Clayster. Um, we're gonna both hold grenades and we're just gonna off ourselves. All right. Okay. All right. Go out together like like. Bros. Oh, well, I mean, it's a little delayed, but... <laughs> Alright, sick. Good game. Uh, I'm virtually trying to shake your hand, and uh, yeah, I'm I'm proud of you for, for the beating me, I guess. I yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, any final any final statements, sentiments for the children? Uh, Don't do drugs. Yeah, drugs are bad. Hey, guys. We're on Doris, and I am joined with Conjura... Hello! War. Dude, we struggled hardcore. We spent a half hour trying to get this lobby to work perfectly. So if there's a little yeah. bit of, like, internet lag or something like that, I apologize because I had to unplug my Ethernet cable to get this to work for some reason. I don't know why, but it's all chill. We're all here, and we're all queer. Don't listen to that part. I can already feel the pressure on round one. That is the effects of World at War 2. Even lunging, like knifing in this game feels like a genuine fucking risk. If I knife, uh, yep. Yep. Yeah. I already got hit once. It feels like I... <laughs> Be careful now. There's no second takes here. There's I no swear to God, if it ends on round one, it ends on round one. That's how we're doing <laughs> no, this. No, I know you're not bluffing. I might go for the Gewehr, honestly. It might be, like, I just want to be safe. I just, I don't care about yeah. points or progression. It's just safety above all. Safety oh, is oh, key. Oh, shit. Okay, insta-kill. So bad. can we open the entire map? There's no restrictions. No it restrictions okay. whatsoever. We're pretty much working together in some capacity. I mean, we still got to, like, open up the yeah. map and, you know, link the teleporters sure. and shit. But at the same time, it's, like, kind of like, fuck you and I hope you die. You know? But we're working together. Mm. We're working together, though. You know? It's like it's like you love someone, but you want them to just kind of choke up and just yeah. fail in front of you so it's that like, you can look better. It's like yeah. sibling love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's kind of that kind of thing. You hope they die. Uh, Low key. Okay, they die. <laughs> die. <laughs> what is your favorite thing about World of War Zombies then? World of War this Zombies. This game into like this yeah, that this game does that no other zombies iteration offers. What is it about? I just I like the realness and the grittiness of the guns mm. especially. Like shoot everything oh, yeah. every single gun in this game feels real and it feels really just like it just feels like you're firing a real gun whereas games like black ops 3 i love the game but you know it, a lot of the guns feel like toys like the the ppsh yeah. in black ops 3 versus this game the difference is just immeasurable oh, honestly for sure yeah, yeah. what about you I what, mean, do you what do you think what's your favorite part of this game 100 percent the guns it's a heartbreaker the zombies being all glitchy the wonder Wolf being glitchy it's a heartbreaker yeah. but the guns and the and the grittiness and realness of world of war can't be mm -hmm. Match. Why did I volunteer to do World at War? What am I doing with my- Oh sh- My god! Oh, my sensitivity is too high. Every fucking corridor oh. is a fucking issue. M1 Garan! With the nuke dude though. There we go. Ready? Watch out, Conjure. Oh, you killed him. I definitely won't kill myself with this thing. Definitely not. 100% mm. <laughs> not. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we gotta make sure none of them what spawn is... behind us. Oh. Yeah, shit. Oh, fuck me. Oh, no, 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 no. Using a controller feels weird, boy. Yeah, a little bit. There's way more dogs than there are in, like, Black Ops 3, isn't there? Yeah. Oh, thank oh, there we God. Go. We did right. it, Tim. Six, I'm half tempted to jug. buy this electric trap and just call it a day, but you know what? Nah. Fuck at it. No! Damn it! Oh, I trenched him, Tim. Don't worry. He, he got a taste of the old 12-gauge. Uh, it's all good. It's all good. I think I'm hallucinating. I think I just saw my G Fuel can literally just move towards me. 
Maybe it was from vibration or something. I, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, maybe it's the sheer excitement of playing a decent COD Zombies game. No, I kid yeah, you I'll not. Play, like, I feel like I, I've never done acid, but let me tell you, if, if I had, I feel like that's what I'd be <laughs> seeing. That just scared the shit out of me, honestly. Just G Fuel everywhere, moving around you. Jug is a play. That's important, kids. Yes. Yes, Jug is important. It's especially, especially in this game. Oh my god. The bigger the round, the more impressed I will become. You know what I mean? I would love, you know what, Tim? Goals. Let's set goals. Even though we're not allies, I would love to open pack a punch together without going down. Yeah, that'd be I'd, pretty I'd easy, feel... I feel. Very achievable. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I feel like that's an, that's an accomplishment. Hounds chill, hounds chill, hounds chill. There's so many after me. I'm Help shooting. Me. I'm shooting the Thompson. I'm shooting the Thompson. Don't worry. I got you, baby. <laughs> I'm so scared. Um, no! Insta kill is huge. Insta kill is huge. Insta kill is huge. Oh. Let's oh. go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my God. Tim, we're together on this. This is an alliance now. Dude, Hounds genuinely intimidating in this game. Not even gonna lie. Black Ops 3. They're oh my just God. Fucking pathetic. Oh thank God. Yeah. Oh. Whoo! Yeah, baby. Give me that fucking nuke. Oh my God. That was genuine fear. I haven't felt Die! Like, oh my god. Yeah, don't die from the they nuke. Can still hit you. So quickly. Yeah. Oh, they can wow. still hit you with the nuke enabled. I forgot about that. I mean, if we were to hypothetically bet on this, what round do you reckon one of us is going to uh, bite the cake? We're going to kick the can. One of us probably around 20. Round 20. Oh, I like how much you believe in us. Somewhere around there, dude. It's just this, this, like I keep, I'm a broken record. This engine doesn't allow success. You will get sucked into yeah. a horde of zombies at some point. Even if you're just training, and you will die. One of us will. It's true. It's, it's going to happen. It is inevitable. Here's what I'm going to do. Right. I'm going to pack a punch my Type 100 because fuck it, you know? You only live once. You're, 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 you are you are Quite literally. Life. Only Quite one literally life. Quite literally on the edge. So. The 1001 Samurai, I believe, was the name Absolutely. of the Type 100. What would you say was the point in which zombies started to dip? I mean, well, started to lose its charm, I'd say. Probably the we're, obvious we're, answer would be like Voyage of Despair, Black Ops 4, I think would be yeah. the obvious one. But I mean, you can make the argument that it lost its charm after Black Ops 2 even. Some people, not yeah. me, but some people would say that. The way I, the way I talk about this with um with my significant other <laughs> is um you're cheating basically, on me. Basically I didn't know you saw me that way too. All of the Black Ops games that had an even number in the title dipped in zombie policy. That's my opinion. I agree. Well, what yeah. do you consider World of War then? <laughs> World of War? It it's was like, it was the starting ground, you know what I mean? It's like I, zero. I was, yeah. And zero is both odd and even, you see? Because it's a middle ground. There's true. lots of things to love. Lots of things to dislike about it. It's uh. Yes. But I feel like, as you've rightfully said before, most of the things that you dislike about World at War purely revolve around just how dated it is. Oh my god! Not right. like this, not like this, not like this. I have, like, the urge to just help you at every fucking turn, even though I should Yeah! Be. It's kind of like a, a subconscious thing. Maybe, it, maybe you haven't done that with the other YouTubers. Maybe I'm special. You know what? Yeah, I'll maybe. Take that. You know what, though? Like I think what? it's almost as if, like, that's how the game is supposed to be played. Do you ever just sit down and just think that Zombies has literally taken... A life like of its half own. Of our lives. Oh wow, another new. Like literally half of our lives has been playing this game. Obviously not solely, but it's like the fact that we're still playing yeah. a game that ah it's fucking. Yeah, wild that is that is wild to think about actually. Uva, wow. I just realized you're Tonk Dompus, aren't you? Yeah, I'm fucking grimace. Who am I? Oh, I'm right, I'm fucking blue, so I'm Nickel. Oh yeah, d I forgot about that. In World at War, the colors corresponded to the character you were. If you're white on the scoreboard, you're Dempsey. If you're blue, you're Nikolai. If you're green, you're Ritzhoff. That's you're freaking orange, racist. That's freaking racist. Actually, I didn't really correlate that, but yeah, now you mention it. Green Ritzhoff was the Nazi uniform. White was Temp fucking Tank Dempsey, just you know being white. And then you've got Takio being yellow, yellow racist. Yeah, I mean, I didn't say it, you did, but yeah. Uh, and then you've got fucking. I mean, why is Nikolai blue? Who knows? Maybe Vodka. he's got blue balls. Oh, PPSH. Hell yeah. Might just fuck Ooh, around and keep that. It's just beautiful, Tim. It's beautiful. Oh, that's a good gun. I'm going to want that. I'm going to want that. I'm going to want that. What gun is it? Oh, it's the FG42. I made a mistake. Ah, uh, what uh, do you think it was? MG42. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Tim, not to discredit you. In any oh! Way, look very different. I just picked up the MG42 as soon as uh, I said that. Fuck Hell yeah. Unbelievable. Oh, God. The fucking super glue on these Monkey boys. Monkey for you. What? He's still helping me? 
What? I just want you to remember that though. If I die first, I'm out on the Thompson. Oh, oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty low too. I got like nothing left. Oh hi, hi, Jesus. Oh no. Hello. All right. Teleport, teleport. Teleporting. All right, let's go. Max ammo. Oh, I've been stunned. Nothing. Oh, thank you, Samantha. Go fuck yourself. No. Fucking headless zombie cunt. I gotta trade out my PPSH or something because I got no ammo. Actually, I, I mean, I could keep setting traps, but I'm not gonna get a drop with a trap. So. Tim, I'm nervous, oh, Tim. Hold me. Boy, what do I do in this situation? I don't want to trade out my PPSH. Oh my god, this PPSH. is... Oh, oh, no! I got no monkeys. Ah! Oh, um, I'm caught, I'm caught. Oh, I'm fucked. Drop down, drop down, drop down. Oh my god. How am I alive? Teleporter, teleporter. teleporter. Telep yes! Oh my god! Oh. How do oh, dude! That was incredible. I had to fucking drop down the Please, uh, Max. The dog hatch. Ammo. Max and fuck. Oh, I, I, ha I have two Bettys. I have two Bettys. That's sick. All right. The fact that we reconvene like that. Ah. Oh, that was just a beautiful moment, Tim. That's going to touch my heart, I think for eternity, Tim. Wow. You know what time it is. Wow. Uh, yep. All right. How about you this time? Uh, you have the money, bro. <laughs> I don't know. Do I, I feel like teleporting? I don't think nukes actually spawn follow-up drops in this game. I oh, hate to tell you. That's bad. Oh, 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 they don't? They don't? Oh, they don't? Because check that out. Oh. oh. Well, you know what, Tim? I was wrong about something. Enjoy. <laughs> I honestly feel like the second we get pushed far, far enough back here, it's over. So I'm just going to hang by this window. And if I got to go, then your boy's leaving. Oh, no. There's so many quarters obstructing oh. that pathway now. Oh, oh, that's double gonna points. Fucking... Wanna go risk your life for the double points, Kajura? I actually kind of need that. I can actually feel the sweat on my fucking controller at this point. This is getting unreal, cunt. <laughs> no! Oh, no! Shit. It happened! <laughs> it fucking happened hey, on the staircase! 20, 26 rounds? Hey, like... Oh, no. That's some impressive shit. That's a, if, even if I downed, I would still consider this like a double W yeah. for, uh, for both of us. Double dub. Uh, but you lost, so uh, fuck you. You just want to commit seppuku together? You just want to hold grenades and yes. just kill ourselves? Okay. Yes. All, All right. right, commit seppuku. Three. <laughs> it's been an honor. Wait, 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 wait. I, I didn't mean to toss that. Oh, there we go. All right, here we go. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, shit. Hi. Oh, there we go. Thank you, Kajora, for joining me. Do you have any final statements? Uh, it was my pleasure. Remaster World at War, but please fix the fucking knife and mechanics. We are joined with Chopper. We've made it to Black Ops 1 in one piece, sort of, and... Uh, we're playing Kino. <laughs> Kino to toe in. We're here on we the We're back classic. to the basics, baby. Yeah, we're back to, to step one in this whole... I'm actually really excited for Kino because it's really going to put an emphasis on the 1v1 because, you know, it's not going to suffocate us like uh, a lot of the other harder maps. Right, so yeah. So this will be like... Four. Yeah, this is kind of a... Uh, it's, it's kind of playing the long game here. You got to see who's got more yeah. endurance. I have like this gift to make zombies, which is a cooperative mode. A, a, a challenge. I have this gift to make. I have a gift of pitting everybody against each other in a, in a cooperative <laughs> game mode. With be, between this and Last Man Standing wins. I just that's just that's what I do, man. I tear people apart. That's what I do. We'd love to see it, Chopper. I have a deal for you. You wouldn't believe. Yo. You want to open up the 750 Yo. door? I'll open up the thousand door. <laughs> All right. So we got to negotiate this, pal. Let's see here. <laughs> All right. So I'll Actually, make you a deal, dude. You know what? I have less points, so I'll op I'll open this up. <laughs> okay. 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 Um, we do in math. So I, I passed yeah, the yeah, fifth yeah, grade. Yeah, I see. I see. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy this door here. Yeah. Because that All should right. still give me enough for that old yes. MP40. Yes. I was thinking yeah, about maybe getting the M14, like I do in a lot of other maps. But hey, you know what? MP40, even <laughs> better. Even better. Yeah, MP40's goaded. Oh god, I have a sneeze coming on. Oh, uh, <laughs> it's not coming out though. God, this is the worst feeling in the world. <laughs> oh, it went away. God damn it! Now there's just gonna be like this. This, uh, this, this sneeze gonna, within me all day, run, festering. Dude, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's just gonna, it's gonna slowly pile up inside me all day, and then it's gonna come out, and I'm gonna break my, I'm gonna break my back when I sneeze later. <laughs> dude, that's the weird thing, is, like, if I'm just, if I'm just, like, in my room or watching TV or something, like, I, if, if I get a sneeze coming on, it usually happens. If I'm streaming, I never sneeze. It's really weird. <laughs> the like, concentration. I, I don't. I genuinely don't think I've ever sneezed on stream. I could be no. wrong. Someone might dig through clips and find it, but yeah, some, I really don't think somebody I've dig ever up done it. somebody dig up a clip of Chopper with a big old sneeze on stream. <laughs> it's the most obscure thing in the whole world. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Oh, I'll, man, I'll pay. But... I'll pay you five bucks. Send me a clip on Twitter. You gotta love how on Black Ops One Solo, 
your POV can be customized, but on co-op, you literally can't customize your POV. It's stuck on console POV. Wait, is that is that actually on BO1 thing? only? I think, which is what so bizarre. I don't understand it. That's like, really weird. Like, I actually, it, I didn't know that. I don't know why I just spun the box. Uh, I could have saved What'd up for get, Jug. Dude? I got the law. <laughs> Yo, let's go, dude. What is up with me and getting this piece of garbage gun every time I play this game? I it's could have saved come up down for Jug. To in this one, like, who gets the thunder gun first? Oh. I was kind of, like, I was thinking about this the other day. I don't know if I told <laughs> you about this, but, like, it's it's really weird to see at the end of every Treyarch game or, like, DLC 4 is usually the blueprints for the next game and how those maps are going to play. So, like, mm -hmm. Moon is basically a BO2 map, in my opinion, in terms of its, like, functionality. Uh, Origins is essentially a BO3 map or mm -hmm. the beginnings of it, and then Revelations is really a BO4 map, but Kino is a map that's like stuck in the past, and that, like, like and I mean that technically. Map. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, um, it was supposed to be. It was supposed to be a World of yeah. War map. Right, and you can and you can just kind of see it's like Kino is a BO1 map, but doesn't really play like one in a lot of ways. I wish they had Flopper right, on this epic. map. That'd be sick. Oh, can you, dude? You just have to, oh, dude. All you have to do is get this ladder down from Flop this area. PhD's up there. Yeah. Oh really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hidden so you, you got to claim up this ladder. It's right above on this balcony. Oh. Eh. <laughs> I miss eh. the days in zombies where, like, little theories like that people actually believed. Yeah, like, I one time I believed that these zombies in these buckets are were aliens. That was something I believed. <laughs> like, the real ya uh, aliens or whatever. And well, isn't that actually what it is? I, I you know, or, like, I, there's... I feel like I it's know, a I feel like it's a 50 50 that, shot. I feel like it could yeah. either be zombies or the aliens who actually know. Trapper, I feel like I feel like you're too good at zombies. I feel like we're gonna be here for a while. <laughs> I feel like you're a lot I feel like you're better than a lot of people I've played with, to be to be quite honest. <laughs> well we'll we'll see what happens in this game. I, I will say I'm I'm prepared for the long haul. <laughs> um we'll we'll see. We'll see though. Yeah. And, and that's the thing about being one man, one little slip up and that's I mean that's at that, least yeah. a down. You know? Nothing's guaranteed. Life is not guaranteed, guys. Live it to the fullest. It's true. Both in and out of game. That is that is words of the wise right there from my boy Tim Hansen. Uh, one day you'll be here, one day you won't be. So That just got really deep for no reason. This is peak zombies. Hmm. Yes. I would say Black Ops 1 is my favorite game. I don't think it's perfect, is it? but what is perfect? Yeah. And also, you don't want a perfect zombies game. Yeah. yeah. You, you don't. Black Ops 3 is solid. I, w I would say it's probably, objectively speaking, the most sound Zombies game, just because of the engine. The engine is, is like, next to... But then again, like, you know, the engine in Black Ops 3 is years and years more advanced than this game, so... As yeah. far, all things considered, I would say for its time, Black Ops 1, I, I, I don't see anything wrong with it, other than the gun variety. I think a lot of the guns are doo-doo, but then, like, beyond that, I think it's perfect. Well, I think the... I was gonna say I agree with you. I think the problem with the BO3 guns is that uh, they they lost the hierarchy of weapons. Like BO1 has has good and bad box weapons. BO3 has all good weapons. At least decent. The, yeah. Yeah. The the worst guns are still usable. So like, mm -hmm. I don't know. Kind of lost that that hierarchy there. So that means like if you pull a good gun, it doesn't feel as satisfying. Oh. Um. Oh. No way, dude. Oh. All right, Tim Privilege. I just came. That's it. Oh. I'm head out. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh Damn boy! Well, All right, I yeah. Lost. Now you know why. Tim, now you know why people say Tim Privilege. This is exactly wow, I, why. So now you're on board with it. <laughs> Buy the merch. I have lost to the game, lads. This is so sad. <laughs> and I got a teddy bear. All right. So Tim Privilege is truly a thing. <laughs> it's uh. It's you heard it here first. Time, Tim Privilege exists, and it's very real. Where does Kino to Toe in rank in your Black Ops One ranking? What do you think? Like bottom and upper? As far as just Bo One. Yeah. Um. Let me think. Because you didn't have it's, a ton probably, of options when you picked this map, but no, you did have you did yeah. have some. So uh, I was wondering, do you, are you a huge fan of this map? Like a lot of people are, because I feel like this map um, is. No, it's. Uh, I'd say Kino is very middle of the pack for me. I really like. I like it, but it's like, mm. and I and I understand why it, it's a beloved map, but it's not one of like it's not one of my favorite maps. But it's like it's perfect for what we're doing as for like a challenge like this. You know what I mean? It's like, mm -hmm. yeah. It's, yeah, I think it's, it's a little overrated, I would say. It's it's a Kino's very moldable map and you can play it in a variety of ways. That's kind of why I wanted to play this one. 
You know what? I was not a big fan of the remaster in Chronicles of Black uh, or uh, of of Kino, to be honest. It, I, really? It, it wasn't because of the gameplay. It was because of the way the map looked. I thought they took really what made Kino special, which was like the greediness and the dirtiness and the and the the creepy environment. I thought they took that away and just made it. I mean, the walls are like gold, and like a lot of the map did. I don't know. They took away the, the spooky. A lot of that's, that's fair, man. Sometimes zombies maps are almost scarier because their graphics are worse. Yep. And so, yeah, I, I don't know. I kind of agree with you there. I mean, Kino looks kind of like it's visually pretty on the new Chronicles version, but mm -hmm. I don't know. Yeah, this one has a certain atmosphere for yes. sure. Plus, it was my first map, so nostalgia. Yeah. Monkey, <laughs> monkey, monkey. Mon oh, monkey, monkey. Yes, lad. Let's watch all the explode. Let's watch the fireworks. Fourth of July, baby. Pow, 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 pow. Holy shit! Then would you like to go with me to pack a punch? Yeah, sure. All right, let's go, dude. I know this is a, a competition, but this is mutually beneficial. Mm, and will be agree. mutually beneficial for the competition between us. Yeah, I should have pack a punched my spaz, actually, before I did the Thunder Gun, but that's okay. The Crawler Nova Crawlers are just... Boy. Why? <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. yeah. You know I what I heard? Them. I don't know I if this everything is... about them. <laughs> you know what I heard? I don't even know if this is true. I heard that the Nova Crawlers are actually pigs. Ew, what? They were they're pigs that got turned into zombies, like like uh, mutated through the Nova gas. I don't actually think they're people. They look a lot more like people than pigs, but pigs and yeah. people are actually pretty close uh, in in the animal kingdom. That may not be correct, but I think that's true. We we, we got to get a storyline expert on this one. <laughs> I, yeah, I heard that from an Australian man at a convenience store one day. Every zombies YouTuber that is British instantly sounds like they have more credibility than they do. <laughs> Why is that actually true? It's the truest shit ever. You hear a British guy on YouTube talking, especially in the gaming community, you're like, he knows what he's talking about. He instantly about. gets more clout. Yeah, it's weird. How us with our, like, boring-ass, plain-ass voices. Are, we're at yeah. a disadvantage. That's what we're at. I think so too, man. To be fair, Taking I've talked to some British people that actually prefer, like, American accents, whatever that means. Oh, but yeah. the thing is, as well, is just like British accents, there's different American dialects. Yeah, yeah, I was about to say, what you know is what an mean? American accent? There are like like almost hundreds of different well, granted they're not all uh very different from each other but there's a lot of different uh dialects here in the states yeah like each, and, and that's even, interesting because yeah. and even within states because my state yeah it, depending on where you are there's like so i'm in ohio and there's either really southern accents there's like some some more like northern where yeah. you know a lot of canadians go and then there's like there's like the the mid like the Midwestern Ohio, where it's kind of like a neutral accent, I feel like. Even the variations of accents within my own family are really weird. Yeah, states themselves can have upwards of like a dozen different accents, especially the bigger ones. I live mm -hmm. in Massachusetts, and I sound like a typical Northeastern person, but a lot of people in my state have that typical Boston accent. We're like, ah, pack the keys in the, in the fucking cabin yet. They all sound like that. And I'm not too close to Boston. Like I'm, I'm like an hour, I'm like an hour out from Boston. So I'm not too close to that. But the fact that somebody a half hour away from me can sound like that is, is crazy. It's wild, man. Isn't yeah. It? It's wild. That's the thing is like, I think a lot of what's influenced my accent is like literally the people I interact with on YouTube because it's like, I think a lot of that is influenced by your environment. So let's say you let's say you go to work every day and you are around the people that have, you know, a super thick southern accent, for example. You're yeah. going to, you know, pick up on those dialects. But if you're around people with a hundred thousand different accents every day, <laughs> they kind of all just blends into one thing and you end yeah. up getting just so, like some neutral gray in the middle where it's like really no accent at all. But yeah, yeah, I feel so it's a weird thing, man. It's weird how people can just have different accents. It's it's so weird how you how quickly you can pick up a different accent too without even realizing yeah. it, just by living in a different place for a while. Mm -hmm. And yeah, like a lot of that as well is like depending on your age when you go to that place. If you're really young, you're gonna pick it up super quick. Oh yeah, like I have family that lives in Minnesota, which is basically southern Canada, and I go there <laughs> once a year because I have family there and. I was there for a week, possibly two, and I, I did not start to sound like I was from that area necessarily, but I had like certain words that would, I'd be like, oh my god, did I really just, I, like one time, <laughs> one time, I didn't, like, I, I, I call it soda where I live, it's soda, but they call it yeah, pop, yeah. they call it pop, and I ended up, mm -hmm. I, I said, can I get some pop, and I, I, I instantly, <laughs> I went, I went, what the fuck, man, why do I sound like this, <laughs> I, I've been here for a week, Jesus Christ.
Yeah. Dude, yeah, a lot of people call it pop here as well. But, yeah. And, and people and people look at me weird when I call it soda. And I'm like, what? <laughs> it's soda, bitch. No, yeah. and then um, I was out on the farm and I was shooting guns. Um, and I ended up hitting one of my targets. And this is what I said out loud. I go, ooh, I got that one over there. And I, and I was like, oh my god, this is not how I sound. I started getting freaked out at myself. I'm like, Tim, stop <laughs> assimilating to this stupid way. No, it's not a stupid way of talking. But like, I was, so freaking my, I was freaking myself out. I was like converting after a week of being there. Converting. Just a week. I mean, that's Bro, how all my yeah, family sounds up there. They're all like, hey, you want to pass me the pup? I'm from I'm basically and, southern Canada, eh? And then when I went to Alabama, God, that was like, <laughs> I spent any more time there, dude. JC lived in Alabama, right? He lives in Texas now, though. Uh, actually, as of right now, my man is living out his California dream. He is moving to LA. I've been to LA, of course, for like a zombie event or two. And I liked LA, but I did not love LA. I think as far as cities go, I'm sorry for all you LA fans out there. I thought it was overrated. I thought the air tasted good like to death. Visit. I would not want to live there no, at all. Fuck no. There's so many pretentious people in LA. I'm gonna die, Chopper, with the thunder gun. Oh, oh! oh. I got caught the spam's up. In crossbow. The... <laughs> oh my god. How did that even? I got caught up with. Oh no, dude. <laughs> I had my fucking Spaz 12 out. I didn't even have my thunder gun out. Why was I? I got so interested in this conversation, I totally lost sight of what was going on. All right, shit. Oh my god. Hey, that That's just goes so to show. That just goes to show how distracted you can get when you talk about. Dude, that was my plan. Accents. I had to get you. I, we had to get so deep in conversation that we just got distracted. I get that, that worked. Was the only way it was it worked, win. dude. I, w I wasn't even holding my thunder gun. I was holding my Spaz 12. Stupid <laughs> as fuck. All right, well, congratulations, Chopper. You have won. Uh, what I'm gonna do is uh, hold a grenade out, and we can both just kill ourselves because the game is over. There it is. And uh, all right. Yeet. That I'm was. A, I'm gonna uh, eat myself as well. And yeet. There it is. So, I, I definitely Jeez. had the upper hand. I definitely had the advantage there. But what ended up happening was my brain stopped. It stopped. <laughs> it was elsewhere. <laughs> if my brain was there, I think it would have been different. Chapa, any final words for the kiddos? Honestly, you lads. To, you don't have to have final words. I just ask because sometimes people have final words. Like, you know, don't do drugs. Stay in school. Mow the lawn. Mm, my, my final words. Honestly, lads, I'm going to say this. I'm going to say this, and I really want you to, to think about this, what this means. Mm. Aim high. Aim high for yourself. That's what I'm going to say. I couldn't agree more. Welcome to 5, the challenge on top of a challenge. I'm joined with that guy who camps, one of the OGs in the zombies community, and we actually have tried this a couple times. We had some technical difficulties, but then again, in pretty much all of these, I've had one technical difficulty in, in some <laughs> way, shape, or form. Anyways, uh, 5, let's do it. Hopefully I'm JFK. So the connection isn't perfect for him, and I just want everybody to know that, regardless of what happens. Um, and it's, it's not perfect for me either, but... Um, uh, and neither one of us have audio, too. That's another thing. The Pentagon Thief is another thing I'm looking forward to. Really yeah. looking forward to that. <laughs> I was actually upset that they didn't have me classified. I know. Uh, like, I, I objectively speaking, I think classified is the best map in Black Ops 4. Like, it just feels the most like an OG zombie map. Um, mm -hmm. But it still doesn't feel much like zombies in general, you know? Yeah, I think classified is a very good map. I do think I personally like 9 and Ancient Evil a bit more. Mm -hmm. But yeah. that is a valid argument. I think Classified is probably the one map that people just go to play for fun, I think, in yeah. that game. Yeah, like, if I ever play with randoms, it would probably be on that map, and that's about it. And, you know, I, I just hope they've learned from their mistakes for Black Ops 5, and they're ready to go. And, you know, like... <laughs> it, we hope! Treyarch, yeah, no, you know, Treyarch, they have a history of making bangers, right? You know, World at War, yeah. BO1, BO2, BO3. BO4 was the only bad apple of the bunch, so... You know, the odds of them making another quote-unquote good game are pretty good. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, everybody has a shit day, right? Everybody. Right. And yeah. for a long time, Treyarch never had a shit day, which is really impressive, too, you know? I'm checking my back fiercely. Got you, bro. MPL. Yeah. No, I, I feel pretty warmed up now, actually. This is my third game of Zombies on 360 in many years, so... Uh, <laughs> in many enough. years. That's crazy. You went to GameStop to go pick that up pretty recently, right? Uh, no, I actually went to an off-brand place called Game Trader. Uh, the, uh, <laughs> the, all GameStops are closed because of COVID right now, so you gotta adapt. And, you know, I went oh downtown, stuck in traffic for two hours, but, you know, sometimes you gotta risk it. For two hours to go get a 360 at a knockoff GameStop. 
<laughs> what a series hey, of unfortunate events. You know, they were friendly and supporting my local business, so yeah. not all bad. Dude, GameStop is going out of business slowly but surely. I oh, mean, it, everything's it's been moving that to the way digital for the space. Past 10 years. Yeah, I mean, were you young enough to like go to you know GameStop midnight launches for like Modern Warfare and Black Ops? I didn't go to the midnight launches, but yeah, I I I went to GameStop pretty frequently for all consoles. Yeah. It was mm -hmm. the Wii, it was the 360. Yeah. It was the GameCube even. Oh hell yeah, dude! It does, dude. We we had such a great like set of consoles growing up you know what i mean yeah like for real dude and, and games were simpler back then but they were also better i feel like yeah although i really like the nintendo switch i think the switch every yeah. console they come i don't i didn't understand the the wii u but mm -hmm. generally yeah. everything nintendo comes out with is pretty oh, yeah. good I, I mean the wii u was like kind of like the virtual boy where it was unpopular but it still had bangers you know mario kart 8 um Smash Bros, and I, I think there was a Zelda game or two. I don't remember, but um, yeah, even the 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 off-brand offshoot still did well too. And yeah, the Switch is insane, man. It, they they combine like the Nintendo DS and the Nintendo Wii into one thing, right? Mm. Kind of where you, you can like have it on the go, but it's still like a, a high you know resolution console and stuff. I hope the guy who designed the Nintendo Switch is on an island somewhere enjoying his life because he deserves it. Oh God, dude. Did what? you see that? Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> like, hung himself, dude. Holy shit. Oh, I have no ammo. Okay, okay. Uh-uh. Grenades. Get my strength on, dude. I'm actually scared right now. It's alright. We got nades out. Oh, no. Pentagon thief. Oh, brother. Oh, boy. Right, I don't know. Are we, are we gonna work together? I think we, we can. Have we have to. Alright, alright. Oh, he's coming for me first. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna let him take my MP5. Just take it, sir. Oh, we gotta kill him. I want that. I want that yeah. fire sale more than anything. I want that fire sale more than anything. Definitely, definitely. Okay, here we go. We, we got this. We'll loop him, bro. Oh my god. My A! Okay. Oh, he's Gotta gone. Yeah, he's he's full sending. This is actually way harder without audio, dude. Yeah, no kidding. I don't know where he is. Oh, he's he's around here somewhere. Yeah, yeah. you know, he, I just... I'll, I'll take the L here. He clapped me. I'll admit it. I don't even know... <laughs> I'm doing 10 damage to him with my Colt. Like, this is nothing, dude. God. Yep. He, uh, he successfully took our guns. Pro gamers on the scene. That's fine. I'm just gonna go grab Jug and drink away my sorrows. The thing is, if you train down in the basement, you get Novas. But if you don't, then you yes. don't. So that, that's the I, uh, good part about it. You, you've played a lot of modded zombies in your day. I, I don't know about you, but I enjoy multiple enemy types. I think it just adds a lot to the experience. Yeah, Novas are a pain in the ass, though. Cause they, I mean, they, but... The, yeah. Mm -hmm. I, yeah, I, I like the duality of it. I also just don't appreciate having to, to shoot at a completely different direction. Like, I have to, I have to I, face down yes. to shoot them. That like, annoys the it, fuck out of me. Yeah, if they were at the same, like, hide his regular zombies, it'd be a different story. Whoever made Double Tap 2.0 should also be sitting on some island, just uh, <laughs> sipping away his life. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to keep spinning the box until I get yeah. the Winter's Howl. Dude, I, I feel like I need to yoink it from you. Uh, there's so many ways to play. Do you get God perks? Do you prioritize guns? I don't know. I'm not. I, it's just, it's really speed, coal, and jug. That's all we really need right now. No, nah, really you'll kick. We're, <gasps> we're in this for the long haul, dude. I got an itch where I can't necessarily itch right now. Ow. Oh God. Ow. Okay, I'm good. I think I'm good. Bro, this is fucking scary. You have no zombies. I, oh me? my God. Yes, I literally have them all. I think there's no a... universe where you have more than like two. I have I have like three or four. Hold me, bro. Holy shit. Die, die. Oh god. Every bullet counts. That's the other thing. Every bullet counts. If I missed any of those bullets I just shot right there, it would have been game over right, for me. Right. I'm dead. No. Dude. Oh no. Oh. Well that's unfortunate. G to the freaking G. G. Yep, for sure, man. Yeah. We could definitely play again one day, uh, not on 5, and with audio. I think both of those things <laughs> would enhance our experience. Anyways, uh, of course, thank you for joining me, and uh, any f final sentiments? Yeah, bro. Just keep fucking killing it, and uh, love zombies. <laughs> we love zombies. All right, on to Ascension. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Ascension. And I'm here with Crazy Rabbit. Yeah. All right, let's just do it. Ascension is his favorite map. Ascension is one of my favorite maps. Black Ops 1 is... We're both... You know what I've noticed about us two? We are BO1 fanboys. Both yes, you and I. Are. 
We're because the goats. Black Ops One is absolutely the most superior game of all time. So oh yeah, there's no need to further elaborate on that. I will Shader one. Diddle anyone that says otherwise. So the objective you. is to not die. I don't care about getting points or anything like that. I'm gonna just grab the M14 and just keep my distance. You feel me? You feel me? Yeah, you stay away from me. You got the cooties. I see you hand holding with girls. That's gay as fuck. <laughs> what round? Because I don't really see either of us dying. What round do we just say truce? Let's we can go back to being homies. I mean, we could do like a final stand sort of thing where it's still kind could of fair. Yeah. Uh, definitely gonna wait till at least round twenty because I if we get to like mid twenties and there's not even like a chance of any of us dying, especially if we have like the thunder gun or the ray gun or whatnot. I think we will have to do something because I this is one of those you. maps where you just have space and you just have dudes. Back when zombies was about having fun. All right, Tim. Oh, punch oh, up! I almost died going? already. By the way, guys, if it sounds like I sound kind of sloppy right now, it's because I just woke up not even like 20 minutes ago and I just walked straight to my PC and just this is what I'm doing now in the morning. So that's, <laughs> yeah, that's what's happening. Be, man. That's my excuse. Yeah, you got. You I, think I woke up like five minutes before you uh, texted me. <laughs> Dude, we're on that YouTube grind. We wake up and we shit, eat, and sleep YouTube. I actually am going to get the Mustang and Sally. I hadn't even thought of that until I saw you do it the other time. So okay, that's what here's I'm the thing. Doing. I already traded my 1911 because I completely fucking forgot about that. Cause uh -huh. that's a thing. Awesome. Fuck me, dude. Will you quit being. And open a fucking door. Hey, I've opened up. Oh well, you nothing. Know. You've opened up nothing. Okay, we as a collective whole have only opened up one door so far. We're not even teammates. I don't have to help you at all, but I will out of the goodness of my heart anyways. Because... Hey, until we get Pack-A-Punch, we're basically in this together. Yeah, pretty much, honestly. It's like high school musical. Can we take this and can we hold hands? Uh, yeah. <laughs> you didn't even need to ask. Are you going to oh, take okay, it without me? No, I'm not. Oh, oh, okay, I'm good. Yeah, because I don't want to fucking spend the money. <laughs> <laughs> you're a bitch. <laughs> I was gonna take it without your butt. You're the one with all the money. In every single recording throughout this entire video, I'm gonna be very cordial with everybody and just be really polite and just be like, "Hey, you know, how are you? Well, uh, let's let's talk about this map." And then with us, it's just like, you know, yeah, it gets dirty with me. This is the way it is. You're doing good over there, bud. Though you're doing good. It's the mystical dildo. I'm gonna. Oh, Oh, I was about to grab ammo right now, and then that happened, so You're I just welcome. walked over here for nothing, but thank you. Is there a god rabbit? No. No? Not even, like a, not even like a funny one? Like a god of, like, <laughs> dirt or something? Not even a funny one? <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, like polytheism, like believing in multiple gods. Like the god of love, the god of walls, the god of Jolly Ranchers. Dude, there's a god of love. He's singing me finger my fucking ass like ten times. <laughs> Okay, well, I have Jug now, so there's probably going to be some space monkeys inbound. Everybody get ready. Brace your assholes. Three, two, one. Poo. Into the stars to buy candy. Can <laughs> or buy can I don't remember. Do you have any perks, by the way? No. No? I don't need perks. You're right. No, no, no. You don't need perks. Keep telling yourself that. I don't. I'm going to fucking win it without perks. You're just executing all of them up there. Oh, my God. Oh, I got stamina up. What'd you get? Uh, that game is Speed Cora. One thing I want to start one day, I want to, like, invest in something or create it myself. I want to make lyrics for white people. I want to make, like, a website or an app or something that translates regular rap lyrics into standard English language. That's hilarious, and you should totally do that. I actually think that would be super successful. Like, like oddly successful. Like, I, I, oh my god, I didn't have enough of that door. You better cut this out of the video or else someone's going to steal it. Like, I don't even know about, where to begin like, with fucking that. whores. And you're like, well, in this lyric, he was talking about his financial struggle paying his taxes. <laughs> Tax evasion is very prevalent in this area, especially amongst the wealthy, you see. All right, we're pretty close here. And pull oh, oh, shit. Are that you just, on it? No, almost, dude. Almost. I almost <laughs> you're just got coming kidnapped. over here with me. I almost just got abducted. There would have been an Amber Alert on my ass. I'm going to tickle you. Come here. If you were a Pokemon trainer, which Pokemon would you fuck? I thought you were about to say which one would you choose to have as your buddy Pokemon. Oh, that's stupid. Um, jeez, you really flipped the script there. I'm gonna go answer my own question. Which one would I want as my buddy Pokemon? Not yours. You're not yours. Whatever you answer, I'm gonna take it as the one you're gonna fuck. Okay, then I'm not so answering. Doesn't matter. Nope. Because <laughs> if your answer's not Gardevoir, I know yours. Then... It's Vulpix. No, I'd I'd have that one, but I'd fuck Gardevoir. No, 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 Rabbit, I died. 
Rabbit, I died. I win! That I was easy. Wow. I got stuck on this pipe, Rabbit. Ow. I'm not gonna lie, I tried to call the lander in to pick you up to come bring you over to me. Okay, I had several flaws with this. Number one, I kept the M14 until round 12. Yeah, I don't know why you did that. It's because I was trying to save up to pack a punch my pistol and then get Flopper and then have Mustang and Sally, but I waited too long. I wasn't Let's meant go. to win on Ascension against you. If I was trying to come somebody get else, if I was facing somebody else on Ascension, I could have had a chance, but you not against you. So, nope. uh, congratulations, though. I, I, I fucked up big time, and for that, you are the winner. So, you can do whatever you want. Commit seppuku. As long as you don't continue surviving. Just kill yourself in any way possible. Honestly, what? in a way, though, I'm a little bit oh, relieved. God. Because now I don't have to edit an hour of <laughs> Ascension footage. I am going to take my loss like a man. Uh, any final words for the fellas? Would you, what would you like to say? Uh, even though Kim Jong-un is alive, I'm still simping for his really hot sister. <laughs> Wait, he's alive. I didn't mean to fucking... <laughs> he's alive, m'lady. He's alive. I mean, even if he's not, I'd still have sex with his hot sister. Oh, same. Right. She could put me in a concentration camp all she fucking wants. We are on Call of the Dead now, and I am joined with MJPW Gaming. This is actually the first recording it's not the first map chronologically but it's the first recording so that's good news this is <laughs> this is mj he's uh he's a custom mapper he's been very helpful he's made the last man standing maps which of course are i did outstanding I did? and he and i are going to do our own little last man standing whoever downs first gets the cone of shame i don't know there's no punishment we just uh whoever downs first loses that's how this works it's a regular game of call of dead though otherwise i mean we can kind of work together in some uh capacity i would imagine but for the most part it's whoever dies first loses that's how this works so pretty much whoever gets stuck with the vr11 here we are oh boy hey the icebergs aren't black because i'm not on uh xbox i'm on pc i'm usually very clumsy on solo but for this like mm. stakes are high they're not really that high but they're high. They're really, really high. Where's the box? Okay, the box is in a semi-decent spot. I'm going to actually do oh, us yeah. both a favor and open up that kayak for us. Oh, and okay. I'll grab the trusty MPL for now, actually. I think that's a money move. I got to be careful. I'm over here knifing the zombies. No one... There's a two-hit down on this map. Ah, uh, it's a risky business. <laughs> How do you feel about Call of the Dead in general without, like, the actors uh, coming into play? What do you think about the map it's um, itself? I love the map, honestly. Same. Um, but... Well, I mean, there's no but. Call of the Dead is absolutely the best Black Ops 1 map. That's my opinion. And I think <laughs> in my, like, again, subjective, I think it's like a top 10 or a top 15. I think it's great. Oh. I think it's super unique. I think that's what separates it from everything else. It's not great mm -hmm. for high rounds, but, you know, not everything oh, yeah. is about high. I mean, the game is survive as long as you can, but, you know, I think there's a lot more that goes into it than just that. Yeah. Call of the Dead hits it out of the park, baby. Oh, Georgie. <laughs> George is cock blocking the whole entrance. <laughs> Are you stuck down there? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. So that means I might get to hit the box. First. I wonder if it's a good idea to stick together or to separate. I mean, um, we could try to like, we could try to do like a like, a like a like a Black Ops Two grief sort of thing and like stick together and try to dick each other over, or we could just totally separate and just hope the other one goes down. Here's an inside scoop. I was originally planning for this. Oh, oh no. shit! Oh shit! Anyways, I'll, I'll I'll finish my uh I'll finish what I basically I was planning on doing a speed run instead of doing a one v one. I was thinking of like uh basically pairing up with with each person on every map, except uh like whoever gets to the highest round in ten minutes wins or whatever. I was thinking about doing that, mm -hmm. but I figured that'd be kind of like a starting room challenge, uh basically. But anyways, um I won because I'm amazing and superior, <laughs> and you suck ass. No, I'm just kidding, John. <laughs> No, I yeah, said it's funny to say, oh, this is my favorite map. This is my number one map. Oh, I'm down at round four. <laughs> it's all right, dude. Black Ops one is unforgiving, though. It's the it's the game. It's not really Call of the Dead. Anyways, um, GG, I suppose. I didn't expect this to end. The box this really. you get first. Yeah, let me just spin the box. Go. Yeah, the game totally if you get the didn't MPL, end. If I get the scavenger, we continue. Here. Okay, fair deal. If I get the scavenger, we continue this. <laughs> Oh my god, oh, I almost got the VR11. That's a scavenger. Wanna just commit uh, suicide together here? Let's do it in the... You know what? I never go to this let's part. Let's do it on... Now. Let's okay. do it over here next to the Let's do it on George. <laughs> as a t well, that's, a, that's a better idea. You just hit the... You just... You you understand. Alright. Let's do it together. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh, oh, he's pissed off. 
Okay. Now he's just gonna run in the same spot. All right. Forever. That was <laughs> that was quick. That was that way was, too short. If you have any final like sentiments uh, for the people, you can surely uh, you know, you got a new map coming up, or you got anything coming up? I do. Yes. Um, Plug it up. It's the third chapter to my labyrinth series. Mm -hmm. It's my big series I've been working on for like six years now within the custom maps. Yes, yes. Love it dearly. The map is a dead mall. A it's dead. a mall. Empty mall. And it's got so much packed into it already and so much going into it. And you are actually going to be in this map. Yes. Yes. Absolutely, <laughs> dude. And I played the first Labyrinth map, there. and it was really good. I really enjoyed it. I'm joined with MC Sports Hawk, the man, the myth legend. Oh, we're playing Shangri-La, and this is this is pretty challenging. Um, We'll see how this goes. Hopefully, we get more than five minutes of footage. Ish, get I'm sweating my ass off already. I'm so nervous. Hey, five hey, man, minutes. hey, man. Hey, man. It's gotta okay. Put, gotta it's gotta put okay. Put the timer on real quick. Bro, just grab... All right, my advice to you is grab the M14. Uh, just shoot. Don't even knife. Don't even bother knifing because you might get windmilled. So just just stay a distance. Shoot with the M14. Uh, like, I don't know. Go grab, like, the MPL or something after that. Just, like, constantly upgrade your weapons. Keep a distance. Jug obviously wasn't hurt. Uh, pack a punch is just, like, a big if. I'm going to go against my word and just yeah, knife them on round one anyways, even though I said keep moving. that was a bad keep idea. Keep moving. Keep moving. You're making me nervous now. You, your nervousness is making Dude, me nervous. Dude, I you don't even know. I was I already am nervous. Out. It's all right. I, Round one successfully especially down. Especially because I want this to last at least a little bit. Yeah. That's what I say every time in bed too. We're gonna play this like kind of like we're playing together a little bit in a way. Yeah, I'm not gonna dick you over. Yo, so Matt, are we are we on Mars or or are we in the Himalayas? Hey man, I never got I never got involved in that argument. Yeah, me neither. I didn't want to. I didn't want to. I don't want to get involved now. When I I didn't really care where it is. It's a good map. Yeah. It's pretty. I'm not a conspiracy theorist. I don't care enough. Although it definitely is not on Mars, by the way, for anyone who actually believes that shit. Let's go this way. Yeet. Which way you like? You like this way? Yeah. Ooh. I fancy this way okay. more. All right. Okay. Oh man, you've already put me in a bind here. So maybe we can get like the I don't know. The PM63 is Ooh, like a really shitty gun, but it might be. I don't know. It might be worthwhile for now. Ah, do I grab it? Fuck it, PM63. Damn. I don't even stress out that much when I play this map, like, when I'm not thinking about the 1v1 oh, dude, part of it. I am stressing so hard. It's the 1v1 part of this that's making me stress out for no reason, because it's, like, my video, too, and I'm the one freaking <laughs> out. It's like, yeah. The fuck? What am I doing to myself? Dude, you... I haven't played this game in, like, a year. I just started oh, yeah. playing again recently. Yeah. Uh, you're good. Don't worry. Hey, you, Matt, you want to play a fun game of oh, zombies? I guess it is probably worse for you, because if you lose... Man, that's... That's just Holy unfortunate. Oh, that, yeah, it would suck. But we did get to round five, so that's good. We, we passed we did, round four. We did. That's, which was I'm, the cursed I'm happy round. about that. Yeah. Uh, round four is the cursed round of the series. Have we hit five minutes? I don't know. Um, I think we have. Maybe. Yeah, probably. Something like that. So, what do you think about grabbing? You want to grab the PM63 and join the PM63 gang? or? Uh, <laughs> do I want to? Probably not, honestly. I wouldn't make the same uh, mistake. Uh, where's the box? I don't even, it's down there. Okay, it says it always start down there in this game. It probably does. I'm going to buy it. I'm going to buy it solely because I'm going to do exactly the opposite of what I usually do, and I usually wouldn't buy it. So. Oh, Shrieker. Shrieker. It's pi it's dead oh, now. Oh, good. I'm glad you took care of that for us. That's a bold move there. I think oh, we man. should definitely pin down Jug. That's our next objective. I think I have a decent enough gun to get to that point, if we get to that point. So let's traverse... You think you have a good enough one? I got. I, I definitely have a better gun than you, and I. I am bugging. <laughs> I need that. Oh, look at man. that! No, you may have just saved me already, dude. <laughs> you actually may have saved me already. Oh, oh. Okay. This is the problem with this gun is it's too it's too slow to run with. Yeah, I got a door for you to open if you'd like. <laughs> then we can get power on. We can get power on right now, actually, and then uh, Jug is not too far away. It isn't. It isn't. We're, we're pretty... I mean, we're doing decent. Flip that. Flip that. Look at that. Teamwork. I've never been this nervous to play zombies because it's always been a cooperative game mode. <laughs> and you have turned it to something different. <laughs> and I am just... Oh, man. It just puts the, the fear of losing in my mind. Uh, napalm zombie. Sure. All right, Matt. Open up the door. Open up the door. <laughs> do it for oh. us. Okay, I'll do it for us. I'll do it for us. Sick. Okay. All right. Uh, grenades going it. out. We cannot get near that napalm. He will insta down us without joke. I need ammo. I'm gonna go buy some PM63 ammo. Damn. <laughs> hey.
Hey, man. Damn, I'm better than this. <laughs> The oh, spikes shit. got me. Well, GG, I would kill myself as tradition. The tradition is to kill ourselves, uh, but I don't have a grenade, so I'll just let the zombies just end me. All right. End me. There we go. All right. Good good game, Matt. That was pretty solid. Honest, honestly, all things no, considered. It wasn't. You I don't, don't have to lie to yourself. But I don't know how many people, like, everybody would be nervous on Shangri La. This is not an easy map yeah, at but, all. Uh, we were doing fine. We were doing fine. It's all good. It ends that quickly. That really is. I had enough for Jug, too. Mm -hmm. That's the worst part. We have <laughs> the Moon Master here, codenamed Pizza, and the, yes. you, believe it or not, you were the first person to respond to me and pick a map. So you were the very first pick, and you picked Moon for Could good you reason. Imagine? Yeah, Moon. Uh, <laughs> and surprisingly, yeah. I had a bunch of other people following up that wanted Moon as well, and I was like, "Nope, Pizza took it. Pizza took it." Really? Um, Who else picked Moon? Do you well, remember? Zwenek, my buddy Zwenek wanted Moon, and he was actually okay. the second person to respond. So, <laughs> the first two people oh. to respond to me both wanted Moon, which was mind blowing to me. I was like, "Damn, really? Moon this popular?" Anyways, <laughs> you ready? I am so ready. I this am is so scared, but I am very ready. With the amount that I played Moon, I will be slightly embarrassed if I lose this, and I pro I think I probably will. But let's see how it goes. <laughs> mm. I'm. A are you a bigger fan of Black Ops One or Black Ops Three, Moon? Black Ops Three looks prettier, but Bo One mm. kind of has that nostalgic feeling. Yeah, for me. yeah. I like the way Bo One feels more, but uh, undeniably, Bo Three just looks infinitely better this map agreed, is just agreed. oh god the way that it looks this map is could have could have been biodome just looks so nice on bo3 see what we get here so we nice. got speed okay so there's no reason to stay here for jug anyways Ooh, I don't definitely not i don't think i'm gonna risk my life for some speed cola okay maybe i'll play a little bit tactically and just wait until the alarms go off we'll see we'll see what happens here i don't know oh i'm deciding what i'm gonna do yet I'm not going to risk it. I, I'm going to get over here by the pad. I am not going. Okay. No worries. <laughs> we'll see how this Shit. goes. I need to remember that it is a two hit down though. Okay. 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 To be fair, we do have the word together here because we hmm. both need to be on the teleport as we get going. Yeah. Okay. I was about to say. <laughs> yeah, dude. I'll get Sick. on. All right. The squad. <laughs> PS required. We got past area 51. That is objective number one complete. In the Step books. One complete. There so, it is. Uh, there yeah, it is. that's good. If the, if Jug was there, I, I would have thought about maybe staying, but speak all yeah. out a chance. Not a chance. For sure. How interesting is it that you can actually get a pack a punch weapon before round one though? That is. Like, that's, yeah. That's, you get Jug, kind of Mustang, and Sally. Oop. Who do we got here? We got O Gonzalez. Zero Gonzalez. <laughs> oh no. Hmm. Oh no. That man's deadly. You don't go near him. Oh 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 oh! I just got flung into the barrier. That could have been no. bad. <laughs> No! I, I wow, I almost already died! I almost already died! Imagine Black Ops 1 zombies. Man. Black Ops 1 zombies. This anti-gravity is going to make things challenging. That wow, two-hit so. system as well. Is it a good or a bad idea to keep Gonzalez alive? Do they actually increase health over time during the rounds? No. Or? No. No. So if you save one, another one can't spawn in, and it keeps the same health. So it's oh. like one shot. Yeah, so you want to keep them alive then. Okay, that makes... Pretty much, yeah. Unless you have perks you really want, and then they can take him away. Turn on the power. And the box is not here, which means... Wait, this is like the map where if the box isn't there, it's like the furthest away. Did you play Moon when it first released? I did not. I don't no. think. I think I joined and I started playing Kino as my first map, but I think that was after Moon had released. Because that's okay. when Kino, Kino had Mule Kick when I started playing. So yeah. that to me means Moon had already been out. So I joined yeah. in late Black Ops 1. But my first map was Kino. So that's how that went down. What about you? When did when did you start? I, right at the start, baby. Not during Totem. Oh, wow. Yeah. yeah. yeah um, a wild, wild time. Yeah, my friend, he, he beat the campaign. And we were just talking on Xbox Live chat. And he was like, holy crap, dude. Do I just unlock this Nazi zombie game mode? And... Uh, and then he invited me to it, and I was just hooked, and I couldn't stop playing. Do I buy the stakeout? I buy the stakeout. I'd rather have protection over points. Yeah, the stakeout's great. I love the stakeout in this yeah, game. Yeah, until about round 10. <laughs> and then we get oh, max ammo. Now we get a max ammo. <laughs> I don't think I want to grab the hacker and take the time to do that. Uh, you can if you want. I I'm like, I'm not trying to st like a hack a door open and then just get mauled from behind. <laughs> There's no way the door hack takes like 30 to a minute. I think. I think a minute to open a door. Yeah, so, no uh, chance. I'm, good. I'm not risking my life with that. I'd rather just pay the full fine. I don't know. Should I? Should I? I mean, I'm yeah, at the top of the lever. Oh, no! Oh! 
Oh! Bro, I didn't even hear that one. I didn't even hear that one. He snuck up on me real good. I'll start hacking it. Oh no. Oh no. Well, he dropped down from here, dude. No, 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 you know, I gotta say, uh, teleporting Nova's kind of kind of bad. We got the right excavator as well. We could technically do the Easter egg. Ooh, <laughs> yeah, let's give it a shot. Let's let's give it a shot. You want to open this door? Or I'm gonna, the, okay, yeah, sure, I'll do that. Oh, there it is. Okay, at least we get to hit the bugs. Okay. Have you got? Oh, no. I, oh, I thought I you didn't have a helmet. Then. I put the hacker away for now. We can go. Okay, uh, good. We could just let Excavator okay. Six go. Honestly, this is actually the scariest shit in the world. This is so so oh. scary. It's so many. <laughs> God damn it. This is not healthy. No. No. Oh, 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 oh. Man, I'm just waiting until I see that revive symbol pop up. Uh. Run. Run. No. Oh, the, oh, the anti gravity. Dude, the the anti gravity. Oh, my God. The anti gravity. I'm throwing grenades. I'm not risking nothing no more. Just uh, pop off. The pop clutches off. are real today, dude. RBK? I mean, that's solid. Ooh, it's, it's not bad. Could be worse. It could be worse. That's actually a really good pull. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. No! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh dude, damn. Was, I was stuck in the doorway. <laughs> hey, GG, though. You know what? This is this is a bitch map. This is a bitch map sometimes, you know? Sometimes you this don't. map is kind to you, and most of the time it's, it's not, actually. Um, it's, it's I'm a, about to die too. Oh my god, I was about to revive you and just kill ourselves together with grenades <laughs> as tradition, oh no. but I just died there too. Okay, um, wow, that, that could have gone a number of ways. If we managed, if one of us pulled like the wave guns or something like that, we have the whole biodome at our disposal, that could have lasted forever. That could have lasted like hour, two hours, but... Pfft. Oh yeah, oh yeah, but oh then god. I run through a doorway at the start of the round. <laughs> <laughs> not, not clever. Not clever. <laughs> All right. Thank you for joining me. Any final words for the kids? Uh, ha, stay safe. Here we are on transit with The Smith Plays, The Lad oh, Salad. Oh. The Lad Salad. And I don't know why. Well, I do know why you chose transit for your uh, for your <laughs> series. But, but at the same time, man, transit. This is going to be interesting. I don't know how we're going to drum up the courage or the strength to live past round five on this map. But... We have no other choice. Let's do it, baby. Best loading screen of all time, though. Oh. I, I love it. I honestly love it. Oh, that's God. That's God knocking on our door. Okay, Pat, we gotta really make... Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Okay, there goes my controller. Okay, I just had a seizure right there. <laughs> we kind of have to work together in some ways. <laughs> I could just keep this part, and then you gotta buy the door. Yeah, you could do that. You know what? I'm not messing around. I'm buying the M14. Like, I seriously don't even want to risk anything. Yeah, do I buy the Olympia? Yeah, let's see. Olympia, 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 Olympia gang Olympia versus gang. Uh, versus M14 gang. East Coast versus West Coast. We su successfully survived past round one. Nice. We got a ladder too. Just All right. For... Well, I'm proud of myself. Yep. That's a We're step. At Olympia gang today. One doing small the, doing leap the proud. for uh, for mankind or whatever the saying is. <laughs> round two is round two is big for this gang. So, what part are you looking most forward to? The fog or the denizens or the lava or the pack a punch or the jack gun? Oh, pack a punch is my favorite. Yeah. Like there's really no consistency better to it. feature. Yeah. Oh no, man. I said there's no better feature. <laughs> it's just a very complicated, oh. complex, stimulating uh, process. Yeah. You really only have a 50/50 shot when you place down that turbine. It's just the most discouraging thing ever when you go <laughs> all the way to town and it's just no bueno. It's just not a good time. Yeah. Dude, I did it Pat. Today, actually. I remember your rant about this map in your top fives, and I used that in my. In Dude, my and I, analysis. And I was going through all your map analysis videos, listening to the one by one, and then you open with that in transit. I was like, hey, what's up? It's me. What if we have perma perks? Perma perks. I very well may have perma jug. Right now, you do? I don't know. Yeah, who knows? <laughs> That's the thing is I don't I don't want to try and yeah, see. You, you don't want to figure that out. <laughs> Patty, you coming with us all aboard? Hey, <laughs> I was about to like I was about to stand in the doorway. I was like, nah. Man, he's got he's got some nice shorts. Wow. Who, me? You, yeah. Am I Stoolinger? Yeah, they're like they're like thigh high. <laughs> I never realized that. I'm thinking Galvies maybe, depending on what part we get. I don't know Ooh. if I should spin the box or not. It's always like a 
I always wa okay, we didn't get that part. We got the we got the train part. When you're playing a normal game of zombies, you never really pay attention to to downing. But now that we can't down, it's it feels like you're a lot more prone to it for some reason. Yeah, yeah, I agree. That's one of the biggest problems with BO4 is that um, you spawn in the game with 200 HP. You don't have to worry about that shit. Right now, we feel yeah. so vulnerable. We feel so... Yeah, I don't like it. Yeah. I like the progression. We feel so vulnerable without Jug. I kind of want to spin the box, low-key. Maybe get EMPs. That'd be a cool thing to get. Don't do it. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Let me in! Let All right. me in! Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! Yes! Hey, oh, Pat. No. Oh no. Is that, <laughs> is that a Mark II? Oh my god. Now I can't down. I can't lose now. If I lose, I'm a disgrace to the zombies community. Oh no. Alright. Well, I have nothing to lose now. This is great. Dude, no yeah, pressure. Pack a punch is going to be a doozy. I kind of want to. I want to strive for that, Pat. I kind of want to get pack a punch. You want to pack. I want to make sure that's like the one thing we get to. You know, we might be able to do it on our first run around if we get lucky. Maybe. Let's I see. attempted it this morning and. It didn't. It didn't work. What does Ted stand for? Aren't there two D's with Ted too? Like T E D D. There are. What does that yeah. stand for? Uh, telecommunications enterprise dr drug dealer. I, drug dealer. Yeah. Telekinetic he's enterprise <laughs> drug dealer. That's what he is. Did you know that he is in COD Mobile and he's like a full, a full-bodied Ted? What? Yeah, dude. It's terrifying. It's like. This kind of suit, but it's just a, a full person. That sounds absolutely terrifying. Those in the audience should know that the only other map Pat and I have ever played together is five. So, <laughs> the track record there, five and transit, those are the maps yeah. we have played together. We haven't played... We only play good a, maps. Yeah, we only play masterpieces <laughs> out here, S-tiers. Yeah, I love that everyone grabbed, like, Black Ops 3 for this, and I was like, Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll do transit. Build them power. Don't let me die. I got you. I got you covered, buddy. Don't watch your back. Don't watch your back. Let me put this here. Stay. You stay. Stay on. Hey, look, it's Avocado. He's going to be a great challenge for later on, if we get to later on. Yeah, I don't... Whoa, I don't want to... After you, Tim. Okay, all right, all right. <laughs> ah! Oh, God. You can do it. Yay! I'll buy the door for us. Tour. Yeah, I wasn't gonna open it. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Good guy, Tim. They really out here don't not even having a single gun on town. Yeah. Can you believe that shit? Oh. Uh, I'm assuming no bank. Oh. Oh no. Oh, I hadn't really thought about that. I'm not gonna pull any money out of the bank. I don't think I have any on PC, anyways. So. Um. I think. Yeah, I, I won't. I, I'm definitely like maxed, but. There. Okay, the moment of truth. All right, we have just a minute of time here. Oh, it's open. Sick. Wow. Sick. Wow, we did it. We actually did it. Wow. All right, well, let's quickly do this. We are. Yeah, yeah, we do not piece. have. It is very easy to get trapped down here. What if we die at the exact same time? It's gonna be uh. That'd be kind of cool. Actually. I mean, I, I don't really care who wins or loses, but that'd be pretty interesting. Uh, let me grab. Oh, do you have the other I piece? Yeah, I got it, last one. All right, I can cover you if you'd like. Oh, there goes Ted. Who cares? There it is. <laughs> you gonna you gonna go get that bus or? Oh no, I'm chilling. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, I'm out! Four, I'm out! M14 gang, what happened to M14 gang? That's, I ran out of ammo. Oh, oh, sick! It's an honor, Pat, to play this map with you in particular Aww. because of that rant you went on. Coming in at number one on our top five worst zombie maps of all time, we have. Transit. Transit is by far the worst zombies map of all time. You start on this little bus depot and everything is just shitty. Shitty colors, shitty atmosphere, shitty characters, shitty everything. The bus is supposed to be the best time ever. Salvation. You're gonna get your jug, gonna get everything, it's gonna be great. It's gonna be your home. Well, guess what? Sorry, the only gun on here is a freaking B23R that isn't much good after round seven. So you better go to the diner and get a gun from the mystery box. Well, sorry, Buttercup, but you're not gonna be here very long because the bus is gonna leave. So you only got pretty much one roll at the box. All right, well then, let's head on to the farm. What's here? Oh, nothing. Sorry, this is a waste of space. We didn't know what to put here, but we wanted to have a big map, so we just put it in here anyway. All right, power center, we're here. You got a 50-50 shot of the bus not leaving on you and getting the power on. If the bus does leave, guess what? You got to walk through the fog, and you know what's in the fog? 
denizens, motherfucker. You are at the town. You are ready to do this. You got your jug. You're awesome. This place is your salvation. You're here. You're happy. Sorry, we don't have any guns. Yeah, it's the town. I know you think we'd have a lot of guns, but no, we don't. Uh, we have Pack-A-Punch. You want a Pack-A-Punch? All right, bud. Here's what you got to do. Head back to the bus depot. Get a turbine. Now you're going to want to head back over to the power center. Turn it on. Put it by the door. And that may turn on the power door to the Pack-A-Punch. But you only got a 50-50 shot, so, I mean, good luck. If that doesn't work, you're gonna have to go do that all again with dealing with the denizens. So have a good time with all that. This is transit, motherfucker. Younger Pat was... Ruthless! A a yeah, Ruthless! Like, what, man. Wow. There was some anger brewing underneath <laughs> there. I love it. Like, it's cool going back there, because I'm like... Like, I can, I can appreciate those old videos still. It's just kind of nice. Yeah, how crazy is it to think that YouTubers have as much influence as they actually have? as to the general opinion of maps like if you make yeah. one like if a big youtuber decides they don't like a map they can make a video dismantling it and the rest of the community will hate it forever isn't that yeah. crazy to think about that's like i because people love transit until a few people started making videos on yeah like, hey, this map is trash a couple of people were like hey transit sucks ass and then everyone was like oh you're right and then everyone hates <laughs> transit forever yeah everyone's like de is the best map ever and everyone's like is the best map ever <laughs> it's like hip it's like hypnotism i really like perma perks i i hope they do something with that yeah they had a couple in, of cool uh, ones future zombies. yeah like uh tombstone phd mm -hmm. uh dead shot they had like... the teddy bear one the only problem with perma perks is it's not entirely clear how you get some of them or when you're gonna get them or how to do it exactly like people have yeah. a general idea but it's really not a guarantee, it seems. Oh, wait, God, dude, I think we have Avogadro here. Yup, he's here, he's pissed! Ooh. He's pissed! Good thing our guns do nothing to him. I'm gonna come down here, Pat, and, and talk with him. I think he wants to talk with us. Oh, oh. I don't think he wants to talk. I don't, do, I don't but, know uh, how I feel about this boss, man. I don't like him! He's a dick! Yeah. I got him alone. Gang up on him. Let's gang up on him. I love how he makes actual zombie noises, too. Oh! Did we get him? Yeah. Hell yeah! Yeah! No, we wait. We didn't. No, no, no. We did not. We did not. Yeah. What's up? Not so tough now, are you? Jesus ya? Christ! Oh, is that it? Oh, yeah. thank God. Nice. Sick. All right. Well, time to get on the bus while we have that chance. Isn't it crazy how Treyarch thought that this would actually be like a safe haven? This little bus here. They're yeah. like, they're like, this is the place to be, and it's like the place <laughs> that everyone doesn't want to be it's like you will die if you stay on here <laughs> you have no chance just so you know hey did you get the ray gun yes oh sick so now this is a mark one versus mark two you know, it would be really cool as if one day they got bored and decided to go back into the black ops 2 files and add a bus route b to transit that would be cool i would i would love that seriously if they give up on call of duty one day and they're just kind of like bored. They should just do that. Pat, no, the no, bus no. is leaving. You're going to be no, late to no, school. No. You're going to be no, late to no, school, no. Pat. Pat, you're going to be late to school. No! <laughs> oh, yeah. He just, yeah. I've never gone to Nocturne Tone or the cabin ever playing this map. Ever. Never. Ever, never, wow. ever. I've just never seen... I'm just, I guess I've never seen the point of doing it. Because I don't go for the jet gun, personally. I know some people say it's like technically a good wonder weapon. Because it has infinite damage. But like... It, I just, I never go for it, because it's just, like, the biggest piece of shit, and it, like, breaks, and... Yeah, I, did, I hate, I hate that, those, those technical people. It's yeah. Like, it's not good, it's not good, no. It's just not practical. Like, theoretically, yeah. like, theoretically, yeah. it's good, but, like, it's just not, <laughs> like, at Yeah, it's all. like, okay, for 1% of people, it's good. Yeah. And even then, it's like, it's only good as long as you're perfect at training. Yeah. And you have hours like, of free time. At a round like this, it wouldn't be good. Oh, hey, Pat, how are you? I didn't even know you were here. You ran for it. I didn't know you oh, ran for it. Oh, I ran for it. I made it. You did not want to be at farm, did you? <laughs> no. Do you ever um, build, like, the turret or the electric trap or any parts on this map? I mean, sometimes no. I go for the shield, but that's kind of rare. Yeah, yeah. Shield is, shield is actually good. It's just, like, do you really want to trade the turbine for it? Yeah, that's a thing. But like like the, defense or open anything yeah, on the map. The electric trap and the turret, I'd never go for, though. No. I think they should have done two buildables. We've been playing transit for a half hour and haven't died yet. Neither of us have even downed. Wow. I am impressed. 
It's either I feel like we're focusing too much or not enough, or it's what something. I don't know. Something's up. It's like voodoo we're magic. Doing something wrong. Now this will be interesting. Are we safe in here? No. Uh, I mean, Pat, tell me we're entrances. tell there's me we're safe in here. I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of here. Pat, you can come with. You could stay. Up to you. I gotta make my way out of here. Oh, I'm getting oh, fucked no. in the oh, face. No. I'm gonna go pack a punch and see if I live doing that. <laughs> Odds that that's open. Oh, that it's is, like, fucking closed yeah. again. Yeah. Oh, no. No. Well, we're not pack a right. bunching again. A lot of zombies coming through. So, yeah, that is. That is the cabin. What the heck? I don't know. You could go behind the cabin. Wait, you're behind oh, the cabin. No. Oh, no. Wait, you're behind the cabin? Yes. You're not in town anymore? <laughs> no. I was just going to grab something. A jet gun piece? No, I went back for the Bowie knife. Or did I go back for the super secret part at the cabin? I went back for the origin staff piece. The origin staff piece? Yeah. What? Yeah, dude, it's a little Easter egg. I'll, you're lying. <laughs> if you uh, go behind the cabin, no. Knife, knife three times and uh, do a 360. Yeah, the origin staff will spawn. All right, Pat, I'm going to show you how to get the ray gun automatically every single first spin. <laughs> All right, here's what I'm going to do. This oh, way, okay, yeah, follow it. you got to follow the code of conduct. You stand right next to this mattress, turn around, you toss a nade at the box, toss another nade at the box for good measure, do a 360 while that's happening, and then you dolphin dive towards it, give it a nice little kiss, then jump into lava because this is fake and it's not, oh, my God, I actually just almost died right there. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I, was, I just I got gonna red screen. Gonna be it. Climb up. Climb up. Climb up. Climb up. The fuck? No! <laughs> no! No! We died at the same. What? I mean, technically, you died first, but like, I died a millisecond <laughs> after you. What the wow. fuck? I was trying wow. to climb up the ladder. I was trying to get up there, and the zombies were all caught. How? Why were the zombies climbing up the ladder before so I was? I I ran into you to try to climb it up myself, oh but my. then I think because you were climbing up, I fell down and then I died. <laughs> no. Oh, that was great. That was, that, was just, that was perfect. Perfect. That yeah. was that was like the best way to die. Oh my god. Yeah. All right. And I had 420 kills. So Jesus, that's epic. All right, Pat. Do you have any like final <laughs> statements? Just any like wholesome uh, sentiments you want to give to the people? Give everyone like a couple seconds to speak at the end of the video, just like a. Um, <laughs> subscribe to no. Pat. Subscribe yeah, to Pat subscribe and to don't play transit unless you have yeah. people with you because that's it. Yeah, playing solo is miserable. Just subscribe to me. I saw Mr. Jafool in a coffee off guard for a second. <laughs> I was like, whoa. All right, hey guys, uh, we are on Nuke Town now with Mr. Dalek JD, and this is our first time speaking together, let alone playing together. This is a very small, confined map, and I'm excited. For the epic I am, survival. Let's do it. I'm even more excited than you are. I have never been more excited to play Nuketown in my life. <laughs> Me neither, honestly. I can't think of a time. I mean, it's 1v1, baby. Some, one of Ooh. us is going home. One of us is continuing on, even though that's not how it works at all. It's just... <laughs> yeah, even, even still, one of us is going home. And I'm telling you now, boys... It's not me. Lovely little throwback here, playing some Black Ops 2. Yeah, absolutely. I had a massive struggle getting the Black Ops 2 servers to work because everything on PC from World of War to Black Ops 2 was just AIDS trying to get into a lobby with, mm. with me with me in particular for some reason. So uh, we're on Xbox, actually. We tried doing it on PC, but it's whatever. It just feels more throwback mm -hmm. playing it on content. So you just got the look, you got the feels, you got the controller. Oh, yeah, brother. I'm not trying to make excuses, but the, the 360 controller just feels so alien in my hands now. Oh, really? I'm using the one at the moment. Oh, lucky. My one's not working, so I'm going OG. And I get aim assist in this. Yes. See, on PC, you don't get aim assist, so I get to I get to sleaze my way to the top. Where does Nuketown rank for you in your giant list of oh, man. maps? How do you, how do you feel the about giant, this map? The giant tier list that's getting memed on. Mm -hmm. um, I think I put Nuketown like... In the middle, because it's 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 mm -hmm. a good map for survival, especially for like this. If you want that old school, yep, 
zombies gameplay delivered straight to you like the og days then this is like as good as it gets mm -hmm. but there's just not much to it and i guess people rate a lot of zombies maps nowadays based on like the, you know the easter egg and storyline and all that sort of stuff that comes into play as well yeah. as gameplay that's really the so tricky it's, it's part tough. that's the tricky part is uh how you rank your maps because it, it really depends on what you value like if you value just simplicity and survival like this is a great map and then you know if you're someone that values lore and story and and like a lot of stuff to do then obviously this map is not for you it really just depends on what you value as a player and I don't, sometimes i don't even know what i value like i i like maps like this but i also like maps like shadows i died no way god four, baby Let's god go. damn it god damn it okay uh oh my gosh i am gonna he's out of stinker uh, I'm going to politely request that you revive me so I can kill myself with a grenade. You know what? I'm going to finish the round out. Okay. Congratulations. If I can finish the round out. <laughs> I didn't even finish it. Wow. Okay. We, I mean, wow. I died first, but we both died on round four, which is kind of like, wow. Good I got God. one more kill than Tim. So oh my God. I'm calling that a, a universal dub to, to Mr. Dalek JD for this one, boys. Damn, I was hoping to get more out of that, but five minutes works. That was a very brief game. Uh, <laughs> that was so short. I yeah. didn't expect it to be that short. Dalek, anything you want to say? Any sentiments or morals for the kids? Any plugs? Whatever it is that you want. The floor is yours. Um, Play zombies and get past round four because it's a very exciting game. Ladies and gentlemen, we are joined with the Johnny J25 on Die Rise. Has it been remastered yet? No. No, it hasn't, and it shouldn't. One part is like stuck in the ground. Yeah, I don't fuck with parts in this map. I'm gonna go in the elevator. I don't think I can go by myself. I think I need. Oh, we have to go I, I need a chaperone. Oh, I was gonna build a trample steam real fast. Oh boy, I don't want to get surrounded. Pro, only pro die rise players know what I'm doing right now. I think I know what you're doing. It's something that's a sin in my book, and it's enjoying die rise. You can play die rise in a bunch of different ways. You can camp. You can uh, you can camp. You can train. You can cry. I like how it like it forces you to adapt to the map. I guess what it really all comes down to ultimately is of course the verticality of it. And if you're not a fan of the verticality of it, you just really can't be a fan of Die Rise. I think that's where that line is, and I'm one of those people that just is granted not great at traversing it, but I just I'm not a fan of the verticality. Uh and who's who actually not even that bad of a perk. But I no. just think it was ruined by being placed in this map. It's a little glitchy, um, especially because like there's so many places you could fall off. Like I've seen people just teleport out of the map, but like in theory, great idea. I don't fuck with knifing zombies anymore. I'll just throw grenades. I have no grenades. I have, and I don't have money for an AK-74U. I'm also <laughs> stuck on the bottom wow. floor. That's the problem. Oh. This game is definitely ending at round four. I think you might be right. I need a gun. Is there any gun on this entire floor? Yeah, Not there's an AK on that floor. No, but there's an AK. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh boy, man. I just. God damn it! I have nothing. I have nothing. This is bad. Bad. Do you have any uh, 1911 ammo? No. Ooh, I think I got this one. Though. It's actually pretty chill right now. Is I don't see many zombies. Oh yeah, it's real chill. Really, really, really vibing out right now. I'm fucked. Oh, this is it. Oh, okay. John, good game. Uh, I'm gonna die anyways. Um, I, what I try to do is I try to revive. I try to have us both up and then just suicide each other at the same time with our knees. I am gonna die before that happens, though. I'm coming to get you. I'm coming to get. Oh, 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 oh. They're all around me. We had a, we had a good run. They're rounds. waiting for me. Yeah, this is Die Rise. You know what? Fuck it. I'm flopping out of the elevator. Yeet! Yeah. <laughs> all right. Hey, congrats uh, on me, I suppose. Uh, good game, Tim. Good game. I needed it. That was a lot faster than I was expecting. Oh, really? I wasn't expecting this to actually last that long because... I mean, let's be quite frank. 
This is die rise. I mean, if I had just remembered to buy a gun, we wouldn't have been in that situation. Yeah, I mean, I had no, I had nothing to my name. That was, hey, but you know what? I appreciate you coming on, John. That was pretty quick. I mean, but a lot of them were. Thank you for joining us, John. Uh, any final words, I suppose? We're, we're at the end uh, already. Damn, that was quick. Remaster die rise. <laughs> remaster die rise. You heard it here. Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, I am joined with Greg FPS. And we are actually going to not only do the 1v1, but we're going to get through the Easter egg and do the 1v1 on the bridge. All right? That's how we're going to do this. This is this is the epic twist on the best map of all time. You ready, Greg? I'm ready. Hell Let's yeah. do it. Let's just get the double points round one. I don't usually do it. Mm -hmm. And then we'll we'll feed the dog over there in the cell block. I like this. Round. I like this. We're working together right now, even though ultimately we will be enemies. I was about to ask you how quarantine is going, but we live, we live so close together. I was about to ask you, hey, how is it where you live? But... <laughs> Man, yeah, we do we not live that far away from each other. We need to meet up at some point. Yeah, we must be like a half hour away or something like that. Yeah, probably. I mean, I won't say... I, I won't give out my town in this video. I don't want to dox us both. Yeah, I'm saying... Honest to God, Greg, this is going to blow your absolute mind right now. As big of a Mob of the Dead fan as I am, I have never done the Easter egg. And that's only because oh, I no. have not found a proper crew to do it with. <laughs> seriously that's literally the only reason it's so easy dude yeah it is i know it's i believe me joke. yeah is it even it's possible a, to do on solo uh yeah you can't do the last step but like you can do it two three or four players oh shit <laughs> oh that's sick all right we got the uh we got an insta kill uh so we, hopefully we can get a double we're literally on round three and it's still like super difficult I need to get out of here. I need to get out of here. I'm gonna leave you over there just to, so I'm, we're not like cluster fucking each other. You can have some yeah, space. Yeah, There's a lot of zombies here. I downed. <laughs> it's all good. Dude, it's so, there's so many. You know that you can jump and shock the thing, right? Without opening it. Wait, really? Uh, this, this thing over here, if you come here and just jump up and shock the box, it opens it. And then if you don't open the front door, like, you can just grab it right away. You should see the inside fence yep. open. There it goes. Yep. Oh, so that means... Okay, I get it. So it's basically just, like, a shortcut so that you don't have to go and, like, we don't have to do it together. It's just, like... Yeah, We exactly. can just grab it. Oh, that makes things yep. slightly more convenient. All right, I got all yeah. these uh, generators on as well. I just got to haul ass. Oh, boy. I hate it when it gets this close. That is something I had actually never thought of. Granted, I don't play this map co-op a ton, but... That's really good. I mean, I play this map too much, so <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of expected that I know a little bit too much. We probably should get the same weapons as well, so it's like a fair fight at the end. Mm -hmm. Do you want to grab the Uzi or do you want me to grab something else? Um, If that's what you want to go with, we can. You want to go in with the same perks as well? You want to just run in with Jug or... Because I, I mean, it's gonna we're going to have to save up a ton of points to get everything. Well, I mean, we'll probably just get Jug, and then if you want, we can just get two packed Uzis. But we do need to get a free Blunder Gat for the Easter egg. Oh, we can start working on getting those skulls for the for the Blunder Gat. I can get the one up here on the rooftop. Okay. You know that? Actually, don't get it. Don't get it. Don't get it. Don't get it. Okay. I want to show you a shortcut. Oh, I got it. Oh, my God. Yeah, you got it. What the <laughs> hell? I was just so excited for the trailer. Were you just as excited? For, my for Blood or Blood? Oh. I saw Blood of the Dead, and I was like, I was like, damn, this this ought to be, like, the best map of all of them, and it turns out, in my opinion, it was the worst, <laughs> which was just just a punch in the gut. Doesn't make sense, man. I honestly like Voyage more now. I, I play the Voyage Gauntlet. I was grinding Voyage this week for a video, and I gotta say, man, I appreciate Voyage way more than Blood of the Dead, just because Voyage is actually, like, original, and it, I mean, it tried being unique, but Blood, it, it just took what we loved and just... Just took a deuce on it. That's on it, yeah. I don't really know if the Hell's Redeemer is even necessary at all, but I think I'm like pretty close to done with that. If not, okay, done. we can just we can just stay for another round. Oh my God, it's shaking so much. I know, dude. It's crazy. Oh no, Greg. I oh, went no. down. Uh, no. I don't see anything over here, so you should be. All right, okay, I might have you. enough time. Go, 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 Brutus! Don't hit me too hard. Oh! We're gonna wait for the chairs to spawn kill the zombie and then get on the chairs right away this is a skip you can do or if you end the round on the bridge while the numbers are flashing and you are already on the chair it will end the round and then the parts will be able to be grabbed again already 
The other, like, I think it's so cool how they have, like, unique power-ups. That is very cool. It's also really interesting how they give you an audio tour here, basically, and that's what they do on the real Alcatraz. Right. Why am I scared right now? <laughs> oh, it's because I'm about to die. That's why I'm scared. Isn't this so cool? All right, so don't kill me yet, and I won't kill you, but we got to revive ourselves. Okay, okay. And then we'll, we'll kill zombies, but try not to be in the crossfire of okay. each other. Okay. So we'll kill, like, Brutus and stuff. But I'm gonna be attacked and you're not. The 1v1 is about to commence. We have the same setup. We both have the Uncle Gal and we both have double tap and Shug and double jug. tap. And a shield and a Hell's Retriever. This is weird. I have like an in plain sight without actually yeah, having an in plain yeah, sight. Yeah, exactly. So like all the zombies and stuff are on uh, Weasel's side because they're trapped here too. Mm -hmm. Because the other people killed Weasel. I'm gonna start on this side. You start on that okay. side. Ready? All right. How quickly does it take to die? All right. I don't know. Three, two, one, go. Oh. 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 Greg. 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 Yes. Shit. <laughs> God, you took me down so quickly. All right, uh, good game. That was, okay, this was a little interesting. This wasn't like, this wasn't, this was very unique compared to the rest of them we've done so far because like this, we did the whole Easter egg and we did the 1v1. So take that as you will. Take that as you will. That was, that was pretty interesting. That's actually my first time doing the mob Easter egg, which is crazy to say out loud considering I uh, have been a Zombies fan forever. But um, Greg, thank you for uh, walking me through that. I yeah, man, it was a ton of fun. I always love playing this map, so oh, yeah. I'm glad I was able to do it with you for the first time ever. That's yes. kind of cool. I am joined with Wizard101 Pro, which is not a Zombies YouTuber. Um, the name, the real name is Russian. This is Russian. This is Luke. And we are doing Buried, and you chose Buried, and you were one of the first people to pick a map, so this is something you actually wanted. You weren't one of the people that picked last and got stuck with something they didn't want to have. Okay, I wouldn't say I picked this out of choice. <laughs> it was more or less, I didn't want to play World of War. <laughs> okay, yeah. Or it was all taken. You opened up with Noct in the first time we did this with a starting room challenge. Yes, actually. And Starting then I don't have BO1 on PC. Hmm. BO2, I've got the DLCs. BO3, I don't have any of the DLCs. And who the fuck buys BO4 on PC? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So it only made sense. Okay. Fair enough. So uh, I don't know how confident yeah, I feel with cool. Buried. It's a pretty easy map, all things considered. But there's still a two-hit system in Black Ops 2. So we shall see. It. It's one of those maps that could last five minutes or five hours, to be honest. Who doesn't get Perma Jug? What a scrub. Jesus. I don't even know how to... I don't know if there's a surefire way to get perma perks i don't know how to there probably is but i don't even know how to do it you literally just go into a game and down right away oh after like one or two shots you'll actually get it that's not even a joke i really wish i was kidding <laughs> uh how do you get perma phd is that uh you flop over and over <laughs> that's so stupid why is that it's so easy <laughs> Is because BO2. You know there's like 15 perma perks, right? Really? Yeah, there, there's a stupid amount of them, and there's a lot of them that never even got confirmed to actually exist. Oh my god, I'm just flopping around. I'm trying to get this perma PhD. Come on. Nah, man. you have to do it off of like an actually like elevated surface. Oh, that's a boner. What's funny is like you have to do it all the way up here. Like, come over. I'm Tim. I'm teaching you things. Come over. Okay. Here. I don't want to die though, because then it would be yeah. over. Well, it's round two. Anyway, so come up here. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> St stand over here and then flop against the railing here. I, I feel like you're tricking me. No, like that's actually... I'll, I'll do it for you, okay? All right, right, do it. So you flop against the railing. Okay. That's actually the high round strat, like Ooh. for first rooms. You can actually get to round thirty-five in yes. this first room. You're the high. You're the you're the record guy. This is the if you've you've probably seen a video on YouTube of a world record video, and that that is probably this delightful young man in charge of that. Yeah. Video, so bad content. Yeah. Well, you know what? I enjoyed it. So you there. don't even sub to me. Am I not sub to you? Honestly, I don't know. I 
don't ever take that as a slight if any of these YouTubers in this video I'm not subscribed. Like, I'm probably only subscribed to, like, half the people I talk to on YouTube, and that's not, uh, that's not a slight. It's more or less like a, I already talk to you privately, and I already know who you are, so, like, it doesn't matter I if I fucking subscribe to, to you. Subscribe. Yeah, yeah, we're playing Grief, alright? Come on. <laughs> I was gonna get backed up there with nothing. Did you really think we were playing Grief here, Tim? Oh, oh, you think you think you're out here trying to like sneak a zombie up behind me? No, I got eyes in the back of my head and on the back of my, you know. How do you have eyes in the back of your deck? I didn't say that though. You, you, your dirty mind just got that out of that. I didn't say. I that. mean, it, it was more or less implied than anything else. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Damn it! I missed it. I missed the L set. I'm upset. I mean, not really, because there's 300 just... other gu guns on this map that are just as good, but, like, gosh darn it. Did you... Fucker. Did I what? Did you... You're not in the first... Wait. Where did you go? This is not a starting room challenge. Oh, wait, what? Oh, is that, is that what you thought this was? Oh, my bad. Yeah. Was... Sorry for the lack of communication there. No. Oh, I was sitting in the first room, like, you know, flopping off the fucking stairs. No. Oh, never mind. Fuck this. Yeah, dude, this is just a 1v1. The last video we did with all the YouTubers, that was a starting them challenge. This is not. This is literally just whoever dies first. We're playing, like, a regular-ass game of Buried. Yeah, maybe... Oh. I'm sorry if I didn't specify that enough. I, I I did say 1v1. I guess I didn't specify that this wasn't a starting them challenge. My bad. I mean, like, I was just <laughs> hanging out in the first room with you. I was like, okay, you know, I mean... I was just saving up for the LSAT, and then I ended up trying to go for it, and I failed. So that's what happened there. Oh, I was just video gaming in the first room. Ow. Really? Already? Are you fucking kidding me? That's no fun. Round five? Mm. Oh. I know. And I'm on like 200 ping. Well, see the thing... <sighs> uh. Well, that's... That was the most anti... You, you didn't even know the challenge we were doing until I <laughs> died. <laughs> That was like the most anticlimactic, <laughs> confusing recording I've done so far. Wow. <laughs> like the it's already over. Like the game's over. Like there's that. no there's no more to this. I we, I've already it, lost. Ignore it. Jesus Christ. Okay. Well, you know what we're gonna do? This is the tradition. Um, we both hold out grenades and kill ourselves. So I I expect you to oblige. There we go. I I, I will scissor you in death. Yay. Okay. Well, that was. Man, I gotta say, I felt like I definitely could have done better than that. <laughs> I got to I got totally surrounded. I, I don't know why. I was standing above Leroy's cage, and I was just, like, chilling there with an M14. I just got mauled at every angle. Well, that was buried. I, th I mean, a better a five-minute fail than a three-hour tie. You know what I mean? Um, <laughs> yeah, the three hours of sitting in the jug corner actually pack a bunch of paralyzer and oh god. Getting um, a resonator. Anyways, uh, thank you, Russian. Do you have any final words for the kids? Any final sentiments? Uh, big pee pee. Big, I concur. Hi, so this is Luke again. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, it's, it's his girlfriend. This is the gamer Cherry. The Cherry Gamer. However you'd like to go by. This is Luke's account still, so it, it's kind of confusing. Like, I just played Buried with this exact Wizard 101 Pro guy, and I'm doing it again on Origins, which is actually the next map chronologically. But it's his girlfriend this time, who does stream on Twitch. So, sorry for the confusion, it's confusing, but this is... Chantel. We're a wizard, Hattie. Come on. We're yeah. a wizard. So, uh, we are doing Origins, and you chose Origins pretty early. This is one of the first picks, and you're very passionate about Origins. So, yeah. this could last a while. This might not. Um, that's what she <laughs> said. And uh, let's, just, let's just get into this. Judging by your buried game, I don't think it's going to last very well, long. Well, see, the problem was I had an M14. Mm -hmm. Luke didn't even know what challenge we All were doing. Excuses, Tim. All I hear is excuses. So he, for... he had no idea what challenge we were doing. Well, he did, but he thought... <laughs> yeah, there... he, he thought it was a starting room challenge. There was just a miscommunication. Just a miscommunication there. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. We weren't on the same page in that game. But uh, you know what we're doing, right? It's a, it's a friendly 1v1. Whoever downs first loses. We can leave the starting room, believe it or not. We can work together if you so choose. You can also choose to grief me if that's your thing. Whatever it is that you want to do, you know? Okay, let's do this. Let's go. I suggest since we're playing Origins and minimal uh, 
teamwork is required that we, you know, pick, pick our thing. place. Pick our place. Yeah. Like, uh, yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll see, 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 since, you know, after your buddy it's done, I'll give you first choice of the staff there, Tim. Ooh, ah. Uh, I don't, th you know, we're not really going for a high round, so it doesn't really matter exactly. I, I think I might go for wind. It depends on the robots and how convenient they are. I think I'll try to go for wind. Fire, maybe, as well. Okay. I'm never going to go for lightning, though. That's the one staff I don't, I'll don't. i never go for. Just because Do you know like, I don't really no. ever go for lightning. It's kind of like the worst one, in my opinion. Yeah, no, it's definitely the worst one, but I like it. I don't know. I like the, the pretty colors. <laughs> pretty colors. <laughs> it doesn't matter how good it is. They're all know? colorful. I think I'll, I think I'll try to go for win, though. Are you thinking of getting ice or something? Um, oh, Yeah, I'll probably just get ice then. I will grab your CD because it is here. Oh, I have you. no ammo at all. This is actually not great. Oh, my God. I don't want to die on round three. That would be... There you go. There's a nick. I mean, okay, cool. I, I, oh, oh, max ammo. There we go. Some, some snow. Generator, generator. I gotta be so careful because I really don't have much of it. Really? Is that how we're gonna do this? Yeah, there's a lot to Origins, and I'm really not gonna do most of that. I'm just probably gonna chill out, you know, and I'll get a staff, but I think that's probably it, you know. I'm not, I'm not gonna go. Do you ever go for the one inch punch or whatever the hell it's called? The. No, like I don't, I don't do that crap. Like, but you get like the golden helmet and you know your perks, you know your extra perks and stuff. Like, yeah. You know the golden shovel and things like, you know, because it's useful. But the punches and stuff are just kind of. Yeah, it's just like extra. Nice. Tim's gonna fucking die already. Tim's gonna fucking die. Oh, I should have. Wow, I actually probably should have died right there. That was. Yikes. I'm actually not helping out here. I could have just left that nook, but I was like, wow. nah, okay. Question, is Origins your favorite map? Yeah, yeah, 100%. Is it, so, sure. it's, so it's the best map of all time, in your opinion, yeah. in your estimation. That's a fair yeah. play. I mean, Origins is like kind of like widely considered a top three map, I would say. Yeah, for I think... For brain dead, at least. For me, it's more just like I do have a massive nostalgia aspect because it was one of the maps back then that was actually around for like release and I actually cared about zombies when Black Ops 2 came out, so it was like one of those maps that I really had an investment in. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, just like, I don't know, it was just a completely different world when you opened up the map for the first time, and it was just yeah. like, what the hell is this? Why is there robots? Like, what's going on, you know? Yep. So I do think nostalgia does have a part to play in it, but I do like the mechanics, you know, it's a map I can go back and continue. Yeah. Do you like the BO3 or the BO2 version more, though? Um, Black Ops 2, definitely, just because I prefer the, the Black Ops 2 mechanics, too. I actually don't like Black Ops 3, believe it or not. Same. Um, Are you talking about the whole game or just BO3 uh, Origins? Just Black Ops 3 in general. I wow. never um, I never bought the season pass when it came out. I didn't really like Shadows, and I was just like, nah, I'll just leave it. And then I got Chronicles, and then I went back and started playing a couple of the maps. But the Horizon Rack's good, right? Don't get me wrong. I don't know. Black Ops 3 just felt really... I don't know, weird when it when it came out. It just felt so different from everything yeah. that we're playing before. Well, I will agree. I don't like Black Ops Three Origins just because of the mud. It's like infinitely worse than it is in this game. And the robots, especially Alange, were super glitchy. And the Panzer's health got like tripled. I swear. Yeah. I don't. I'm not a big <laughs> fan of Bo3 Origins. Oh, not a Panzer. Not a goddamn Panzer. Okay. Oh shit. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah, store, okay. How expensive is it? Okay. It's cheap enough for me to. You're really... Hey, you go deal with yep. it. Uh, my hands are full right now. <laughs> I I'm taking it up to you, bro. All right, if this kills me, it kills me. I don't know if this is the right foot. It is, thank God. Thank I'm dead, God. I'm dead. I Oof, was able to get in the... F <laughs> I didn't even know if that was the right foot. It's a whole <laughs> hell of a lot of... No! Wow! Woo! Should have died. Should have died. Should have died. Wh that's the second time... Third time, really, where I should be dead. My fear is that once we get the staffs, it's pretty much like we're not going to die ever. Would you rather we just undo staffs then and just see how long we survived with normal weapons? Oh, that's an interesting idea. Maybe we should use staffs but not upgrade them. Okay, okay. we'll just do the normal staffs and not upgrade Yeah, them. regular staffs. That way it's interesting but not OP. Because they'll, yeah. dro they'll drop off. Yeah, they drop off pretty early, so it's not like we're going to get to... You know, honestly, this map is so bad for co-op high rounds, man. Wait, Nobody wants to play it. Why is the vibration no longer in my controller? It's a wired controller. A ray gun? Is that... Ah, there's a panzer! 
There's a panther! I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm alive still. How did that happen? Find out in the next episode of Tim avoids his death. Oh, look at this fucking guy. He's dead. I thought you were talking about me. I was like, wait, what? No, no. Are you dead? I hope not. I um... hope not, too. Well, I do hope. Um, there's two panthers. I killed one, but now there's one more. There's, oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. there's one free Roman. I don't even know what other perk I should get. Double tap is free with a challenge. Are we going to live that long? I don't know, but I'm not going to grab that yet. I think I'm going to grab it. Should I just spin the fizz machine? Is that the, that's what the cool kids call it. The fizz machine. Fizz. Where's that shit at? The fizz. Uh, I'm going to go spin the fizz. Oh, cool. It moved. So, yeah, that's cool. First spin on the, on the fizz and it's gone. I'm going to call it that from now on, the fizz. Stop calling it the Dude, fizz. Dude, I'm sticking with it. If, if there's going to be jank, they're going to be zombies, or... I, I died. Know. I died. I got stomped <gasps> on. No way, dude. I didn't even have to try to... Are you kidding to me? It. I'm going to take this stupid goddamn panzer out of his last thing I do. Die. Ho. Okay, I killed him. Hey, I went out with a bang, though. I killed the... I got stomped on. You know what? You know what's crazy, actually? Earlier, I think I told you this. Earlier, I took a chance. Like, I thought I was gonna get stomped on. Like, I literally just went underneath the foot and prayed that it was the right foot. And I actually didn't get stomped on. I got lucky there. But... And then, and then this time, I didn't actually even see the foot and I got stomped on. So... I mean, that's I was, how that was. I was kind of, I was kind of just like, um, should I let him? I was like, you know what? I, I'm just gonna let him do this thing and see how it goes. But <laughs> dude, I didn't even. I saw the red light, but I only saw it like a second or two before I got stomped. I had way too many near death experiences throughout that game to not that to not bad. have it eventually. It had to catch up to me at some point. I got way yeah. too lucky throughout that. Thanks for having me on, Tim. And if I see any Origins is overrated comments on this video, I swear I'm going to full screen mode. <laughs> and is, is the best map, okay? All right, we are now on Shadows of Evil. Welcome to Black Ops 3. You guys have been waiting for this moment. The moment where we are now in, I I guess, the best... Well, I don't even know where I said it with that. Uh, we're joined by Plus Johnny, and we're going to do some Shadows of Evil. And, you know, the drill, 1v1, classic gobblegum only. And that is the only restriction. And Shadows is a pretty interesting map. We could die pretty early, but if we don't, assuming that uh, you and I are on our A game, uh, then we will have quite a bit to do. Swords, you know, tentacles. I think you mean you have a lot to do. I'm trying to catch a dub here, not help you out. That's what I was, you know, that's what everyone's been doing to me, is just been making me open up all the fucking doors. This sneaky little oh, bitch just took the fumigator. Okay, good thing I'm a pro and I know all the locations. Also, I'm going to get the, the secret Easter egg before you. Oh my god, if I just down myself by my grenade right there, I might have just ended my whole life. We are opponents, but we should uh, coordinate the beast modes, at least, at the very least, because I kind of want to... Why is that? I kind of want to... I mean, we don't have to. We, do, we don't have to if you don't want to, brother, but uh, it's just a suggestion. You know what, Tim? I'm going to let you do whatever you want to do, and I'll do whatever I want to do, and if that happens to coincide... <laughs> That's a dickhead way of saying no. Oh, Fumigator, look at that. God damn you! You I think I only slut. get the points, right? That's yeah. Correct. All right, good. That's how we like it out here. Haha, -ha, I got the quick revive prone points. I cannot be fucked with. You know what? Let's just do the Easter egg. <laughs> yeah, you you probably could, to be honest. You can't do the full thing without four players, I don't think, right? I can do a fat chunk of it, though. All the way toward the end. Where'd you go? You went to the waterfront district. Hi, no, Tim. No, no, stop following me. No, Johnny, no. No. Hello, good sir. Oh, I was about to say good sir, but you're a, a nice little... Woman. Jessica Rose, yeah. Wait, where are you at? Did you start the uh, the ritual over there? Or you're not going to tell me? Maybe. There might be a Margo. I don't know. Yo, Tim, you should really pack a punch to the starting weapon. I think you should uh, also shoot it at your feet repeatedly. Hey, that kills me. No, Bad no, 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 no. You've, you've PhD. Not bro. You got a shield piece. Good luck with that. I mean, good luck with that. <laughs> I can still grab the pieces. No. <laughs> what, are you going to block them? Oh, John, do you want to explain to the people why you chose Shadows of Evil, by the way? Because got, Shadows of Evil happens to be picks. the greatest map of all time. I I don't agree with that, but I do agree that it's a top five. And actually, you had, I think, the second... You were the second person to respond to me, so you got second pick. And you chose, of course, Black Ops 3's gem. Absolutely glorious. Well, did you see besides Dryzendrak? Dryzendrak is, is nothing on this absolute 
masterpiece. Jirai's and Drag is number one. Shadows of Evil is number two. And then the Giant, in my opinion, is number three. And then number four is Gorod. And then number five is Zetsubo. And then number six is Rev, because Rev is an unoriginal, boring hunk of shit. I think you're going to fall off a wall run. I think that's what's going to happen. I'm, I'm host, so I mean, my connection's decent. No, I think a zombie's going to jump into you and, like, block you off. I don't... See, I don't train in this area. I used to do that when this map first came out, but I don't do that anymore. You know what we should do? We should get all the Civil Protector fuses, spawn in the Civil Protector, and then fight over custody over him. You can do that. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you haven't opened up anything, have you? Jeez. What are you talking about? I feel like I'm opening up every ounce of this map, John. Good God. Oh, uh -huh. What a good guy you are, Tim. I appreciate it. I can see, like, I can see your smile without actually seeing your smile when you fucking <laughs> do all this shit. Yeah. I got all a right. fat grin on my face. You're actually doing this? Pff, try hard. Stop. I was trying to block you from seeing it. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if I'm actually going to do it. If I lose this game, I will be wholeheartedly embarrassed. Oh, yeah? Why is that? Oh, I got the SVG. It's over for you, Tim. Oh. I'm going to hit my trick shot. If I hit a trick shot, do I just automatically win? Yeah. Honestly, it's just going to come down to whoever gets the Apothecan Servant, let's be honest. If I get the Apothecan, I might just put it away. I might just trade it out. Really? How would that benefit you, though? It wouldn't screw me over, because I don't have access it, but to But it. it wouldn't allow you to, like, stand by me and get any benefit from it. Why, what makes you think I would stand by you, John? I don't know. Just, just intuition? Oh, I just won the game. Oh, my God. What? Nothing. Oh, no. Man. For all I know, he just pulled the pharaoh and he's just bluffing. <laughs> or I got some friends. Little Arnie's. That's what you got. <laughs> Arnold! Dude, John got little Arnie's. What the fuck? <laughs> I just Arnold's lost. Arnold's gonna help me. Arnold's gonna help me. Uh, Mark Holy Mark shit, he spawned on top of me! Oh, you got it, Tim. You got it. Grab I the believe. fucking fuse. I'm red screen, John. I died, John. Are you kidding me? What happened? I got meatballed! Why does the Marco always insist on harassing me? Hold on, Tim. I'm coming. I'm coming. Don't yeah, worry. Yeah, yeah. I was doing the fucking free gobble gum Easter egg. I was about to grab it, and the Marco has spawned right up just, my ass. Just stay there. There's no need to fret. Johnny's here, and he brought his friends. <laughs> I hope you're proud. I hope you're proud. <laughs> I really am. I'd rather lose on. I didn't I, do anything. This I, game. I'd rather die on round nine and lose than fucking get to round thirty and have this take five hours. Man, Jessica looks really concerned. Can you at least revive me, dickhead, so we can kill ourselves together as tradition in this video? Up, oh, nope, you scumbag. Up, oh, there it is. Okay, it's fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. Okay, well, congratulations, Johnny. I'm on a fucking losing streak right now. Johnny, thank you for that. Um, any final words for the kids? Shout out Arnold. Shout out Arnold. All right, on to the giant. Hey guys, we're on the giant with Skizzleax. That's the only thing that needs to be established. Yo, what's up? Whoever dies first loses. Are you ready? Are you confident? Uh, oh, I'm ready. Are you, I'm are ready. you confident? I'm ready. Do you think you're going to watch me die first, or am I going to be watching you die first? Uh, I'm just going to pull an excuse right now. I haven't played zombies in the longest, so even if you win, <laughs> hey, don't like start to X us. Uh, don't be like excited or anything like that. What are your thoughts on Call of Duty 2020? What What is that one thing you're really looking forward to in zombies? specifically oh my god um the return of the messiah the return of jug baby that would be cool yeah I mean, yeah, the yeah, perk yeah system in general i think what about you i i think what they did with black ops 4 zombies was great but their path the, the path they chose was not what i mean by this is that you know all the new perks they added what if they those were like perk machines in itself and what if they made them um, exclusive perks for example who's who was a thing for die rise what mm -hmm. if those new perks they chose, you know, just pick one perk and make it unique and exclusive to one one map. I remember the last time we did this, you were in the last one, the part one of this, where we did the starting room challenge. You and I did Keno yep. on Black Ops 1, and you thought it was a 1v1 at first. What are we doing? We're doing, like, starting room challenge? Like, should I put you down? Something like that? So we, we are not doing a 1v1, despite common belief. This is, we're working uh, together. We're a team. Maybe starting you room. baited me. I, I think uh, I'm, yeah. I'm just going to blame you. Maybe, maybe you baited me, I think. You got your hopes <laughs> up too quickly. See, we were a team, and now we're not. Would you be cool if we get trapped? Remaster. Are, are you keeping up with like the rumors and whatnot? Sort of, yeah. For the most part, I have heard that Transit is like gonna be 
in 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 the next game in some capacity. It seems like. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there was like uh, I I've seen I've seen like in-game code of DLC five being in Black Ops four, but of course I never thought we we're gonna get it. Mm -hmm. Uh, so I, I think they they were really planning for it, but somehow they were like, hey, eh, we we're not gonna have time, so they didn't. I think, mm -hmm. but. Would you be cool if we get that? Or you're I like, would, hey, whatever. Yeah, they have a lot. I think Transit Remastered has a ton of potential. I mean, obviously, in last gen, they had limitations. But in next gen, like, hey, it could be really good. Oh, you're waiting. Oh, you're waiting. Oh, you're waiting. <laughs> oh, it's a uh, dog run. Oh, yeah. That's a dog run. You want to you wanna tag team or it's just... Uh... Okay, yeah, I was going to say, like, in some capacity, we have to work together. Because, like, at the same time, you know, we got to link up teleporters and such, turn on power, like... We're sort of a team, oh, yeah. even though we're not. It's it's kind of a weird dynamic. It's almost as if this game was made for teamwork. It's crazy. Yeah, mind blown. There was a lot of conversation about it being in Vietnam, Black Ops 5, and now it's Cold War. Even though those are kind of in the same ballpark, it's interesting I, I how think that changed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think it's going to be Vietnam and uh, Cold War. It, basically, they're going to go back. It's Black Ops 1 all over again. Yeah, so Black Ops 1, exactly. I genuinely am excited, dude. Like, I don't want to be. I really don't want to be, but I genuinely am excited. I don't. It's Call of Duty Cycle, like, like, that's what it is. Yeah, every call, every new Call of Duty is exciting, and then, you know, when you get something like Black Ops 4, it's like, oh, well, great, there goes my erection. There are rumors of four maps again coming to Call of Cold War, Black Ops Cold War. I'm uh, hoping it's not true. I don't know. I don't know if that's going to bode well. I, I honestly I think two solid maps is better than four decent yep. ones. Um, three max. The giant. Two new maps and one remake. But no more than that. The giant and Shadows of Evil were like perfect for launch maps. You had like a complicated map and an easy map. And you know, one was familiar, one wasn't. And it was like the perfect like duality at the beginning of Black yep. Ops 3. And then Black Ops 4 was just like, here's four fucking maps, four Easter eggs to try to solve in two different storylines to try to keep up with. Good luck. And they just close the door <laughs> on us, and we never heard from them again. Yeah. Oh, and they dropped Dead of the Night without telling us, so that was also a really cool thing. That was bad, dude. Uh, yeah. I think they were really going after a surprise. Uh, maybe, you know what, they were trying to attempt something unique. Uh, they were just, I think they were really testing. They were really hoping for it to bang, but mm -hmm. it certainly did not. Yo, I want to test it. Uh, I do not, like, I don't want to test it. Nah, forget it. I kind of want to. I was I'm pretty sure to with go Jug, it. you're good. Oh, yeah, yeah. Do I test it? Wow, uh, that'd be a really anti it, It's been ending. it's been so long. Like I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. Like the jug, you're good. But knowing my chances, knowing my luck, I'll I'll probably go down. So uh, I, I won't. Try. Oh, oh. I don't know. I kind of wanna, but I kind of don't. Oh, oh shit. What was your first map ever of all time? Uh, you know, you know. Same, same, same. I was a B I'm a Bo1 Black fanboy Black. to be honest. Black Ops One. Yeah. Yeah, I would say Black Ops Two was the best though, in my opinion. For zombies I, I a, or just everything. Uh, for everything. Black Ops Two was the best for everything. Uh, mm. but uh, here's the thing though: Black Ops One campaign, anger. Black yep. Ops Two multiplayer was the best. Black Ops Three zombies was the best. That's kind of like my ranking though. But That's I had fair. a lot of fun playing. Grief in town though. You play Modern Warfare? You like I it? You don't like so it? I feel so sad. I literally bought the game on PS4, the full version. Haven't even touched it, and I feel so shitty about it. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Just... Yeah, same. Kind of same for me. I bought like the last season, uh, and I did not even like. I was like tier two, three, and this time I didn't buy the the season. I'm like tier three. I mm -hmm. like the game, but I don't like playing. Oh my I get god, all those points and thank God. Jeez, I ran. Oh, you son of a gun, up. dude. All right. I was, I was having fun. Board. I was making points. I was making moolah. <laughs> oh, wow. I have exactly enough to put this impaler back in here. And hopefully I get fireworks. Yeah, that's goal. Or turned is okay, I guess. The reason I haven't played zombies in the longest is just like, I'm waiting for the reveal. I'm waiting for zombies to come back, and that's when I want to play. I just don't want to be burnt out before, you know? That makes sense, yeah. What's your favorite character, by the way, in zombies? Hmm. I think I gotta go with Dempsey or Nikolai. What about you? Yeah, Dempsey, Nikolai, uh, Richthofen. Yeah, it's just one of those. I think everyone would say that. Yeah, same for me. I mean, I like Takio. I just think of the four of them, Takio and Richthofen. I like Richthofen too, but it's just like I don't know. Dempsey's mm -hmm. the most relatable to an American 
such as myself. And Nikolai is just the funniest, so I think I like those two the most. Yeah, I, I like the Russian accent also. Yeah. Dude, oh shit. You might not like hearing this news, but I think I just got the Wonder Wife DG too. Oh, I think I did just you? did. Did you really? <laughs> did yeah, you acquire yeah. such a weapon? I love the the basic aspect about this map. It's so good in that regards. Mm -hmm. You can yeah, just jump on. I was about to say, what is that? Why you picked it? I mean, there were a lot of options. I think when I asked you what map you wanted, because you were one of the first uh, that the was yeah one of the reason why yeah. I picked it. I because uh, you gotta understand, I haven't played zombies in the longest, so I was like, hey, I'm gonna go with the giant. Like I don't. Oh. Oh, oh no! shit! Oh shit! Skizzle axe. Oh, damn. You know, it happened all of a sudden. It's like I got hit once. I swear to God, the game is rigged. Uh, you, yeah. Are you using any hacks? You know what? I'll pick you up out of good grace. And uh, congratulations. Uh, let's both hold grenades and just commit seppuku right now. All right. <laughs> All right, all right three, yeah, just two. holding it down. All right, there we go. All right, twenty-two rounds. That was not bad. All right. No. <laughs> that was wholesome. But you gotta, you have, like, I haven't played zombies in, like, a year. Good game. Uh, do you have any final statements for the lads? Like, I don't know, I give everybody, like, a, like, a, like you want to plug something mm. or say anything. Uh, when, whenever you're looking to make a huge video and whenever you are looking to do a challenge, I'm gonna get you. Hello, ladies okay. and gentlemen, and welcome to Der Eisen Drahach. If you don't say it like that... Are you even an ethnic German? It's in Austria, Tim. I'll have you know. I don't give it. You know what? Take that up with the comment section. All right. I'm here with Zwenik. Watch me just down on round two. Just watch. <laughs> that would be really anticlimactic. <laughs> not gonna lie. <laughs> Especially will, under eyes and Drek. I will actually cry. I'm being serious. I will cry. I will get in my bed, fully clothed, PC on and everything. Probably audacity still running in the background. I will cry myself to sleep. <laughs> what bow are you thinking about getting, by the way? I'm curious. Uh, either wolf or lightning. Wolf or lightning. Yeah, yeah. I'm not sure. I'm pretty much going to go for anything besides fire, I think. Because I don't feel like waiting at the rocket pad to get that. I feel like I'm probably going to go for wolf or void. Or, you know, it depends on what you get. We can kind of work together. I mean, it is a 1v1, but... It's a lot, you know, for setting up, I would say we could work together, but for, uh... So, sounds like communist propaganda, but sure, why not? You know what, you're right. Never mind. Let's, let's not help <laughs> Don't tell Rabbit, though. He will, he will, he will bite your head off. I feel like Ooh. lying to buy a weapon. I feel like I should definitely have some protection. Like Probably should. <laughs> oh, God. Um, right. throwing shade at yourself there. Very cool. Yeah. Hello, zombie. <laughs> Hello, dragon. Just I need a gobble gum for me. I need a gobble gum for a guy on the move. In plain sight, does the trick. What are your thoughts on DE? Best BO3 map or what? What do you think? I think it is. Mm. No? Uh, Shadows has grown on me. Ooh, Gorod, Gorod's grown on me as well. Um, I still hold the same opinion about ZNS. Uh, it's not... Sorry, ZNS. Um, I still hold the oh God, relative like same opinion of that map. It's all right. The only redeeming factor for me on that map is the dual wield Marshall 16s. That's literally it. I'm so used to being at the third dragon by now, if not having the Wrath of the Ancients. But, but you know, this isn't a regular game of Dries and Drac, ladies and gentlemen. I would say DE is like easily my favorite BO3 map and probably my favorite map of all time with Mob. And then Shadows is also fucking amazing. And then the rest of them are pretty, like, pretty good. Like, the Giant's great. Uh, Garag Krovi's great. And then ZNS is good in a lot of ways and bad a lot of ways. And Revelations, to me, is just kind of boring. Ooh, ooh how did I know I was going to get a fire sale, too? Oh, my God. Did you have Immolation Liquidation on? Oh, you cheating slut. Cheating slut? No, no, no. I got it from a tram. Well, no, so at least I'm getting some decent weapons now. The fucking Shiva, I spin the box and I get the Shiva. Thank you. Okay, Pharaoh! Wow, we're two for two here! Oh my god, I'm about to get cornered. Ray gun. Okay. Okay. I don't know how helpful that's actually going to be. Can't imagine it'd be all that bad, but then again, it is Black Ops 3. I'm gonna hide underneath the staircase like Harry Potter. They won't be able to find me. Right? Right, Zwenik? Uh, yeah, I mean, that's a good plan. I'm gonna go for the wolf bow if you don't mind. Is that cool, dog? Sure. Um, I almost completely forgot what the uh, steps were for the lightning bow for a second. What round is Panzer again? Is it 12? I can't remember. Mm hmm. Oh, God. 
I thought that was Origins, but am I just being f***ed? I do not know. Well, that was a bad word for me to say. You're not meant to say that word. Why did it's you say turned... that word? You, like, straight up offended me. <laughs> He's a bit stuck. Can you move? Let him get by. Thank you. I didn't even think that was possible. How the fuck did you stop him? What can I say? I'm too strong. But yeah, I've got a question for you. Being from Massachusetts, have you ever been to the? Have you ever been to Plymouth Rock? It's a very really dumb question, but you know. I don't even know. I, my guess is no, because I don't remember it. But there's a possibility I went there when I was younger, and I don't remember. It's all about fucking pilgrims and shit. Oh shit! I'm done. Hell yeah, brother! Oh. <laughs> oh, that was so close. What? Oh, did I save you with that nuke? No, 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 no. I was at the rocket. I was at the rocket test, and I went to get the switch for the Ragnaroks. The doors closed, and I just got on the Wonder Sphere in time. I actually haven't used the Wolf Bow in forever because whenever I play DE, I high around and I use the Lightning Bow. So this is this is my favorite though. I really like this one the most. It's so badass. Pack punch is now built, but it's at the rocket test, and I'm not pleased about that. Oh god, he's coming. Oh god, he's a coming. See, you know what? I have a plan. I have a plan. <gasps> Killing me? No. <laughs> Where is he? Oh, there he is. Check that out. I'm gonna just, uh... I'm gonna just come over here. And then run over here. Hallelujah. Oh, Jesus Christ. That was a very good plan. I like that plan. <gasps> oh, you know what? I've got a death machine. I'm all right. I'm gooch. I, I, don't want to, I don't want to see you die. I just need you to die. I'm colorblind, apparently. I thought the uh, lightning bow was green. Okay. Oh, oh, rocket's going off. I'm working on getting the Ragnarok pieces, by the way. Very cool. Thanks, Tim. Very cool. You know what's always been on my mind? I've always wondered if you pack, if you put a gun in the pack a bunch machine and it moves and it teleports to another location, will it be there when it teleports? Like if you go over to pick it up, do you think it'd be there? <laughs> I've uh, always no. wondered. I don't know if you don't know. No, that's fun. the that's the myth busting Mondays. Uh, get get Ben on that. Yes, I just pack a punched my Vesper. Got the same exact camo that I had originally on it, because I already had the Pack-A-Punch camo on it. You ever watch Jimmy Neutron? Is that big over there in the UK at all? Or? Um, it used to be, but obviously, like, now we're not grow Now we're growing up, we don't have a need for that stuff. <laughs> I was brought up on, like, the old cartoons. Like, I was brought up on, sort of, like, the actual, like, Tom and Jerry and all uh -huh. that shit. Well, let me tell you, Jimmy Neutron did not age well. My god, I tried watching it the other day. I think it's on Hulu or Netflix? One of the two. And it is bad. It did not age well. It is a tr it is unwatchable. Not that it was great back in the day, but, you know, when you're a kid, everything's a lot more absorbable. Not that fucking show. Hi, I'm Tim Hansen. Thanks for coming to my TED Talk. Oh, red screen, fuck me. Fuck me. Guys, Wenick. Die! <laughs> I'm just going to sit here and hump you. I don't think Lisa would be very happy about that. Aha! Uh -huh. Fucking bitch. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Fucking slut. We are no longer friends. Ooh, ouch. Ends, ends, ends video there. Die, motherfucker. Yeah, look at that. We got him. Teamwork. Ha, got him. Uh, my mouse is really starting to go weird. I don't think we're gonna die, dude. I'm gonna just have to harass you for a while. Like, just run around and... No, 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 it crashed! It fucking well, crashed, Wenick! Well, that's where we're ending it! <laughs> oh my god! Wait, you, did you not actually... Did you do that on purpose? No, no, dude. Okay, people always <laughs> swear I purposefully crash games. I don't. There, how does that benefit me? I would never purposefully harm my video by crashing the game. We literally just... I, I disconnected from the server somehow. So did I. I don't should, we know just say, should we just say that was a draw? I seriously did not end the game, all right? People in the comments, Jesus Christ. <laughs> wow, I can't say that um, even if what... I. Even if one of us did down, I'm pretty sure it was pretty even, I would say. Anyways, uh, Zwenik, do you have anything to, like, plug, anything you want to say before I move on to the next map here? Uh, I was going to say, 
uh thanks for getting me to 1k on youtube i appreciate it uh if you sub to tim which a lot of you already are and if you would wouldn't mind subbing to me as well channels in the description and yeah thanks for watching this segment on to the next one hey guys we're playing zetsubo no shima and this is reed and we are going to hopefully not humiliate ourselves on zetsubo because zetsubo isn't exactly forgiving yeah one bad thrasher and we are embarrassed i just want to get to double digits with you and i think we can have a little respect we get to round 10 mm -hmm. And then it's like, ah, whatever, shit happens. You die round two, it's like, that's embarrassing, mm -hmm. all right? And it's like, when, as soon as you have something on the line, as soon as it's like, oh, you know, friendly competition, no, it takes on a whole new form, and you, you just, you're all that more likely just to <laughs> screw it all up. There's no way to relax on this map in general, but now there's competition added on top of the challenge. It's a challenge on top of a challenge, Reed. I say between uh, BO4 and BO3 is definitely the safest to play the games. It's really easy just to... And, blow through the rounds and any big mistakes you might have made that would be death sentences in the older ones you can get away with you can skirt by i think this is less going to be like a direct competition with one another on zet and more or less just trying mm -hmm. not to make a mistake oh here's jug that's sick uh, that's, that's sick. 300. hey friend you want to open this thinking about it <laughs> you can think about it some more okay there we go <laughs> All right, let's see what Which we got. Mine. I believe mine Water is Waterpipe plants. It's pretty easy. Waterpipe plants. Uh, trap. Okay. Should I start working on the skull? I don't know. I mean, that puts me in harm's way. That, yeah, that seems really like a really, does. really dangerous thing to do right now, especially without Jug. Maybe we should but work on Then you on get bragging rights, rights if you do it. You know what? You're right. I want bragging rights. So I'm going to go do that. <laughs> oh, you picked up the other one. That explains No. That. Not true. I tried placing it down in the slot, and I was like, what? <laughs> this is a new glitch. Brand new glitch day one. Dang it, Shreyarch is broken. The amount of times I heard that on, like, on an Easter egg hunt is just debilitating. I'm God so sick of hearing that. Yeah. That's... Steps glitch. Steps glitch. Really? You really think it's list? It's always the same people too. <laughs> yeah. We uh, it's been out for 34 minutes and it's glitched. Really? Sometimes, yeah. But most of the times, like, no. We have no idea how this works. It's been out for 30 oh. minutes. Oh my God. This is not good this is not healthy this is not What's good that? i am surrounded already there's a lot of spiders mm. which sound more like seagulls and less like spiders they're That's cracking it no tim run tim. away tim no we're just getting started oh, red screen did they all die or did they break it they probably broke oh it no i got it actually that's sick nice job and i avoided death for now let's do the the mario golf nice shot i'm gonna hopefully something good hopefully something good please for the love of god up oh, kuda i mean that's that's average uh, blue water obtained i'm gonna go dump it in the the thing and we can get power on momentarily up oh, spiders nope. all right Scoot around this is gonna be interesting because sure will be there's going to be some KT4 parts we're going to have to acquire together, but only one person can obtain the KT4, at least. Not true. You can get it out of the box. Yeah, yeah, but ugh, let's be honest. We're going to die yeah, before fair. that happens. Yeah, yeah, it's fair. I'm actually kind of hoping we do, I, like, I'm hoping we survive for a very long time because, like, I'm hoping to play some Zets, but, like, I don't want to set up for nothing, you know? I agree. I agree. Zet is a really interesting map, and it pushed a lot of uh, boundaries of innovation, which I mm -hmm. really do credit to it with... It's like the spider bite, or spider bait, rather. Not spider bite, the guy. <laughs> the spider bait Easter egg, the jump scare Easter egg. The swimming mechanics in here were very interesting to see how they were implemented. Mm -hmm. There's just a lot of stuff that was testing and pushing the boundaries. The golden bucket. Uh, oh, boy. Well, here we go. We might get my first down. I have Thrasher. I've agitated him. I don't have a very good weapon. I am having... Oh, I'm in trouble. Yep. Oh, oh <laughs> no. It's all good, man. Oh, no, I'm eaten by it. It was a time. Six oh, rounds. What are you going to do? Oh, I, I I take that personally. You can't just eat my friend like that. I'm going to go over I there. I know, that's rough. I'm going to have to shoot him open. I can, oh, God, he spawned right next I to had me. the um, spider hit yeah. me while the thrasher hit me at the same time. Here, I'll pick you up GG. so we can kill ourselves together. That's the, that's the policy. Uh, we that's kill ourselves policy. together. So let's just hold our grenades out and just... Okay, I'm coughing to death. Give me a second. There we go. <laughs> there we go. All right, sick. I mean, well, way to ruin that for you, but I was trying to get power open and right. get it going and all that. 
Hey, and I got dude, caught with the spiders. It's it's Such chill. I, honestly, statistically, I'm I'm bound to go like 50 50 with wins and losses here. So, <laughs> I mean, I'm the one under pressure. I'm the one that's got to go through 30 different people. But uh, anyways, that was. I mean, that was. That was. We did stuff. That was that was stuff. You know, hey oh. <laughs> we didn't do all the stuff, but we did stuff. That was interesting. Yeah. All right, Reed, well, um, I like to give everybody just like a closing, like if you want to say something, it could be anything. It could be uh, a plug. It doesn't have to be a plug. It could just be like a message for the kids, like, uh, I don't know, uh, don't do drugs, just anything you want to say. Uh, posters at radrendering.com. I didn't mm -hmm. earn a purchase, though, with this gameplay, so uh, just just keep giving love to Tim. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, with... That that didn't roll off the tongue well. I keep forgetting that this is in the middle of the video, so I don't have to I don't have to do an actual intro. Uh, this is JC Backfire, the man, the myth, the legend. And what other map would it be than Garage Kroby? What other map would it be? Always. It Always. is a hot classic, one would say. And we're gonna one of you one each other. And to be fair to JC, uh, I don't know when the last time you uh, played Zombies was, but I can't imagine it was recently, especially since you've been kind of busy. So. Um, just honestly, everybody keep that in mind. Hasn't been recent. I haven't played Garage Krovi in probably a couple months, to be honest. Isn't that crazy? <sighs> Is this the most frequent map? Like, if when you do play zombies, do you actually hop on Garage the most often? Do you think? Um, it's either this or DE. Yeah. Good choices. Good solid choices. I don't really think there is a bad Black Ops Three map. I really think you can enjoy all of them. DE for that. You know, when you want to do an Easter egg kind of thing. Yeah. Just, like, I want to do an Easter egg. I want to challenge myself and do, like, a speed run or something. And then GK, just for the fun mm. of it. I love this map. Yeah. Everybody clowns on Zetsubo. But I actually think Zetsubo is way better than Revelations. I think I like Rev enough to not hate it. But, but I think Rev is my least favorite just because of really? the unoriginality. I mean, Zetsubo was original, and it may be tedious, but... I prefer that over a map that played it safe. You like you like the the gardening? It depends. <laughs> Sometimes I swear, like I know what I'm doing with that. I'll put the right colors in for the for the watering and the plants, and it just doesn't work. But anyways, we're, we're, we ain't playing Zetsubo. <laughs> uh, Reed and I just got done doing that, so uh, here we go. Garad Krovi. You and I did Garad Krovi in the last video I did with all the YouTubers when we did that starting room challenge, and I already fanboyed then. I don't need to do it again. Everybody already knows that. Uh, it's a really pure moment. The, the Garad story. You were the first person I ever donated any money to online. I donated you... <laughs> Are you serious? I donated you five dollars on your Garage Krovi stream when you solved the Easter egg for the first time. I took my Dude. mom's credit card. I'm not gonna lie. I donated you five dollars. <laughs> I remember this so precisely. You were kill it. You was a Valkyrie drone round. You were playing with DC, and you killed the last Valkyrie yeah, drone. DC. My name popped up, and you were. I said. All right. Yo, come I up love here. your channel. You have inspired me to start my own. <sighs> Also, Thank you so much, Blue Foot. You saw an electric chair machine? I don't think there was an electric chair machine. I haven't seen one yet. I think it might be in the. Maybe it's in. Could it be in the Wonder Puzzle? Yeah, I bet. I'm glad I finally inspired you, man. That means a lot. I said, JC, you are an inspiration for me to start my YouTube channel. And you said, oh, thank you. I remember that so <laughs> clearly, dude. <laughs> I'm not joking at all. That's how well I remember that. So that's number Bro, one. I, I appreciate that so much. Like I, I it, like to me that I, I, I did not know yeah. that it went back that far. I was just some random like, kid watching your stream, and when you read it off, that was the first first like the first YouTuber that ever acknowledged my existence. So I was like dude. freaking out. I was like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, just that like makes fanboy. Makes happy, man. I, I'm, I'm glad to hear like you enjoyed the streams way back then. I'm kind of scared to call in a Groff module or do anything risky like that. Groff you know? module? I haven't heard that name in a while. <laughs> Groff module. What a name, dude. What a game. Good guy, Gersh. Good guy, Gersh. Oh my god, dude, you're bringing back a lot of feelings for that me. that's what i do to you jc every time we play together all of your zombies all your past experiences just wash over you my my past just flashes before my eyes we're talking before this recording yeah about how every time we talk together we just go just on this deep huge like let's just talk about <laughs> life train let's talk about where we are as and it, ha it happens instantly too like we don't it's like effortless like it just just rolls out and there it is oh, i'm about to die 
No! Don't die oh, no. yet! I'm good, I'm good. <laughs> I want you to die, but not right now. Keep it together. I need another gun. I need some other gun. Please. Yeah, I should probably start thinking about buying that, too. a pharaoh because F it. A f <laughs> a f <laughs> In 2020, we buy pharaohs, unironically. Oh, yeah. That's what it's come to. This, this year has been just, in a lot of ways, for me personally, good. But as a whole, for this country especially, this year just isn't it. I don't think. Oh, yeah. I, I don't think it's the year. It doesn't know? even feel like it's a year. It just feels like it's just yeah. health. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. I got Jug now. A little bit less stress. All right. Yeah, dude. That's, the, nice. that's the thing with Black Ops 4. There is none of that. The amount of pressure that's relieved, <laughs> you know, actual game progression, like actually building up to that, you just spawn in with that health. Like, you, you don't get that experience yeah. of, oh, thank God I have Jug. You don't get that in Black Ops 4. It's just one of the very many issues I have with that game. You're just constantly stressed at all times. Yeah. Even long term in that game. <laughs> it's like, just... yeah. And on this map, you spin the box, you get the Ray Gun Mark III. In Black Ops 4, you spawn in with the Wonder Weapon, the Specialist. You already have it. Show me the money. Show me the money. Watch me get, like, the Annex Shadow Claws. Oh, oh Draken. <laughs> Bitch. Let's -a go. Let's -a do it and see what that happens. Are you doing, oh. oh, oh, he's real close. Ooh. Oh, enemy's attacking. JC, you don't have to help me, but, uh... Hey, I would, man, I like I'd the Groth mod. <laughs> I'd appreciate it. I feel like I might do another video like this in the future, a while from now, where I get a bunch of YouTubers together again. I hope. Yeah. I just gotta think of another idea for it, because, you know, you only have so many ideas. A 1v1 what is was cool. the last one again? Was it Star starting room? Starting room, yeah. And this is a 1v1, so I'm sure I could think of something. I kind of like this more than the starting room because it, it it's gives competitive. You more time. Yeah, it gives you like a little bit more time in my opinion too. I feel like the starting room I'm so bad at. Oh, it depends though. It very much depends <laughs> because That's true. on Black Ops 3, it's not too bad. But on other games like BO1, BO2, World of War, the two hit system, it, sometimes yeah. those clips only last like five minutes. Oh, I might kill me. <gasps> I'll clear the path for you and I'll give you a death. Machine! Wow. Hey, oh, look at I that. You. We wow. got each other's backs, even though we're not supposed to. <laughs> I might have been red screened at one point right there. Oh, God. I got you. I got you. Aw. I block you. I, <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I actually could have killed you there, potentially. <laughs> nah, I, I don't do that. I don't do it that way. I do it the legit way. Just for randomly going down in conversation. Yeah, that's how we do it. Like I was playing with Chop on Kino, and we were talking. We had a, we were having a deep conversation about like different like accents and stuff like that, and <laughs> I legitimately was so invested in the conversation that instead of holding out my thunder gun, I was holding out my Spas 12, and I died. Oh my! I God. had the thunder gun and lost on Kino. Can you believe that? Dude, that's literally all you need. Exactly, but I was so I was so into the conversation, I wasn't even thinking about zombies. I was just thinking about the conversation. And sure, Dang, shit, bro. I get overwhelmed immediately, and uh, that's how life goes. <laughs> Dragon is busy. What are you doing? Huh? <laughs> Don't you do it. What? Don't you... I'm not JC. doing anything. I just summoned him over here. He's just JC. chilling. He's my boy. It's just, dude, it's literally the same thing, dude. It's I just like the GK video, I was bro. very respectful <laughs> to you. I'm, I have, we're fine. <laughs> we're not completely against each other, but we're not completely for each other either. It's like, mm. all right, let's, let's just take turns. Let's let fate decide. That's the best way to approach this video sometimes. But um, fate is, fate has been met, actually. <laughs> Some, um. <laughs> sometimes people like to actively grief me, and sometimes it's the opposite. This is a nice middle ground, and JC won. Congratulations. You already won. No, but then again, like I said, if I had Wonder Weapons, and I've gone down, so I just got to keep you distracted. You want to go to the thing? Uh, let's go to the thing. Oh, look at that. Look how good this looks on PC. Oh, my God. It does look really good. It looks good. way better than on console. Can you imagine back in the day when zombies were just starting out seeing something like this? Oh, dear Like, it's Lord. honestly insane that this ever happened. Like, we had a, we rode a dragon in Call of Duty, guys. Yeah. I don't think people, like, understand that too much, but that happened. 
Yeah, there was always that small percentage of people who were turned off by that. And what do zombies come to? But come on, man. No, that dude, is it's too so freaking cool. It's too cool. Let's me spin uh, the box. Gets the ray gun. <laughs> I feel like the drop rate of that weapon is pretty high in this game for some reason. Yeah, it is. I think it is. Because I, I swear every time I play GK, somebody grabs it. And on maps like, I don't know, Shang, for example, where oh, yeah. the baby gun is it's such so a low hard. drop rate. Sometimes you play that map and you nobody gets it, like straight up. Yep. <laughs> that doesn't happen in this map. I'm just waiting for you to take the dragon and screw me over. I'm just waiting for it. Uh, you know what? The fact that you had that in your mind tells me that you're waiting to do that <laughs> to me. Because I wasn't even thinking about it's that. You were thinking about that. It's oh, not true. Yo, these are logic zombies like give me problems. Dude, I hate those. They're so random. I still don't understand when they pop up. I still don't get it. They they pop up. I don't know. Like when the Valkyrie, it's they like they you? hide. The Valkyries hide in a little corner and they just start shitting them out one by one. Like seriously, like the, the little electric zombies will just crawl out of their asses, the Valkyrie drones, <laughs> and just start running towards you. And, they, and there's they, they, there are gonna be thirty of them at a time. Like there's no cap I remember to them. It always, I always thought it was the um. I always thought it was when they hit you. I, that was always like the thing in my head. Like, oh, if a Valkyrie hits me, they're gonna start spawning them or something. Like they take your juice. I don't know. I don't it know. Sounds really weird. Oh my goodness, my game. Did your game crash? Are you serious? I'll protect you. Are you dead? <laughs> no! JC, no! I don't know. JC! <laughs> Are you alive? How am I alive? Wait, what? <laughs> what the f Bro, what? There's no. There's I, think no the, I think there was a lag spike. Way. I think I even felt the lag spike. I apologize what for that, but how, how are you still in one piece, my friend? What? Bro, I thought that was it. There's no way. I thought your game like had just totally crashed. Like I thought you it's were back at your even, desktop. My my controller is constantly shooting. <laughs> what? This is not good, Tim. My controller is constantly shooting. Oh my god. I gotta like I'm gonna ride the dragon. Oh. Sorry, oh. if you wanna get on, get on, but I gotta like <laughs> stop my controller. What oh just my happened? god! You legitimately just shot down. I was like, "Wow, he's over, and this is gonna be another draw." But no. Nope. Game went back to windowed mode, and then I had to tab back into full screen, and I'm still alive. Were you helping me? Oh, I was, but you were getting hit quite a bit. <laughs> so I'm wondering if you were if you were like invincible or something. Dude, if I didn't have the shield, I would have died. Though the shield's gone now. Ah, uh, well, yeah, I, I was up. I was protecting you slightly. I don't think I was protecting you enough to totally cover your ass. <laughs> That's crazy. Back from the dead. There's uh, so many enemies. Oh my god. Valkyrie drones ruin it. I love this dual camping strat. It works too. This is very it's very Doris feeling. Yes. Honestly. It's like two half catwalks. Yeah, but then you have the the dragon for an escape if you want it. Yes. Speaking of that, yeah, let's get him in here. <gasps> oh, what? Oh, hello. <laughs> okay, we're on the same side now. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Were you planning on staying here? No, it's gonna no. cost you. Walk the plank. F it. <laughs> F it. Oh, you you were just standing on top of him. <laughs> You were just straight up standing on top of them. I actually have a Chinese water dragon, which is... It's a pretty standard looking lizard. It's like a... I'm gonna, I fucking die. What the hell? What killed you? A electric zombie. Oh my god. Did you just get one hit? Yeah, JC, revive me. I was in the middle of a story. Dude, Tim, no. Okay, let's be honest. You had the Mark III. Let's be honest. You would have survived a lot no. longer than I would have anyways. No, but what I was saying is, uh, I'm trying to remember. I have a I have a Chinese water dragon named Siegfried, and and and, uh, and the specialist from this map inspired me. Uh, he's a little cute little dragon. Oh, uh, but so anyways, you have a you have a Garad Krovi pet. Yeah, a little bit. Although really Sie adorable. Siegfried goes a lot further back than uh than Garad Krovi, but yeah, that was it was pretty cool uh, connection there. Anyways, JC, congratulations died. on winning. Now we kill ourselves together in a ceremonial of holding no, the grenade. I don't want to go. And uh, go, oh. Bro. Calm down, Spider-Man. We're gonna fire. be <laughs> in the fire. <laughs> Mr. Stark, I don't want to go. I got killed by an electric zombie. Remember how we were talking so much garbage <laughs> about them? We're like, look at these stupid electric zombies. Sure as shit. That's the thing that kills me. Anyways, JC, thank you for uh, joining me on this blessed. I don't even know what day it is. It's like uh, Sunday. Sunday evening. Someday. Um, it's yeah. someday. We don't know what's going on. It's five o'clock somewhere. But I think. Thank you for having me on, man. It was yes, a lot of fun. Absolutely. Like, I love, love chilling on Grog Crovy. Playing it.
Yeah. Are it's you great. streaming often at all? Right. Or maybe not right now, but are you um, are you still into the Twitch game? So basically, I'm I'm doing Twitch. Twitch is my main thing. I do it the most I can and just kind of play whatever I want to, like Resident Evil and stuff is what I've been doing lately. Um, so mm -hmm. that's just twitch.tv, JC Backfire. Yes, and check then, them out. Um, other than that, I, like we talked about at the beginning, uh, we didn't talk about during too much, but I'm actually going into the industry a little bit and doing a job um, mm. soon that I can't really say much of, but I'm not, I'm not going to be really doing a lot of content creating stuff um, as much. Mm -hmm. uh, it's gonna be more chill as as a side project of mine. Yes, but I was glad to have you to. on this. I was I was very much looking forward to having you and a bunch of the other guys on this video. So uh, I appreciate that. And uh, on yeah, to what's after Grug Crit Revelations. On to Revelations. I am joined with the Chicken Snipe, and we are on Revelations. And he has never, ever played Revelations before, which I've puts never seen a this whole map. hell of a lot of pressure on me. Okay. Because although I'm not a huge fan of Rev, although I don't play this every day like a lot of people, I, well actually I don't know a lot of people that play Revelations every day now that I'm thinking about it, I am not a huge Rev fan, so, uh, I mean, but I, I've played it, and he hasn't, okay, so but like, what excuse Tim, do I have? If, if you lose, like, this is gonna be <laughs> the biggest, like, you're never gonna financially recover from this. Big Squiggums is on his way. Oh my god, what is that? Oh my god, first reaction ever, what's happening? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, he took the Pack-A-Punch machine. What the fuck? He's gone into the abyss. Oh, I'm going to steal these 100 points from you. Yeah, that's right. You steal those 100 points. Might want to watch your back, by the no, way. No, it was like right... Oh, my God! Fair warning. <laughs> All right. Well, we should be able to get power Wait, can I just, fully can I just on. snipe these things? Or? Well, yeah, yeah, that's round one. They're, they're, uh, these oh, okay. furries are, are very susceptible. Wait, they're one. furries? Oh, my God. Yeah, they're, they're technically called furies, but... Nah, they're furries. They're furries. How are you over there? Go through the portal. The same portal that I showed you earlier. Oh, duh. Yeah, that, that ominous portal. You don't want to go through there. Uh, I, believe me, you won't you won't be touched inappropriately on your way over here. On Ooh. your voyage here. Aw, that's what I'm paying for. <laughs> yeah, I so Chicken Snipe, uh, you're a pretty good player. He's just not experienced with revelations, but he's, uh, he's really into custom zombies and stuff like that. So he's not like a total noob. It's just when it comes to this specific map. When it comes to, like, official stuff, I have no idea. This map kind of looks a little bit familiar, but I can't really put my finger on why exactly. Yeah. Why does this map look so familiar? Yeah, I don't know. Is it because... Uh, maybe it's the lighting? I don't know if you know this, but there are quite a few overpowered wonder weapons on this map. There's the Thunder Gun, the Apothecary Servant, the Lil Arnie's, Ragnarok's, whole plethora of them. And they All are of it? mostly... Oh my God. I think they're all obtainable through the box. So once we get to the box, you're gonna have Ooh. an opportunity to get a very overpowered murder weapon. Uh, there's also contrastly margwas and panzers, elemental margwas too. On top of that, so elemental. What does that even mean? They are colorful margwas that shoot cooler stuff. What the hell now. is even that? There's a lot of minor things. There's a lot of like small Easter eggs to this map that you could try to do. Like there's a bunch of god masks and stuff like that. But I god could masks. not fucking what, care wait, less. What does it do? But what does yeah, it do? You know, there's like a god mask, for example, that gives you a, a stamina boost if you uh, feed a soul box or something oh, like that. I don't remember exactly okay. where it is. Okay. There, there's a bunch of those kinds of things. I am gonna take you down to. All right, fair enough. I can't get any more points for the rest of the game. I'm funny. We're gonna go to origins. Oh, did I say origins? I meant a totally original part of this totally original map. Yo, what is that house though? That's where Monty lives. He doesn't let visitors stop by often. Usually, Whoa. Usually he just lectures Dude, us. Dude, just all of a sudden, the little arrow thing that pointed to where you are just went up. You know what else went up? My self-esteem. Right oh. Thunder gun, thunder gun, thunder gun, thunder gun, thunder gun, thunder gun. Thunder! No fucking way. No fucking way. Why don't you get the Apothecary Servant? Oh, that's actually that's Ripped. substantial though. That's that's a substantial pickup right it there. It is it is nice though. I feel like I should be freaking out a lot more that I just pulled the thunder gun and you called it. You just pulled the thunder gun after saying thunder gun. <laughs> oh, ICR. All right, cool. Uh, so on our on our very way, you know what we could use this game as? Uh, we could use it less as a one v one and more of a I'll teach you revelations, even though you'll probably never play it again. I don't know, Tim. Like. I kind of want to take you down. It'd be a lot cooler if these guys could, like, fuck off a little bit. I know. They're so annoying, and there's so many of them. It's like, what the, what the H? Although I am fucking them up. 
Oh, there we go. That's the end of it. All right, round seven. Pretty good. I think we should be expecting a Margua pretty soon. So if we make our way down here through the tunnels, we're going to transition here into Mob of the Dead, which is Yo. very interesting. And fun fact, a little cool Easter egg, you get to pick up Al's hat, which I'm going to do right now. There we go. We got power station two out of four on. Good job. We're killing it. Now we can go over here. You want to open up this door for me? Um, you know... Don't be a plus, Johnny. Sure. I actually oh, originally yeah. had planned Black Ops Amazing to play Revelations, and he respectfully uh, resigned his position. Uh, so he what, was going to be in the video. I, I don't, I don't know. He said he was busy. Uh, it's, it's cool. Uh, but uh, yeah, I, I planned having him uh, play Revelations, and things got mixed up and schedules and stuff like that. And uh, but I'm glad to have you here. Even Yo, though you've never you played it. Why did you save me like that? I, I don't know. It was just my instinct. Because this is a cooperative mode, and my instinct is to help you. There's too many zombies. Oh, my God. Oh, I'm fucked now. Oh, chicken snipe. Well, oh. shit. I totally didn't do that to kill you. Chicken oh, no. snipe. That's all right. Well, you know what? Congratulations. I actually needed that win because I have been doing really <laughs> fucking poorly. So, nobody, literally nobody's going to give you shit. I mean, this is your first time playing this map. Who cares? Yeah, I, I have literally have never touched this map before. Oh, but one, this is the elemental Margo I was talking about. See this thing? Oh, my God. It's like on fire and shit. Yeah. That's crazy. So anyways, you know, it was literally uh, as I was clicking anywhere but here. <laughs> so, we're going to kill this guy and then kill and ourselves. By, I mean, I uh, idolize. We'll kill ourselves as a... As a token when of you say friendship. We. Uh, open the door! Oh, thank god. Oh. oh no, I went down with a grenade that I I'm accidentally held on purpose. I'm gonna kill this motherfucker before I die. <laughs> there we go. Uh. Alright, nuke. Alright. Stay golden pony boy. I can't say that that was, like, exhilarating, but that was substantial. That was a pretty I cool... Up. What did you learn? Did you learn anything cool about Revelations? I learned that it exists. Yeah, that... Okay. Yep. Yeah. Uh, all right. Any final words for the kids before we move on to oh, Black Ops kiddos. Four? Oh God. Um, stay in drugs. Don't do school. Mm -hmm. Um, eat elderly people. Exactly. And exactly. close your curtains during the daytime. All right. Yes. See you in Black Ops Four. I am joined with the real, the real Noah J. Not to and be confused with the fake. Yeah, not to be confused with the with the various, <laughs> the real Slim Shady. Hey, Noah. This is. I don't think this is our first time speaking. Um, but it's our first time playing, for sure. Yeah. This is gonna be you. This is gonna be interesting. A lot of people in this video I have played with and talked with for the first time. So this is, I mean, goddamn, you're Noah J. It's surreal. I just, I don't want a fanboy. I don't want to. I don't want to be that. But um, I will just say I've been watching. You know, it was you, Lex, Pat. It was all of you guys. It's been a. It's been an honor to just be able to play with all of you guys in the same video too. That's the thing. This this is gonna be a. Uh... How, how long do you anticipate this video being? This is going to be a big boy, huh? It's going to be edited, but even with editing, I, th I think it's going to be well over an hour. Last time I did this with the 30 YouTubers in the 30 maps, we did a starting them challenge. That, that was almost a four-hour video. Uh, but it <laughs> Oh, my God. W while editing. <laughs> there have been some big, like, solo videos and stuff like that. This has got to be, the, like, the biggest collaboration video of all time in Zombies history then, right? Like, yeah, I would number of YouTubers yeah. length and everything. Co it's the, probably the largest collaborative video, I would say. Uh, I mean, you remember Easter Eggs for Charity. That was That's probably the biggest Zombies collab of all time, I would say. Uh, not in terms of, like, quantity, but you know what I mean. Like, yeah, yeah, scale yeah, yeah. and impact. Man, yeah, oh, that, man. Good, good memory. Good memories, man. Zombies have been around for a long time, and I... Has I it has? I I, I I got a couple options from Tim, <laughs> and uh, he he said Voyage was one of them, and I said, you know what? <laughs> I've still talked a lot about Bo4, oh. but I'm willing to go back and and play Voyage. Yeah. And, uh, and and see that this game's not all bad. This map isn't terrible. It's really not. Honestly, I, I don't like it, but it has grown on me a little <laughs> bit. I had to do the Voyage Gauntlet. I'm doing the series where I do the Gauntlets. I did Voyage, and ever since doing that, I have. I, I hate it less. Um, I, I don't fully hate it anymore. I think it's mm. like, I think it's lower bottom, but it's not top five worse anymore, you know? Uh, yeah, but I see I, what you mean. I, I think the main problem with a lot of the BO4 maps is that they are just on the BO4 system. The, the maps themselves, True. I actually like a lot. Yeah. But the it's mostly the map systems and how like the perks work, everything like that, that 
is the problem. Yeah, in my opinion, anyway. I feel you. Like if nine and ancient evil were in the Black Ops oh Three God, engine. Imagine. <sighs> oh, I don't remember how many options I presented to you. I don't know how many were left when I uh, asked you which map you wanted, but there were a couple, and you did choose Voyage. So, and mm. I was glad. I was, I was, I was wondering who was going to pick it because somebody <laughs> had to pick it. And God <laughs> bless you for picking it. Yeah. God bless <laughs> oh, you for I picking forgot. it. Oh, no, I was going to do this. I, 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 you, were, you were saying so many nice things about me right off the start. I forgot that I was going to do this right off the start just to, like, flex a certain dominance. I, I was going to just pop this elixir right off the bat to, uh... Well, this is, this is supposed to be where a zombie shows up, and it's the big reveal. Um, I'm scared. <clears throat> What's going on? Uh... This is where I oh! Are we helping each other um, out? Are we opening up the map? Are we I'm just... Gonna, I'm gonna... I'm gonna be honest. Uh... You won't know until it's too late. Okay. I remember the snake memes. I remember those. Yeah, that was actually the board... The... The... The born. The birth of the snake memes was the, uh... Oh, what? The in plain sights? The, uh, The in plain sights. The, uh... Yeah, there was... There was definitely some snakeage going on between, uh... <laughs> Sneaky. Between John and I in the uh, first room challenges. I'm not buying the door unless you do. Ow. Ow. Oh. I will, I, will, I will do nothing that uh, benefits both. both. Okay. Uh <laughs> See, I'm a player. I'm a, I'm a true player. Let's let's do this. Let's do this, Noah J. Come on. Now, this would be where I bought the Mog. But <laughs> this thing, I, I haven't even used it since. But I apparently, it's awful now. It's trash. Really? Did they nerf it? Yeah. They nerfed it into the ground. Wow. Like horribly when do you know when because uh it was before the end of before modern warfare came out oh why'd they do that they're like you know what we don't want people to enjoy it let's just <laughs> let's just tear it down like everything else that people enjoy he's a shield remember oh shield there we go there we go actually funny enough now you say that uh your shield guide was the one i watched for this map how does that make you feel uh a little bit better actually because it's partially wrong really <laughs> Work for me. <laughs> I, 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 I think there's one spawn point that I either skipped or I gave the same spawn point twice, and that shield guide. Oh, hey, but you know what? Custom mutations made tutorials so much easier for people because you can True. just hop in with a million points and just open up the whole map and just have all the parts at your disposal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were looking out yeah, for YouTubers when they did shield customs. guides. Shield guides are like almost like a I don't I don't know what the right word is shield guides are like a staple of a new map coming out i feel like every <laughs> single time a new map comes out the shield guide is literally the first video that everyone makes i out. don't even know where you are where did you go <laughs> uh we're doing some things boy did you turn on the sentinel artifact yet no no no, no. <laughs> I, I would no. i wouldn't i wouldn't dream i wouldn't dream of activating a sentinel artifact i'm assuming you've done the voyage gauntlet uh yes okay I, I, that, this was the first one that came out right yeah. I think, oh yeah, yeah, it was because then, then everybody uh, proceeded <laughs> to. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Everyone yeah. beat it on the hardest difficulty, flawless, and then uh, I think people were a little upset that the reward was literally a uh, an outline, <laughs> a purple outline, a a, pur a purple sticker. Yeah. It, the, the sticker for the regular difficulty is the same as the one with the hard difficulty, except for the hard yeah. one, they just gave you a purple outline. How? Dude, that's just a slap in the face, quite frankly. That's what that feels like. Well, as far as the Kraken goes, I know that there's a way to get it by doing it manually, Um, but I don't remember how to do that. I know it involves chests, uh, filling up, like, soul boxes or something. I, You know what? Yeah. I'm a, I'm going to go spin the box. I think that's my my route. Yeah, I was kind of thinking, like, I'm pretty sure there's a way that you can, like, get a free Kraken, but I'm not. I think you can only, can you only get one out of the box, or can you get multiple? I, I don't know. That's a good question, actually. I'm trapped. Nice. <laughs> what I'm learning is that we don't actually know very much about this map at all. And you know what? <laughs> Understandably so. <laughs> Ooh. Argus! I got two shotguns. Argus! My question is, why did they add the guns they did into this game throughout the DLCs? Why did they add the Argus? Well, I mean, no, it's the greatest gun of all time, but let's be honest. Why did they add the Argus? Why did they add the Locust? Why did they add the VMP? I feel like they just picked random guns out of a hat, and they're just like, hey, we'll just throw it in. Why not? Yeah. You know? Hey, remember when not one person asked for this? Hey, 
Let's <laughs> put, we're gonna we're gonna make we're, that's the one. Put him in. Dude, do you remember how good the VMP was? We gotta bring it back. Oh, um. So here's something, Noah. I'm gonna be totally upfront with you. I accidentally kept Dying Wish on. I'm not gonna buy it though. Don't worry about me buying it. I'm not gonna cheat. Tim's not a cheater. Uh, okay. Okay. Tim privilege may exist, um, but <laughs> I'm not a cheater. No, I, I I accidentally kept it on, but I'm not gonna buy it. I actually thought it was Zomshell. Whoopsies. Anyways, it's my video. I, I, you don't yeah, have to worry I can about see me how cheating. would be confused. The, as, as they are both very uh, clutch perks or uh, crutch perks rather. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I just got the Kraken. <laughs> Why wouldn't you? You know. <laughs> Listen, I picked Voyage, and Voyage picked me right back. Okay. That's fair. So, it clearly, it clearly is uh, thanking me. It rewarded me. you. Yeah, it, it's thanking yeah. you for, for picking it. It's like the last kid that gets picked for the kickball team at recess. He's like, yeah. hey, you picked me, so I'm going to give you my uh, my Kraken. Yeah, yeah. He, he, he ends up uh, he ends up like being the CEO of like a huge company and hires you in. You yeah, know? his dad works for, uh, for Xbox, for Microsoft. <laughs> his dad is Mr. Xbox. His dad is an Xbox. This is actually tragic because now I can't get my... Uh, my what the hell is it called modifier i can't get my modifier now because i can't buy all four of the perks that's so tragic oh, oh. Yeah. a blind father <laughs> no he's touching me noah no he's touching me i'm gonna die i'm gonna die no 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 rubber ducks you'll be fine rubber ducks and blight fathers you'll be fine i am gonna just have... don't just don't just, walk into the light where is he well. where is he that's i am smart I I died, Noah. <laughs> Tim, I'm not gonna lie to you. I've been training up zombies for about for about three minutes there, and just tried to lead them all to you all at once. I wasn't expecting to beat you, Noah. I mean, you're Noah. Like this isn't something I was expecting to walk in and just defeat you. GG. Congratulations, Noah. You are the winner, and I am just glad that this didn't turn into a three hour game oh my god <laughs> yeah i was like this can go one of two ways it's gonna be an early down or we're going to literally round 50 with uh with upgraded krakens and everything oh so <laughs> jeez anyways noah thank you for joining me in this video uh any final words for the kids any final sentiments uh stay in school uh -huh. don't do drugs and uh subscribe to tim hansen hey thank you i made the mistake of selecting dying wish last time on accident and we have replaced that with zomshell my intended perk i enjoyed with turbo on nine. Oh boy the best black ops 4 map so i'm excited i really am for this i one. thought you were gonna say the best black ops 4 player i was gonna say i'm gonna leave i'll, I'll go i'll leave <laughs> i really embarrassed myself in that voyage game not gonna lie <laughs> well it's voyage so you're not really yeah uh, dude it's a <laughs> map that i would feel you know what i'd feel like a bitch if i won on voyage Fuck there voyage. you go. That's it. You took a stand. <laughs> oh, me. challenges too. I forgot. Challenges. What do we got? No! Knife, Knife kill flags. 13 zombies. Last time we did this video, when we did the starting room challenge, we finished with we Alpha Omega. Alpha. Yeah. And Tog hadn't even released at that time, so you were the final person playing Alpha Omega in that oh, starting room challenge. And we did the best. I'm pretty sure you and I had the entire the yeah, best no, I, re I remember round. when i remember when uh what you call we said didn't, didn't we say like we couldn't drop oh no we dropped from the van <laughs> and alpha mega and people in the comments are like that's not a real starting room you have this to go get, get back on that van you son of a bitch oh what? god i don't even remember calling these motherfuckers in turbo i'm a little slow i actually did summon the champion and then i act all surprised when the champion i was gonna say in. you just said let's go to ron and i was like what else would he do yeah Good on Tim. Good. So you just woke up. You just woke up. It's Fucking good. People God. people don't know we're supposed to be waiting on Lex right now for a last man standing if you if you don't yeah. know why, you know. Um, it's like it's like right we're now. doing last man standing right now though, Turbo. It's just uh it's it, we just minimized it by half the up. people. We're warming up. We're half warming the people up right basically. Oh. They they're, they're okay. still Rabbit's still sleeping when Lex calls the Discord, he'll wake up and um I think we're just warm we're getting our nerves nice and loose, you know? We're getting yes. uh we're getting all the the nerves out. Eat my chakra, bitch. All right, so if I die from the blade trap, just know <laughs> I was trying to do what the Mac told oh, me. Oh, now it's that's my challenge too. Maybe. God damn it! Yeah. I don't, I don't okay, think good, I'm gonna, good, good. I don't think I'm gonna do that. I, I don't even think I, w dude, I have more <laughs> losses than wins now. I cannot afford to do that. 
I am oh, going to resign from Well, my... I think I got my Pack-a-Punch. There we go. Pack-a-Punch strife, bitch. Let's do it. I seriously can't get over the fact that if this map was in Black Ops 3's engine, it would literally oh! be... It would literally okay. be like a top right. three map. All Welcome. right. Thank God I wasn't just dazed for a second. I, uh... Almost went down trying to build your shield. Oh. You know, I try to be a good friend and my shield. shield. <laughs> I mean, listen, you 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 found the pawn. There's still tigers. Yeah, these the motherfuckers. Fuck? There's a tiger around, I think. Come on, come on. That's it. Pack a punch, strife in your anus and your anus. Let's go. Come Tony on. the tiger. Tony Bitch. the tiger. What's your favorite cereal? Favorite cereal? Oh god! I'm not a cereal guy anymore, Me but I do neither. like it. I do like it dry though. I I will put it in a solo cup and chug it. You know, I I, say, I, will, I will do it. The best cereal to eat dry, in my opinion, is cinnamon toast crunch. Okay, because yeah, of it's, course. It's already of very, course. it's already very good That's in and of it. itself. Cinnamon but, uh, toast crunch. And if somebody Fruit doesn't like cinnamon toast crunch, you deserve to be annihilated. You deserve yeah. to have your head chopped off. Apple Jacks is underrated. I really like Apple Jacks. I don't eat cereal, though, in general. Like now, you Apple Jacks is underrated. It's a great cereal, great for a nutritious breakfast, even though I don't believe <laughs> that. When they say that nutritious breakfast, how much sugar are you pounding your body at, like, 7 in the morning? That's nutritious? <laughs> I'm not even a big breakfast guy in general. I... Are you an eggs guy? Do you eat no, eggs? No, 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 no. I, I don't really I, eat breakfast. If I eat fucking eggs and we were taking a road trip together, I would fart the fuck up in the car. Like, the car would be filled with <laughs> turbo fumes. Like, I will I will explode if I eat eggs. I'll explode. I kind of like... I'm not like, like, if I eat breakfast, which is rare, I am a pancake guy. I like having pancakes, oh, waffles. Pa pancakes, waffles, French toast, yeah. anything like that. Yeah, anything. Do Some you, fruit are, are you, on the side. Are fruit, you a pancakes. person... Are you a person that if you have all the ingredients at home, you would make it, or you would just... Easy to go out and just get it? Uh, I would make it if I had the ingredients, but like I said, yeah. normally I just wait till like two or three in the afternoon to eat and I'll have like some, I'll just, it depends. Most of the time I just make a roast beef sandwich, Re roast, roast beef, beef and chicken sandwich. Blight daddy, blight daddy, hello, blight daddy. Uh, I can feel the vibration. I can't hear him. Be that's yeah. the, that's the frightening part about this. Yeah, it's all right. I've got him. I got him. I got him. It's, he's, oh. he's done. He's done. It's over. All right, Tim, time to make the game go a little bit nutty. Newtonian Nugation, let's do it. Oh god, oh god, oh fuck, oh fuck. <laughs> Float up in the air, pansies. Fly, fly like your mother. Fly, motherfuckers. Oh, they're stuck to the ceiling, Turbo. They're stuck to the ceiling, Turbo. Do it, I'm happy. Fly, fly like a pelican. Who's your favorite Get rapper? Who is your favorite rapper of all time? Okay, so I'm white, so you're gonna cringe. Um, okay, let's see. It's okay, um, I'm not judgmental. So, okay, here's the thing. My friends watching this, they're going to be like, he's lying. He still likes it. I like Logic. I liked him a lot yeah. back when he dropped Barry Tarantino 2. When he, anything, Under Pressure. He, One of the greatest yes, everything songs. Before, everything before Bobby Tarantino 2, I loved Logic. He was a great guy. But you, got, you know, he's maybe a great guy. But his music, I loved him. But um, now, I got to be honest with you, now it's not really rap. I mean, if it has to be rap... You know, it's Logic, um, Eminem, um, MG, fucking MGK is all right. Um, <laughs> Every white rapper. What you call it. Yeah, no, I mean, like I said, listen, you're going to start getting cringe. Uh, I don't know. I can um, get behind Logic for sure. I was a huge Logic fan I like through J. high Cole. school. J. J. Cole, J. Cole is another fucking amazing Kendrick one. Lamar. Oh, 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 Tim Trap. Oh, Timothy got around the corner. Oh, oh the these boys are fucking. Floating. Okay. <laughs> The greatest rapper of all time is Brooklyn Zone, the notorious B.I.G. Oh, there you go. I there fucking love go. Biggie so much. I think he's the best rapper of all time. But yeah, I'm not even a huge rap fan. I just kind of like I like all music, basically, except for country. Yeah, well, I, I mean, oh, God, yeah, country can lick my taint. I can't take country. I cannot take country one bit. No country. Oh. My sister's the one that sits in her car and she's like, laid back down and I'm going. I'm like, Dom, Dominique. Calm the fuck down. What are you doing? Like, wh what are you doing? She goes, I like it. I'm like, are you in Tennessee, Georgia, Kentucky, where you can actually listen to this shit? So how long will this documentary be, Tim? Oh, boy. The last one was almost four hours, but this what? is actually going to be I, I, What? So, I forgot it was four hours. What the fuck? How is that even possible on YouTube? Like I don't upload know. a four hour but how long It was did edited that take too. To it wasn't process? it wasn't even raw footage. It was No, just I edited. know. How did that take to even like how did that even like to it took it took like sixteen on hours. Takes longer than the upload. 
It that took, was, whoa. It took almost 16 hours to render and another 16 to upload, almost. Uh, maybe a little less. Maybe like 15 or 14 like hours. Like a two-day thing. Yeah. Jesus. Just to upload the footage. Not even the editing part. The editing? Don't even get me started on the editing. Oh. Uh, I mean, yeah. I love nothing more than making these types of videos, but jeez. <laughs> You really gotta earn this shit. But I lost my head doing this for you people. You come this way, I can find the trap. Oh my god, you could have just killed me, probably. I mean, I could have. Fuck me. Why didn't I think of that shit? <laughs> wow. That. I, I keep thinking we're teaming up. I don't know if I should be thanking you right now or if oh, I should fuck just you. be relieved. I, you see how nice I am and I just get abused. It Do is really speak? easy to forget that we are 1v1ing. I actually yeah. went a while forgetting about that. My sister's on that like TikTok thing. Why don't you like my TikToks? I don't know. I don't know. I, 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 I don't know, Dom. Who gives a fuck? Yeah, dude. Yeah. Honestly, you know what pisses me off more than anything is uh, when you're listening to a song and somebody says, you got that from TikTok. Oh, oh does mean, my blood boil when that happens? Oh I, my fucking god! I I mean, listen, I, there, there are some songs that yeah, like I understood from TikTok, and in my head I'm like, yeah, it's from TikTok, but like, who the, the, that that person can't make that assumption. <laughs> oh, so Tim, too. you know what? This is actually a great time. If, if, if I don't know how many people will get this far on the video, probably lots, but hopefully because I kind of want to um squash this, I get X a ton of how did you and me meet and a lot of people think like i like fucking um like kiss ass you and like found you and like wanted you can you explain to them the first sight you seen me ever uh well the first time we <laughs> saw each other and well, didn't know who we were ZW, zw yeah so there was that but that is sort of unrelated but there's, to but the, 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 I know the first time you like ever commented in my chat because before that I had no clue who you were but I was you go, I'll just go ahead and say it and then you, this is probably what you were gonna say hmm. I was doing a Halloween stream uh, just a mobile Halloween stream and I was dressed up as Freddie Mercury and I just see this random kid Tim Hansen hey what's up going on Freddie Mercury I'm like oh <laughs> I'm like hey Tim Hansen <laughs> ah, <shit. laughs> yeah I remember that it was a Halloween stream like you said and uh I saw this boy dressed up as fucking Freddie Mercury, and I was like, there's something about this kid. <laughs> something about him. And, he doesn't uh, have all his wires intact. I like I, it. <laughs> I think we recorded a video within like a two-week interval after that. Sometime within not too long after I, that. If it, if it wasn't a video, then it was definitely I had you on my podcast shortly after that. Yeah, I think the first time we ever talked without like dms uh in yeah. person was the podcast the first podcast on yeah i it is what it is so yeah that's how that went that was pretty cool um yeah because i gotta tell like how'd you tim me and every time i say oh he saw me in a hollering stream as freddie mercury i get people saying bullshit ah uh, he came all over the pack of punch machine call my aunt marie i gotta clean that off he just came all over the uh. help her gather all my things and bury me in all my faded colors. Oh, it's favorite. My sisters and my brother, Timothy. That was beautiful. You have a brother, right, Tim? I have two. You ever played competitive Call of Duty? Like, mid-cut! He's poolside, poolside! No, I'm straight. <laughs> I mean, this is... Wait, this is competitive Call of Duty when you think about it, so... No, no t I mean, like, <laughs> multiplayer. I mean, like... <laughs> Oh, I mean, no, no. Like, I, like real no, competitive Call of Duty. No, Jesus Christ. I could never. I just... Were you one of those people when, like, you would see those MOG events go on? Like, why do they have this for zombies? No, I don't think video game... I think I think people should be able to enjoy competitive video games. For sure. Absolutely. And it's very profitable. Did you think Call of Duty of should have been allowed in the X Games back then? I... Uh, first of all, I don't even know what X Games is. is the that... X Games, Tim! I think I've heard of it, actually. Like, skateboarding? The yeah, snowboard, yeah, okay. Like, Sports. You jogged my memory again. Yeah. Yeah, Tony Hawk. The yeah. What is it? The 800, the 600, whatever maneuver he did. 300. I don't know. I do think video games should be competitive. Can be competitive. People should enjoy it, and it's very profitable. Me personally, though, I would never fucking compete in. But I have. And that, that's, that's, that, that, that's how that's how my channel started with artificial gaming. When it was a clan channel, that was the clan. It was a competitive Call of Duty clan. Do I have to just like stand near Tim until he goes into like a trap? What do I gotta do? Here? Good news, you don't have to go to the podcast right after this, so you have a little time. <laughs> there you go. I'm not, I Every time rush. we fucking record Last Man Standing, you got the podcast right afterwards. Yeah, thank fucking God. Why don't you come over here, give me a kiss, Tim? Oh yeah. Actually, <laughs> I do need this to complete the challenge. 
I mean, Tim, why don't you just fucking, you know? Though? I really, I, I don't want to risk dying. Hey, Tim, why don't you just, uh... Oh, my God. I, 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 do, 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 I, I. Do, 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 White people music. Is that guitar band? Or like not rock band? The guitar hero. I said guitar band. Hear that? Guitar band. I never played rock hero. I did play guitar. Rock hero. I said rock. Rock. What the fuck is it called? Rock band. I never played. Yeah, rock band. I never played that one. I played guitar hero. Yeah, I was a guitar hero guy. Yeah. I needed the colors on the buttons. I couldn't just do the colors on the side now. My friends and I would play the that. same song all the time to the point where we perfected it. We played Hotel California by the Eagles. Hotel California. On Guitar Hero. You played with Guitar Hero 4? Which one you, which one you played I, a lot? I really couldn't even tell you, honestly. Was it was one like so Slash? Ah, uh, I remember it. I remember the cover of it being like orange, if that helps at all. That might not Not help. really, but continue. Yeah, he, my friends and I... It's like half of our childhood is going into his basement. Uh, he had oh, little, dude. He had the whole drum kit, the, both the guitars, oh, even the microphone. Oh, that's what I didn't have. I, I, we only had two guitars. We didn't have a fucking um, b the kit. Nah, damn. Ah, uh, yeah. Good dude, I, that's the one fucking thing I want. Like, isn't there a way you can get a guitar for the PC and play Guitar Hero? Probably. Probably. Yeah, I, I want that. Boom. Clap, sound the my heart. The beat goes on and 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 <laughs> oh man, he just stuck his big old tongue out. You know <laughs> oh, and he got you! Got him! Yes! 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 I legitimately think this game yes! is fair. Can some yes! Can somebody explain to me how this is fair? He just stuck his tongue and f***ed him! I... Yes! I don't understand. Oh, it feels good. It took 33 does it, years. Does it feel good? Number one. I had my shield out. Okay. Number two, I uh -huh. had a fully charged Winter's Whale. Okay. Number three. You're dealing with a blight, Daddy. I I'm got sure. one hit. Hey, just in time for Lex. He's awake. Good. <laughs> All right. Well, hey, GG. Uh, congratulations on beating me. You're not the first one. Um, <laughs> good God. I am just... I am racking up losses like you wouldn't fucking believe, man. I am losing left and right, but... Uh, you saw what happened, man. I got fucked. <laughs> I got fucked. Uh, Turbo, any final words for the kids? Um, keep your nose clean. Um, vote for Nixon and uh, just be respectful to your chinchilla. <laughs> Hello, guys. We're on Blood of the Dead. I'm with Fat Matt. Um, Hi. He chose Blood of the Dead because he is a Blood of the Dead fanatic. One would say. I made a mistake. Yeah. I made a mistake. It's all good. I, I realize it now. You know what's really scary is the catwalk. <laughs> the catwalk could be scary. That it, could be the down right there. It's a recipe for an early down, that catwalk, if you're not I careful. feel like you might just run there and insta down and not play this map. <laughs> what are you running? What gun do you got? What perch do you got? What specialist do you got? I got, do you got? I got a Strife chilling there, and then I have the Katana, and then my perks in order from Brew to Tonic are PhD, Time Slip, uh, Victoria's Tortoise, and Winter's Whale. Winter's Whale in the modifier is actually sick. Dude, it's, it's a really fucking good. tornado. I, I actually learned that the other day. I didn't know that until last week when I was doing this Easter egg on stream. And someone was like, yo, put Winter's Whale in your modifier real quick. I was like, okay. And then I was like, oh, shit. You know what doesn't make sense about this map is that Wraith Fires Everything. are pretty much better than the Hell's Retriever. So... I don't get why in this game in general you can only have one throwable object. Yeah. I don't even know what to call it, but you can't you can't have you nades can't and monkeys. You can't have nades. monkeys and the Hell's Retriever and Wraith Fires. It's 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 like why, why on earth do you make us choose one? I mean, Wraith Fires are better, and you spawn in with them by default. So what is the incentive for me to actually go for the Retriever right now? When you really think and. Yeah, why are we even doing? And upgrading the Retriever is not even worth it. Did you get yeah. the power on them. Okay, yeah. cool. Dude, this might actually be the rip. We have no katanas or Ragnaroks here. Uh, I actually have mine. I have my Ragnarok. Ugh. Ugh. Oh no. Okay, there we go. I'm pulling it out. I don't care. 
Ow. I hate the hands. I hate the little hands that... Oh, I agree. Yo, I actually have an idea. Hold on. I'm not gonna kill anything. I'm just gonna run past with my katana, and you're gonna have a ton of fucking zombies to deal with. <laughs> wow. Thank you. Christmas came early. Did it work? Did it work? Ah, uh, I think it gotta work. No. Eh. No. They're, they're still they're going they're for you. they kind of chasing me. <laughs> yeah, whatever. You feed this dog, I'll go grab the park. We'll get this thing Sounds going. Sounds good. Man. Strategy. Strategy. I'm looking Easter for the ghost jizz. Where's the ghost jizz? It's one of the shield cards. Um, probably pilot by the warden. I, I, I don't understand you. I don't know I refer to it as ghost jizz and you understand I was about to say. About. Yeah, and and the fact that they put oh, it in the liquid it. divinium tube. I don't get it. You pick it up, it's just straight jizz, and then you, you really pick it up and it's a, in a tube already. It's like, when did that happen? Yeah. That, I think oh my god, to I'm red screens. I'm red screens. I am. Oh my god. Matt. Matt. I almost sneezed. I couldn't see anything. That's be what that careful, sound Matt. was. Okay. <laughs> I think you want me to die. I, well, you know okay. what? I don't. I don't want to die. And the only way this ends is if one of us dies. So, or if the game it's crashes, like it did options. on Horizon Drag. Die! You bald asshole. He's wearing a helmet, dude. He's probably. Oh, I knocked it off. Up oh, there's the other side. Okay, there you go. Right, he's probably self-conscious about it. Yeah, he's dead now, so he's not to be self-conscious about it. He literally... I don't know, dude. He has no fashion. He wakes up every day and just puts barbed wire on. I don't know how you could do that. <laughs> that sounds really like, painful. <laughs> seriously, he's like, oh, I'm gonna put my barbed wire on for the day. Oh, shit, I didn't even turn the power on over here. I forgot there's two power switches. That's another thing I love about Blood, by the way, Matt. Two power switches. Ooh, sarcasm? Yeah, that was sarcasm. <laughs> It's not as bad as Zetsubo though. The Zetsubo power. That is Zetsubu? true. Whoa. Zetsubu. That is. No! No! Te no! Oh! Oh my God! Hold up. I don't even have. <laughs> okay. Does it? I oh, never. No, I was about to say. I fucking died. Um. I pulled out my specialist. Funny enough, and I still died. For the oh, because this game's broken. We're playing yeah. Black Ops 4. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, I thought that shit would work. <laughs> I pulled out my Ragnaroks. They were physically in my hands for two se full seconds before I died. So I'm really happy about that. No, good, good game, Matt. I'm like, yeah, GG. Semi relieved that uh, blood is over. I should have picked a better map, but whatever. No, it's it's chill. Like someone had to pick it, so I mean. I'll live with it. I'll live with my decision, I guess. Yeah. Hey, I got right. the dub, so. Yeah, Matt. Um, I would say like uh, you got anything to say, anything to plug? Obviously, uh, check him out. His uh, YouTube link is in the description. Uh, if you have anything to, any closing statements, I suppose. Um. That was fun. Thanks for having me on and never play Blood of the Dead again. Guys, we are on Five Reimagined? F Reimagined. Five e Remastered. Five no, e yeah, Reimagined, we're actually. On, yeah. we're, on, we're on Classified and uh, enjoyed cool. with Jack the Bus. This game right. was pretty smooth. I guess I haven't yeah. played BO4 in so long. Well, you three picked a good map. Nice well, you didn't pick it because you were actually one of the final people who got chosen. Yeah, so. but this is like this is probably like one of my like the maps I would have chosen honestly if I did. Yeah, this is definitely the Black Ops Four map to play if you don't want to get a headache. True, actually, I don't know. I never had a big problem with like nine's, blood or nine, anything. Nine's good. Uh, Ancient Evil. Yeah, I like nine's a lot, good. But it's, it's still pretty complicated. Most of the maps are pretty complicated. Ancient game. Evil has like a cult following. I don't get it. I just, <laughs> I I think it's a good map. I don't think it's insane. But yeah, it's, a lot of people like come to BO4 just for Ancient Evil. It's wild. It's Derizen Drac 2.0, and Derizen Drac is sort of Origins 2.0. So it's like the 2.0 of the 2.0. That's understandable. Oh, yeah, you can spawn in with the shotgun. That's right. Dang, dude. Black Ops 4 was its own kind of creature. Yeah, yeah. That's so weird. Yeah, I, uh, you want to open that? Uh, I want to open that door there. Oh, pack a bunch of parts. Here we go. Oh. oh, you did. Wait, which door did you open? Oh uh, shoot! Went the far away. There's two ways. Oh, we're also Becky. gonna be experiencing some hellhounds. This box. I believe. Oh yes, that's right. Those are on this map. Still yeah. disappointed they didn't have the thief on this map. I know. That was one of my favorite parts of the original. Uh, exactly. I tell people that the original they think I'm five. Crazy. It's he was such a good challenge. I liked it. Yeah. I, was, I always remember like fear just being instilled in me from such a young age of that that sound and like the smoke and all that. Why did they put out Victorious Tortoise? I guess in my brain I thought it was a good idea, but now that I'm thinking about it, yeah, now you have to build a shield. <laughs> oh, boy. Gotta give me a shield. I don't know how I feel about that. I saw some guys replacing Vaughn supposedly. Oh really? I don't know. Uh, I don't know if it's now or if it's later. But Vaughn confirmed that some dude would be replacing him eventually, which is 
weird because I couldn't picture like he's been in COD and like Treyarch for so long it'd be weird to picture him doing something else. But yeah. I guess Jason's gone. Jason See, everybody's really upset that Jason Blundell is gone. I look at the positive side of it and you know what? I'm kinda glad. I said Really? It. I'm glad. Because everybody runs like the course. Fresh take? Yeah, dude. It's just new blood. Like it doesn't really matter yeah. who it is specifically. It's just Bring a change life. of scenery. Like yeah. Zelinsky had some bangers, but he he ran out. He burnt out <laughs> True, yeah. at the end there. So he yeah. needed to be gone. And that's what happened to Blundell, in my estimation. So some new blood will yeah, kind of breathe it. something into the map, yeah. Pig. Hopefully that doesn't curse me. I just killed the pig. Where I am right now in the in the porcine labs, the pig labs, it's actually a pretty good mm -hmm. place to train down here. And of course the war room is probably the most ideal place. Yeah, the war yeah. See the labs always scared me too much to train. <laughs> like just in general That's you get pretty... novas down here uh at least in oh, the original true. five in the original yeah. five if you don't train downstairs you don't get novas which is huge yeah it's huge I forgot about that god now i'm just having flashbacks to like exploring this map and like easter egg hunting thinking there was more to it when it wasn't like anything insane you didn't god. jack you, you didn't know you just had to get up to around 150 what the yeah heck? right oh what an intriguing easter egg step I remember like looking the at these rooms and stuff. I'm like, there, there must be more. Like we we have to do this puzzle and uh and, and this and this. No, just just play it. No, just just, li li just literally play the game the exact way you would normally play it, and you'll do the Easter egg genius. if you have 14 Absolutely hours genius. of your life to spare. And every single one of these recordings with the one v ones. I end up dying every time I open. Like I'll open up the entire map. I'll work really hard to do that, and then I'll just fucking die. <laughs> <laughs> like for example, as soon as you finish, yeah, on uh, Shadows with Johnny, he fucking sat there with his thumb in his ass the entire game while I did everything. <laughs> I did everything on the entire map, and I get killed. Uh, He's just sitting there twirling his thumbs, doing nothing. And it's like, oh, thanks, society. John. I mean, we're enemies, but like, you want to fucking contribute <laughs> to your own health survival? What's saw the Winter's Howl go by? Echo Hawk Dual Boar. Isn't that the one that reloads automatically? I don't even remember. Yeah, I don't know. He's got like, these gun name Echo Hawk Dual Bo Dual Board. That sounds like a randomly generated name. You used to spin the box and be like, "Hey, I got the Spash 12 or "Hey, I got the Spectre." Now it's, "Hey guys, I got the Dual Hawk es Escobar X Pablo 12,000." <laughs> Elon Musk's son. <laughs> X12Z9580. <laughs> That's what I fucking got out of the box. You know, I was thinking, I'm pretty close to pack-a-punching. I have almost five grand, and then I remembered, oh, wait, it's 15 fucking thousand to upgrade your gun to get the fullest damage out of it. So, oh, yeah, the triple pack, dude. Yeah. It's just like, all right, cool. Yeah, oh you're going to have to save up more of your pennies there, sonny. Bam, bitch. Yeah, remember when Jason just assumed we all knew that? It's oh like, guys, uh, why, aren't you, uh, yeah. why aren't you playing the game the way I designed it? <laughs> There are very few things that are more infuriating than that. A developer, <laughs> a, no, dev, Jason. a dev just expecting you to know shit like that. He's like, he's like it gives you a bloody speed call ability as well. It's like, oh, really? <laughs> Thanks. That's cool. I know that now after a month of playing. <laughs> oh, there's a nuke. I will Hiroshima this bitch. I will probably cut that out. I don't, I don't know. It depends how I feel when I'm editing. If it I always, remember. It, I always, it always depends how I feel when I'm editing. I still haven't used one Mega Elixir in this game. Not one. I rarely use them just because, I don't know, the, the classics are just, they're good enough, you know? Yeah. I don't know. You don't even think about them either. It's not like Gobblegum uh -huh. where they're so... In such, such a big difference. In game, yeah. And, and this, it's like, oh, you want to be able to escape? Okay, there's an extra little bonus, but like other than Yeah, that, actually though. Oh hell yeah. Micro MG nine millimeter. You, what are you, these weapons? Did you just get that? Because I just did too. The yeah. Exact same time. I don't think I've ever used this. It's like a delayed trigger. That's weird. This is kind of a cool weapon though. I like yeah. this. I had absolutely no strategy going into this. This is my perk setup beforehand, except <laughs> for the the revive one, which I switched to like whatever electric cherry is. I forget what this, whatever this discount electric cola burst. is. Electric burst, God. If you're gonna copy like the first word to change the whole name, like actually. Mm -hmm. It just makes it feel discounted at that point. Yeah, you know what my theory was with, if you're going to copy, uh, Treyarch perks from the past like for example if you were uh, 
IW Zombies or AW Zombies, instead of coming up with your own bullshit names, you should just minimize the name. Like, so for example, people don't really call Jug Juggernog. So whereas Treyarch calls it Juggernog officially, you could call it just Jug. J U G. Just call it Jug. And not only would it like just be simplified, but like it would just be cooler, honestly. And then it would feel yeah. For Speed Cola, just call it Speed. For Electric Cherry, just call it Cherry. I know it wouldn't make a ton of sense. It would make a ton of sense for like new. It'd be more like less infuriating than Electric Burst. Yeah. I just, you know, I, I'd fear maybe the noobs wouldn't get it. They'd be like, well, Cherry, what the fuck's yeah. Cherry? But, like, I mean, for the vast majority of players, it would just be a lot better. The vast better. majority of Zombies players are pretty passionate about the game, yeah. Echo Hawk, Dual Boar. <laughs> That's so funny to me. So fucking stupid. I saw that. Just... Such a wild name, dude. Sounds like a, a roller coaster. <laughs> <laughs> The gun sounds like a roller coaster. I think you're doing something this wrong. This spring, the Echo Hawk Dual Bore. <laughs> the fastest roller coaster in the world. In the world. Before I even pushed the button to the elevator, one zombie just turned around and gave up. He's like, okay. I see you're leaving. <laughs> I won't bother you anymore. <laughs> Message is clear. This is such a weird pathing. You, wait, was that your nuke? Yeah. I'm gonna be honest, I was about to die. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding was, me? I was right about the, I didn't have my I didn't have my uh Come on, it could have been over <laughs> I was like oh shoot it doesn't get bad you just like say we have to stay in like the like the starting room or something <laughs> yeah. That'd be pretty chaotic Yeah I always have to fucking revise it I always gotta go Alright new <laughs> challenge starting room challenge now it's like, Jesus Christ. If we get to 30, we might consider that. The strat for Black Ops 4, the high round strat, is pretty much just grab a Helion Salvo, have PhD Slider, Stone Cold Stronghold, sit, don't move a muscle, and just spam this thing. Mm -hmm. That's basically what it is. This is better than every Wonder Weapon in this game. There's a couple cheese strats in BO4. Yeah. I haven't bothered to do any of it. I've never high rounded in this game once. Not even, not even on, like, easy mode with 300 HP. Just... Just like I just I, don't love high rounding. Yeah. I don't know. I'm one of those people that likes a, a brief game, whether it be a challenge yeah. or a whatever it is. Yeah, I'm like, not a big knowing. fan of high round. I just I just like knowing that I'm not going to be sitting still for four hours straight or longer. Yeah, like Lex is doing all those high rounds right now. I don't know how he has the patience. He's doing like a hundred on like every map or something like he, that. Yeah, he takes breaks. Granted, like he he does them in several sittings. Some of them he mm -hmm. records. Some of them he doesn't. Mm -hmm. So, but you know, like one time I did an Ascension high round stream, it got to 100, it was Black Ops 3, classic gobblegum only, it took me 8 fucking hours straight of just sitting down. Yeah. And let me tell you, now that I proved to everybody that I'm capable of doing it, I am not going to do it again. Never I mean, doing it again. It's just not something <laughs> that interests me. Yeah. People, people, I only did it because people were like, you can't do it, that's why you haven't done it. Okay, bitch, I'll show you. All I need is 8 hours of free time. Ooh, I got the ray gun. Oh my god. Oh, let's go! That's crazy. Hype! Right? Let's Hype go. in 2012! Let's go, uh, I'm actually considering pack-a-punching now. I think I might just do that. Okay. Having the ray gun in Black Ops 4 to me just feels illegal. <laughs> Why? It doesn't feel like I should be able to use this thing. It's, it's just, a modded weapon. It's like such a, <laughs> it's such a, it's just so watered down compared to what yeah. it used to be. It just feels wrong. Kinda sad. He says like a washed up drunk, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Kinda sad. Some empty guy shell. who's just some guy who's living his high school memories still. Yeah, still in his hometown. <laughs> still kicking around, asking people for five bucks here and there. <laughs> oh god, that's what the ray gun is nowadays. It's sad. It's fucking sad. <laughs> there used to be a point in time when people really were sad. genuinely excited. Uh, he was like the he was like the quarterback of the football team. Yeah. Captain. Prom king. He was getting mad bitches in junior year, senior <laughs> year, and then all of a sudden. It's like, where where did the time go? Now he's hitting on uncomfortably young women. Yeah, now he's looking for women at uh, <laughs> his local convenience store. It still blows my mind that we haven't had an original Ether map ever since Gorod Krovi. <laughs> it's kind of sad, honestly. That is fucking pathetic. That, that's just like, <laughs> how does that even happen? How does that, how is that allowed? Such a sad testament to what zombies and, and it's into. not even it's not even like it's been like one or two maps since garag Krovi. it's been what uh at least 10? yeah wow 10 
10 maps. I was going to say it's like 6 or 7. I guess it has been like 10. Yeah, because Revelation has and eight then maps. all Black Ops 4. Yeah. So around 9 or 10, yeah. Raygun only requires one pack, I think. Right? Yep. All right. It has probably the worst camo I've ever seen. That's okay. Two out of five. Good God. Up. Oh, there's already fucking zombies here. Hello. Wait, let's make this impossible, said Treyarch. It's my turn. Eh, eh, eh. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. <laughs> I got a little shaky there for what a I'm, second. What I'm doing right now is don't do it at home, kids, because this is a recipe for death. Playing a dangerous game there, Timmy. Let's see. Yeah, I forgot how many barrels are just chilling here. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Grab it, grab it. That's four out of five. Four out of five. <laughs> You're just packing it all. <laughs> uh. Five out of five. Let me pick it up. Let me pick it up. God damn it. There we go. Holy shit. You haven't yeah. played much Modern Warfare, right? I haven't even touched the game yet. Yeah. Which is it's a uh, pretty solid game. Hey, uh, hey, thank you for finally pulling out the fucking specialist. I just pressed 20 buttons and it finally worked. My controller just shit. I mean, it was, it was nervous. My, uh, the last, I used to actually upload videos on Blackout, but I slowly realized that every Blackout video I ever posted was just filled with sweaty tryhards in the comments telling me, uh, this or that, <laughs> how, how I'm shit at the game for doing this differently. And eventually I just came to the conclusion that although the blackout community although the entire blackout community isn't toxic the vast majority of it is that's just brs so, in general yeah too. that's the thing it's not it's not exclusive to uh blackout um yeah but most brs are just i mean it's quite literally just the sweatiest multiplayers i remember posting blackout videos and people would literally they would look at my stats they would they would look at my gamer tag or my psn they would go to my profile no. They would look at my stats and then they would comment Hell and they'd be like, no. they'd be like, this guy's shit. He doesn't have 8,000 wins. <laughs> oh, God. Like, I think, yeah, in, the, I think in, the, right. in the first month, Blackout was, like, out. I think I maybe had, like, 10 wins, maybe a little less, which is not great. Mm -hmm. But that's, I also. That's not bad, though. I didn't play it every day, all day. That's the thing, too. I, yeah. I would play it kind of just uh, casually. And so people mm -hmm. would, like, look at my stats and they would just call me shit and say that my opinion was instantly. I had no credibility because <laughs> no credibility I didn't have, at like, all. hundred yeah. wins or something. <laughs> it's like fuck you. <laughs> like I'm, I was done with the blackout videos. I was like, ah, this is not for me anyway. I feel like eventually it's like, my, like Warzone is really popular now. I feel like that'll turn to like what Fortnite is now, where it's just a bunch of people that are really dead inside that just that have accepted that the game's different. So I think um, it's official. I think when we hit round thirty, if one of us has not perished by then, it is going to be. An official draw. Actually, official not draw. well. Not when we reach thirty, but when we finish thirty. So when it technically hits thirty-one is when it'll be considered a draw, if we mm. don't die. And at that rate, um, we'll we won't kill ourselves, but we'll do a final stand and just no matter who wins, it'll still be a draw. You want me to yeah. test it? I'll test sliding through the trap. I'll let you know how it goes. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Uh, let's figure it out. You can eat pig. I'll be chilling. That was anticlimactic. Oh. Oh, it takes you to 50 health. I'm gonna be honest, my plan was- my plan failed. I had that elixir that negates trap damage. So I was hoping you have that, that was equipped? supposed to do. Yeah. <laughs> I was hoping that it would do 200, and I was gonna slide through it, and you'd be like, oh, it's safe! <laughs> wow, that uh, almost worked. Yeah, Although, I know, right? That was close to work. <laughs> I thought in this game you couldn't die under a trap anyways. Yeah. In Black Ops 3, I think you can. Okay, we hit round 31, so it is officially a draw. That was... Let's go! We said. All right, so uh, where do you want to do like a little final stand? Where do you want to kill ourselves? i say in the conference room. Conference room. Or we could try this... No, I'd say the circle, but there's a teleporter. I'd rather take... <laughs> rather take a draw than a loss, to be honest. Conference room? Is that where we're going? Let's go to. Let's the do the mall. elevator. Let's do the elevator. The elevator? What? My what, God. What better way? I'm on my way to defend with a crossbow. Oh, oh no! Jack! Ah. Fuck! <laughs> defend our family! The light is getting so bright! Oh, I know where to go. And thus, I take my exit. Don't worry, Jack. <clears throat> I'll, I'll die the way you wanted me to die, man. 
I'm dying the way you wanted me to die. A true man of culture. Oh, boy. 31 rounds. That was a draw. Uh -oh. That was a draw. Jack, thank you so much for joining me. Guys, check out his link in the description. Do you want me to plug Jack the bus, or do you want me to plug uh, I should <sighs> Honestly, it doesn't even matter. You take your pick. I'm going to plug iShinobi. He uploads reaction go. videos to anime over there. Some pretty cool stuff. And that is where you're most active, of course. So I'll plug that. Yeah, instead. right now. Uh, but he also has Jack the Bus's actual YouTube uh, gaming channel. So thank you so much for joining me. Any final words for the kids? Um, Don't slide into traps unless I tell you to. Ladies and gentlemen, Dead of the Night with... Your boy, J.R. Rizzo. And I am excited. I'm scared, but I'm excited. The number one thing I'm not excited for, though, the fucking Nosferatu's on round 12. I'm not, I'm not looking forward to that. No, they're fine. Honestly, I, I love this map so much, except for the, like, the Nosferatu's single-handedly ruined this entire map for me. I know that might be, like, an over-exaggeration, but, like, I honestly, I think I would rather, what would I rather do? I think I would rather... I think I'd rather chop my own dick off than deal with the Nosferatu's. Sounds crazy. But a little bit. It sounds true. a little bit hyperbolic. It's, it's just a video game, man. No, no, this is real. This is real life. Honestly, every time I play Dead of the Night, I just stay in the spawn room until round 12, and then when the Nosferatu spawn in, that's when I flee. And then, by that rate, I haven't set up or done anything, and then I just get overwhelmed round and 12? die. And then I go on Twitter, and then I bitch about how much I don't like this map, even though it was entirely my fault. Hey, that's me. Let me pick your brain a little bit. What What are your honest opinions on Black Ops 4 as a whole, and also Dead of the Night as a whole? Oh, boy. Yeah, oh here boy. come the big questions. <laughs> the big well, questions. I think Black Ops 4 is the worst game I've ever played that I really like. Okay, that's... like the, I get the that. The designs and the balance of the game and the perks and... Player health and zombie speeds. It's so mm -hmm. terrible. Yeah. But it is pretty fun. Yeah. I, I can definitely see where you're coming from there. Like, I love this game sometimes when I'm playing it, but it's hard for me to ever go out of my way to actually play it. But when I am, it's like, ah, I mean, it's not terrible, but then, like, I, I get what you mean. Dude, you know what's crazy? I only, I think I know one character's name on this map. Like, I know Godfried, but, like, I don't know any other character's name on this map or their origin. Granted, it's sort of my fault for not really looking into it or caring much, but, like, I mean, usually with characters, yeah, saying you know World their War II names. Zombies is boring. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I know you're a big World War II zombie fan. I, yeah, yeah. yeah. But I get why people don't like it. It's fine. Yeah, I like Groston House a lot, actually. That's my favorite map, just because of how simple it is. But the rest of that game, I don't know. To be fair, I haven't played any... I haven't played many of them. Um, Wait, you haven't played the whole DLC season? No, I played the Final Reich, Groston House, and that was it. So, I, really? honestly, I can't really give a, a very valid, sound opinion on World War II zombies as oh. a whole. But game mechanic-wise... Oh, I could go on for days on how well designed World War II is from a gameplay stance. Yeah, well, the, the built-in double hit prevention, the slower zombie walk speeds—they take longer to actually strike you instead of just being in like four frames. Oh, it's great. Mm. Although in the note track or the yeah, sorry, not yeah, note track, uh, the attack animation for whistlings, the note track is set to I think frame thirteen. Which means that you have 13 frames to get out of the way of a whistling attack before it hits you. And oh, a game wow. running at 30, at a, well, the animation is built at 30, so that'll be 26. Huh. Did I lose you at some point? Well, <laughs> I'm listening. I, I just, it's, you know, fuck, <laughs> I don't know. I, I, I'm just used to hanging out with uh, buds who know... It, uh, they're just as <gasps> I found horrible, it. degenerate nerds about these games as I am, so... They're like, oh yeah, that nonsense you just said makes sense. Alice is falling, out of the box, come on, I don't feel like getting it the regular way, because quite frankly, I don't even know how. <gasps> the Essex! Hell yeah! I got the Essex! Look at this! Oh! Hell yeah, dude! The number one thing that honestly frustrates me about this game the most, which is like, kind of a ridiculous thing to get frustrated over, is just having to purchase a shield. On, like, over and over again. Oh, you too? God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> it's just to me it just it's like the kick is it's like the biggest kick in the dick it's like hey your shield's gone you have to pay more the next time and then more and then more after that until eventually the shield costs like five grand it's like when does it even it end sure does. oh boy okay all right i'm in the danger zone rizzo i'm in the danger zone there's a lot of vampires then they're pissed off why didn't you just wait for me to come over there i could have helped you out bud 
I I don't know, but they're pissed off. I do have a specialist though, so it's good. Uh, <laughs> never mind, you're fine. Fuck off! Do you know how many mini Easter eggs there actually are on this map? Like I can. Oh god, no. There's so many. There's literally there's too many to keep track of, and nobody cares yeah. about them because there's too many. So it's like, what's even the point? There's a werewolf! Ho -ho! Oh. oh my god, I'm gonna run towards oh, you. You opened the funny thing, didn't you? Yes, he's pissed. He's fucking pissed. But when isn't he? He sure is. It would be a shame if I just let him, if I did nothing. <laughs> It'd be a damn shame, wouldn't it? Oh, uh, I, I, I don't feel good about that. Oh. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, you have a specialist. That's helpful. Yeah, I'm good. Alright, oh. he's done. Wow, he's dead as fuck. I think that's the biggest example of Treyarch misunderstanding their game. Like, Jug's a crutch, it's bad. No, no. Getting a, an increase in health, that's called game progression. <laughs> there needs to be a thing that you're constantly going for. You need to feel vulnerable in the early game. So that, you know, exactly. you, you're a little bit careful going in. And then, of course, once you get Jug or whatever, you can feel a little bit more confident. Crutch perks will always exist, no matter what you do. Like, personally, Absolutely. Dying Wish is, is a crutch perk. I always run it, and I always generally run the same, like, three or four other perks with that as well. So it's not yep. like I'm... It's not like I, every game I head into Black Ops 4, like, alright, let me try this this time, and that this time. No, it's just, yeah. it's still the pick-your-favorite-four type of deal. Yeah. So. Like, I get what they were going for, I just think they did it wrong. Yes, absolutely. And I, I'm totally behind the idea of making Jug a, uh, a different like a different way of obtaining it. I think World War II did it pretty good with Guy's Child. Mm -hmm. um, and I, I like the idea of getting rid of Double Tap as a perk and just making it so your weapons are stronger. Mm -hmm. But it's not fun to sit at the Pack-a-Punch five times longer than normal. I think Black Ops 4 has a lot of cool ideas, it just it didn't execute many of them well. And hopefully, in the next one, they they learn where they went wrong and use it as a way to make something really great. Because yeah. their map designers at this point are really good. Mm -hmm. Except Blood. Oh boy. Oh, I hate Blood with pretty much every fiber of my being. I gotta Too ask, are we allowed to intentionally fuck each other over? Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah. <laughs> There's no rule. All right, have noted. To There's no uh, rule where... I'm gonna die right now anyways. Oh, never mind. I'm oh, good. Sick. Uh, there's no rule where you have to be very pleasant to each other, because this is a fucking, you know, 1v1. You can fuck me over if you so choose. I'm probably going to die on my own merit here. I think that's another problem with Black Ops 4, and kind of 3, is how essential having this shield is. Oh, I would I, I would say it's a lot more essential in this game, but yeah, like the fact that you literally can't live without it. There's a perk revolved around it, which just goes to show yeah. like you need to have it at all times. I think you you can tell how so how well designed uh, Treyarch Zombies is by how how much do you need the shield? If the answer is you absolutely need it, the game is designed like shit. Yeah. Oh hey werewolf, what's up? And the fact that you need it and the price increases over time to me is just like an extra slap in the face. Oh hi werewolf! Oh you we both got one, Nito. Cuck! Oh, damn it! Oh, oh, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna rub in your face, don't worry. I'm just gonna come over That's to you. That's fine. I'm gonna come over to you, I'm gonna come over to you. And no, like, don't you dare, don't you dare. Dude, dude, don't, don't dude, dude, don't dude. Don't, 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 don't teabag me, dude. Dude, seriously, don't teabag me in games. Dude, come on, dude, seriously, dude, come on, dude, dude. I'm a cool gamer boy, you can't fuck my ego like that. I'm an influencer, I have a very, very sensitive one. All right, all right, all right. Here's what I'm gonna do. Oh shit! Am I even gonna be able to revive? You? <laughs> you're gonna fucking go to hell, is where you're going. Oh wait, no one is. Oh, all right, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you, and we're gonna both kill ourselves. That's the tradition around here. Oh, so you when, mean, when we like right when here? the game's over, we're all Are dead. Are these nuts? Yep, yeah. yep, yep, yep. I'm gonna die regardless. Up oh, there goes. The I'm gonna game. be honest. I set that fire trap up like 30 minutes ago, waiting for the right time to throw you into it. Oh, thank you. Appreciate that. Well, that's the game. <laughs> no uh, yeah. Fuck. All right, um, that was Dead of the Night. I, I think that was wholesome. Anything past round 20 for these challenges, I applaud. I really think past round 20, not one person downing. I mean, we're YouTubers, but like, still kind of respectable. Thank <laughs> you so much, Rizzo, for joining me. You have the of floor. Course. If you like want to say or do or st any messages, morals for the children, uh, the floor uh, is open oh, to you. Oh, okay, morals for the youngins. All right, yeah. let me crack my hips and my ankles and... Get uh, some Arnold Palmer. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> don't do drugs. Nope. What the fuck are you talking about? Drugs are just awesome. No, don't. Don't. <laughs>
depends. Don't do drugs, kids. Depends what kind of drugs. But, do a little uh, bit of drugs. Most drugs see, are bad, okay? See if you like them. Prescription drugs are okay if they are prescribed to you. If you're, we're all gonna die eventually anyway. What's another five years off of it, right? Yeah, yeah. Anyways, uh, <laughs> that's horrible. <laughs> yeah. We are joined with Newbie Gaming here on Ancient Evil, which is actually precisely the same map he did last time with me. He chose it again because Ancient Evil is his quote baby. So um, we're gonna be doing a one v one instead of a starting room on Ancient Evil this time around. You ready? No. Nah. Want to come over here and open up this door, Newbie? Huh? Yeah, you open up that way. Yes. Why is there something wrong with oh, this way? Oh my gosh, you're a troll. Is there yeah, something you go the wrong with this way? What is a stink over faster. here or something? We're doing a speed run. That way's faster. Why do you have the? Oh man, the rubber duckies again. Man, what is it? Why do you always pick that one? It's unique to Bio4. This is what makes <laughs> Bio4 the greatest game in zombies history. Hi, oh. Tim. What? Why? 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 <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Tim. Have fun out there. Stay safe. Be back by nine. <laughs> okay, Mom. Is Ancient Evil your favorite Black Ops 4 map? Yeah, by far. Ooh. ooh. It, of all time? Where is that? Uh, uh, probably third favorite map of all time. Mm, what's ahead of that? Drives and Drak and Mob the Dead? <laughs> Dries and Drak's top. Oh, wow. And then probably oh, this is gonna sound stupid, but town. Town. That's a yeah, weird Dragon jump Drag from ancient evil to town. <laughs> Dragon Drag Town, ancient evil. God, how do I do this? I totally forgot. Um, how, how do you not remember how to do the hands? I'm. I know. I have the hand. How the hell do I? I'm here, and I. How do I? Get yeah. Over? How do I get? I'll, I'll come. I'll come over and show you. I'll be a good friend. I'm pretty sure. So what you do is you go into it like this, and then you do the challenge. Did you? You already fucking... <laughs> you bitch. Looks like I am for going for Gaia. Is that why I wasn't able to activate it? Because I literally wasn't able to activate it. You already... A you yeah, got, you, I already did it. You slut. It's okay. I forgive you. I Bye, can't, Tim. I can't stay mad at you. You know what? Gaia is just as good. All right? It's not, but... It's just as good. Who thought this was a good idea? They totally X out all of your elixirs, too. They're, they're like, here. You don't get yeah, you, anything. Like, not a get, thing. Well, the thing is, Tim. Yeah. I have work. So I'm just trying to get down as quick as possible so I can eat. Oh, okay. <laughs> what if this does go on for an hour? Who's going no, to win? I, then, I, uh, <laughs> then I get not to eat when I go to work. <laughs> I've been eating dust. You're going to do this to essential workers, Tim? Essential workers, essential workers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who needs them? All right, off to uh, prove myself to the goddess of Earth or whatever Gaia is. Right now, I have the redeemed hand of Gaia, and there is a way to further pack a punch it, isn't there? Yes. Except I don't remember how to do that. Oh my um, God. you do all the hands. You then have to kill a certain amount of catalysts in front of each. Each single um, like stand, oh. and then you go into a third challenge of pack punch where you get like blight fathers and giganies, and it's really difficult. Sounds like a headache. I feel that giganies, by the way. Is there giganies? <laughs> I fucking feel him. I don't have PS4 audio right now, but I feel his presence. I just see the screen shaking. You know what? You're, you're you not running away from me. You're not running away from your palms <laughs> this time. Get back over here. <laughs> no, Tim! Oh, hi, douchebag. I, I don't I don't want any piece of you in your forearms. Oh, look at that. Look at that. I, mean, I have an X6 stingray. I could have taken him out really easily. Which is why I had you... I wouldn't just come to you. I see what you're trying to do, boy. <laughs> what? You want to go on now? Oh, there we go. There we go. Hello, Pegasus. Thank you for stopping. You, you stepped on it and then walked off it. <laughs> just to try and get me down. And I was at 50 health, so I don't know why you left. Because you just saved my life. So I'm not going to tell you how to get out of this side, so I hope you remember. What's that? No. What? Uh, you, do you know how to get out of here? What? Do you know how to get out of this side? You, you want to fight? That's what I'm hearing. I'm hearing fighting words. The Oracle just gave me stuff. 
The Oracle's a friend. She gave me ammo. Oh, the Oracle's more than a friend. Oh. Yeah, me and the Oracle <laughs> are just getting it on. Uh, do you know, isn't it you and the Oracle getting it on, Scarlet? Hmm? I don't actually know what the deal is there, to be honest. I don't really care about the Chaos storyline, but... Yeah, they, they, like, they, like, kissed, didn't they? Uh, yeah, the Oracle kissed her because... Here, here comes Greek mythology, uh, talk. That's how you pass knowledge in Greek, like... That's how oh. Greeks thought you pass knowledge is through kissing. But of course, the Call of Duty community was just like, Lesbians! Exactly! Pack of punching your gun once isn't enough. I gotta do it four more times, so... I'll be here for a while. Uh, pack punching twice is enough. It it is, but like, it isn't. You know. It's the a thing that people don't know. When you pack punch once, it's just like pack punching without double tap and like de and all that. With mm. chaos story, the good thing is if you pack punch again, that all the ammo type is literally. A new. If you kill a certain catalyst with an alternate ammo type, it just goes off like a nuke and killing all surrounding zombies. Oh, that's what. It, okay, I was, I was. That's actually really interesting because on Voyage of Despair the other day, I had, must have been, I don't remember what that pap ability I had, but I killed a poison zombie and he just blew the fuck up and killed everyone. Yeah, yeah. So pretty much, I have a thing that I want to. Like, I want a, a video idea for my own channel to talk about how Aether was definitely not supposed to be in BO4. Because everything just works in chaos. Because, of course, that combination doesn't work in Aether. Because there's no catalysts. Oh my god, she just mauled that fucking skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. I would say don't die, but please die. <laughs> I don't do other stuff, neither. <laughs> of course not. Not IRL. You should definitely die in this game, though. Mm. Will you donate me money if I do? Yeah, I'll pay pal you a hundred bucks to just throw the mask right now. I may consider that. <laughs> I may consider that. I need to look good for my subscribers, damn it. I'll pay you whatever <laughs> it takes. Why do they still have rubber ducks? Is it glitched or do you just constantly renew it? Oh, I'm constantly renewing it. <laughs> Round 20 is pretty close. That would be a nice little objective. Nice little, uh check mark checkpoint to get to that'd be you know 20s are always why are you crouching over trying to you constipate or something <laughs> i'm dark bruno i'm gonna make you dark scarlet tim tim who doesn't understand the uh, chaos storyline just like what i mean i i i i i don't get it i don't get the full scope of it but i i, I something along the lines of like there's an artifact and like these ancient weird uh, people in robes like took it and then uh there's like alistair rhodes who is the father of scarlet rhodes and they're looking for him and then like bruno has like a weird dot on his head and then and then diego ha no diego doesn't have it shaw has one and then uh yeah that's the whole chaos storyline dead ah uh, look at that oh. And I just fell down the whole stairs. He's over here for me now. <laughs> what the hell? Is he wearing socks? Is this bitch wearing socks? No, he's not. No, I'm going to say he's not wearing anything on his feet. How do you think bow and arrows came to be? Like, one guy, one day, like, some guy was just like, I kind of want to stab him, but, like, from really far away. And he just <laughs> invented a way to just shoot a, just a the blade from a very far distance. Yeah. That's pretty. Then the burn arrow was made, and then a gun was made. Oh, what? What the hell is this? Do I grab this? this is a Bowie knife, isn't it? Yeah. It's hey. a Bowie knife. Bowie oh, knife. Yeah, that's a nice reward. <laughs> what the hell? Are you you good? No! No! Thank God. I was at 10 health. I absolutely love it when the magma zombies... I just called it a magma zombie. I love it when the I, when the lava ones start doing, like, the, the anime run. I'm out of ammo in three, two, you and I'm out. Set, you could always set a trap. True, but then I will get max ammo drop. Oh, yeah, shield would be effective. This would also be effective. I just came over here and did this. Come on, Max! <laughs> come on, Max! Yay! Oh. You know what? I'm not standing for that shit. I'm gonna come follow you. <laughs> I'm not gonna be left can behind you... with this douchebag again. Can he just spawn as well? Yeah, he, Yay, just, Max. he just crawled out of his cave. He's like, hey, Tim, I'm here to fucking kill you. Yeah. Uh, we haven't had a bike father yet, have we? I think, have we? I think one. Oh. Uh, 
in 25 rounds, which is actually kind of crazy. I'm just going to risk it all. I'm going to put my life on the line to fight this Giganese right now. No. T Tim's bored is essentially what he's trying to say. Regardless of whoever wins, like, whenever you get to this high of a round, it's, a, it's pretty much a tie, regardless of who actually pulls out. Hey... I agree if I lose, <laughs> but if you, if you lose, no, it's because I'm just saying it now. I'm just saying it now. So if I do lose, I'll refer back to this. I'll bookmark this and be like, hey, remember, remember, we're not all losers here. But remember then if when I win, Tim... I'm just going to rub it in your face. Remember when Tim had a cop out in case he lost? Jesus Christ. Imagine <laughs> actually being impaled like that. <laughs> you just scared me more than you probably scared yourself. Jesus Christ. No, I'm what fine. What was that noise? Fuck. That's that's the uh, 50 health noise. Why after me, you four armed freak? Whoa! No, no offense, everyone has four arms. Oh, there's two. Jeez, there's two, man. Tim. I've got eight arms on me. There's two still? That means there's three this round, because I already killed one. Oh, yeah, because three can happen. Yeah, three can happen on this round. Oh, I've got Blight Father as well. Blight Father and three Giganese? What is this? This is a tragedy. Oh I think. They want the game to end. They want it to end so bad. Like, Tim's video's taking too long. Well, if, if we don't gonna die to four Guineas and two Blight Fathers, I think we're good, Tim. Yeah, I am so reluctant to, to quit or do like a final stand because then people are gonna be like, you're not trying. Well, let's do it this way. Let's be fair and impartial about this, okay? Whoever has the most points wins. Round 33. All right, ladies and gentlemen, what we're gonna do is a final stand. Now, I know what you're thinking. Tim, you should play until somebody- No, 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 okay, listen, we've been going on for an hour and 40 minutes. This is almost a full-ass, whole-ass two hours. So, um, we both agreed that- that there is not a winner of this, okay? It is a draw. Much like, uh, the match with Zwenik under Eyes and Dragon, it is a draw, okay? But at the same time, like, uh, I'm not gonna quit the game or anything, so let's just go in here, in this little amphitheater over here, and whoever dies, dies, but whoever dies is not the loser. That's- that- I'm gonna- I'm gonna say that now. Before I die. Poor health, poor health, poor health, poor health, poor health. I died. Yay! It's okay, though. I, I It's okay, though, because I didn't lose. We draw it already. Newbie. Thank you so much for joining us. Any final words? I like to give everyone just like a, like a closing statement or two if they have any. A plug, whatever it is that you want. You lose. I win. Bye. Okay. I'm joined with the Q Knight Z. And interestingly enough, um, this is the first time you and I have actually talked. It's just pretty cool. Well... Pretty I don't know if you remember, but we actually had a call about 15 minutes ago. Um, right. When, we first met. when you, yeah, we were going to play it and then you had to re download Alpha and here we so are. This is again. actually the second time. Second we've time talked. we've talked. First, first, time, that first time recording while talking, I suppose. Um, okay. We're going to play yeah. some Alpha That's Omega because I know you're a big Nuketown fan. Uh, you can thank Mr. Dalek JD for snatching that from you. But uh, <laughs> we're playing the next best thing, right? Alpha Omega in Black Ops 4. So. Uh, I am ready to go. Is this the next best thing? If this map had come out for BO3 zombies, I think I would. Oh yeah. I think yeah. I would play it pretty often. Oh my god, yeah, in that engine. But good god, just like I, I feel like that just gets beat into the ground. Like the whole BO4 engine sucks mm -hmm. thing. Yeah. But it's true. <laughs> like it's very true. Oh my That's god. That's like yeah. the whole reason I never revisit this game. As far as the Dude. ray guns go, I am like I kind of remember, but I don't. I don't think I have, you have to do the something whole with TVs. grasp. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The TVs. You have to shoot something. There's four of them. I think there's parts. I think you might have to open the map. Yeah. Maybe. Too much effort. I don't feel like opening up the whole map. <laughs> I'm kidding. No, but I'm actually, I'm not going for the ray guns. Fuck that. I don't remember how to get that either, so I don't even know why I'm bringing it up. Yeah. I'm, I'm but... glad. I'm glad that you don't know how to do it either, because that would be kind of unfortunate for me if you were like, if you knew how to do it, like all four of them and you just got them all while I was just sitting here like with my I don't know if that'd be much of an advantage. I, I don't know like BO4 just my my roommates played this game a lot casually too And they all just feel like it's just mind-numbingly easy All the maps for the most like, part. You don't have yeah with Wraith Fire any of the maps difficult? Like uh, Classified super easy just camp mm. Well, okay. E remember when it was remember when round 30 was like big yeah. okay that's a high round you made mm -hmm. it to round 30 like black ops pretty one good. two even yeah uh, in this game like round 30 it's like uh that's when you start getting bored because it's getting so easy it's getting mind numbing it's almost like it gets easier i was gonna ask you uh was black ops 4 itself the reason why you took that uh that long hiatus or was it just like personal stuff too uh well 
I mean, I, I guess we've never talked, but I mean, I do a couple other channels. Oh, um, yeah. Actually, I think I have heard of um one of them. Don't you play uh, is it Battlefront Star Wars? Yeah, I have Battlefront I Night, which yeah. is like a Battlefront channel, mm -hmm. obviously, or Star Wars channel, I guess at this point, because Battlefront's on the way down. But um, and then I do Yesterworld, which is like a theme park channel. Oh, um, cool, cool. I'd actually both of those that. channels are around like the 200k mark. That's pretty good. Um, and I, I mean, like for me, Call of Duty, like I plan, like if BO5 Zombies is really good, I mean, I'm going to come back at launch no matter what, but mm -hmm. if it's really good, I'll stick around and stream because streaming it can be is not that fun. hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, like stream a couple hours each night. I like if I, I'm enjoying the map, it's fun. If you're not enjoying the map, it's like a chore. What were you doing when BO4 launched? Because it wasn't your. I'm not <laughs> sure if I'm supposed you to mention Black Ops 4 launched. I was. Wasn't your channel called like Bluefoot? Oh, bro, that was. Person, um, right? I was Bluefoot for the first like year and a half of my channel. I think around 50k is when I just changed it to my you know my plain ass basic ass mm -hmm. name, uh, Tim Hansen, um, and. Ever since then, I, I the beginning of Black Ops Four, I must have been around like anywhere between seventy five k and hundred k, and then it was this summer that really, uh, it was custom zombies that made me grow more than anything. It was never Black Ops Four. <laughs> when the game actually launched, I was a huge fan of Nine, especially that map was absolutely. It's I mean it didn't get worse. It's still amazing, but mm -hmm. at, especially at spawn, that map was so hype, and everybody was disregarding it too. That's that's the best part about it. Everyone was like, eh. I'm excited for Blood of the Dead, and then it was, ironically, it ended up being one of the worst ones, in my opinion. I remember putting out a tweet that Blood I thought Blood of the Dead was way better than Mob of the Dead uh, uh, around launch. Yeah. But a lot of that just came from me, like, because I, like, solved a few of the Easter egg steps first, which was, like, really exciting, because I'd never even tried before. Mm -hmm. So it was there was, like, some of that, like, hype, you know, like yeah, that. Yeah, launch hype. Can do a lot to it. Man. Yeah, I think that was it. I mean, every time a map comes out, you're out. It's like when a band releases a new album, and then they get interviewed and they tell everybody it's their best album yet, mm -hmm. and they know damn well it's not. That's how I feel about like every time a map comes out, I'm like, oh, this is pretty good. But like, <laughs> exactly, dude. Every first playthrough, I'm like, this is this is really good, especially in Black Ops Four. And then like a week later, everyone's like, did you give up on it? I'm like, yeah, sorta. It's just. I, got, I, got I, I feel like I should give, like, Alpha Omega, I, I I don't think I ever gave a fair enough chance. Me neither, I, I mean, I, frankly. I tried it a bit, but I just, at that point, I just, I, I don't know. I mean, I, I was already too far gone on the chaos story. Oh, shit. So. Oh, shit. Get out of me way. Get out of me. No, no, no. No, no, no. This is not ending right now. This is not ending right now. Fuck no. I actually watched a bit of your last video you did like this, the starting room one, mm -hmm. with JC. Um, yeah. I watched the part with JC, and you were talking with JC about how it was so weird for you to be playing, like, with, you know, JC and Lex and those guys. Yeah. Because you used to watch them all the time. Yeah. <laughs> that was literally, like, the same exact thing, like, for me. Like, I remember watching uh, the first Easter eggs for charity and being like, oh, wow, that'd be so cool to be in that someday. And then, like, around, like, Zombie Chronicles, like... The whole streaming thing like kind of blew up yep um I, I, were you around during chronicles you must have been a little bit i guess i guess at the time i was probably still bluefoot actually yeah i was and i had some videos up for sure it's hard it's, youtube's weird because it's all just like one big blur it feels like one big like doesn't it's hard to like distinguish years on youtube for me i uh, yeah, I th I think I was uploading. Yeah, I definitely was. I must not be very good at doing things while talking to another per human being. Yeah, it's a little bit because I keep difficult. like running to random corners of the map with like a goal, <laughs> yeah. and then I don't actually do anything. Yeah. I, I think I've it. picked up one part in total over the last ten minutes. Dude, the amount of fucking doors I've opened, Quinn. Are you kidding me? What the hell's going on with ten grand over here? Okay, I'm doing a ventilation unit. <laughs> All right, get off my back. I should have practiced this at least once. I could have helped. Practice, smack this, cactus. Who cares about practice? You know. <laughs> I'm a. I, I I practice zombies eight hours a day for the last three years. I don't know if you knew that about <laughs> me. Eight hours every day. I wake up at four thirty a.m. just to get started. <laughs> uh, Maybe have a cup of coffee if I have time. 
No. No, Tim. I've had the Mog this entire game, I, I and I spawned in with it, too. I didn't even get it, so I'm like, I, I gotta spin the box. That might be a decent idea. I'm gonna try to build the shield. I th did you get the part in here? There is a part in here somewhere. I think I got the part might, up where the Mog might was part. in the blue building. Okay, I never finished this. What the hell is the I got the Reaver. I got this stupid crossbow thing. But they didn't. Oh, I died. Did we get that? Oh, Tim. We were just about- I was just building the shield. Guess what? I tried what? to use anywhere but here. I used temporal. Instead. Sure, Jan. Sure. That's my excuse. Honestly, like, I'm, I'm really sad, actually, because I felt- I mean, it's Alpha it Omega. Be... If there were a map for me to suck on, it's this one, because I- this- I fucking hate this map, and apparently this map hates me back, so. Uh, congratulations, Quinn, you are the winner, and you can choose to revive me, and we can kill ourselves together as tradition, or you can let me bleed out, whatever you'd like. And then, I'll revive uh, you. Alright. That's- that's the spirit. I like that. Take me down! Shouldn't be too- Oh, I Your fucked it up. Your are killing that I thought, was, I thought they'd still hit me. Here we go. Here we go. Hey! Oh. Come hit me! There you go. Oh, are oh, you you killed him. I don't, what do I do? Do I revive you in this situation or do I just I think you, you should just uh let's try that again. I'll get you again. We got to make this count. Yeah. This one will probably work. Yep. Yep. That'll suffice. There we All go. right, there we go. Nice. Quinn, thank you for joining us. Any final words for the kids? Any morals? Any plugs? Whatever it is that you want, fam. It's all open for you right now. Uh, no plugs. Thanks for watching. Thank you for watching, and on to the final map, which is Tog Dare Toten with, you guessed it. If you've made it this far into the video, if you've made it to the very last map here on Tog Dare Toten, round of applause. Round of applause. You're a trooper. That's 30 maps, and that's a lot of time invested into the video. So for that, I, of course, thank you, and I am joined with Mr. T-Lexify on the final map, the and finale of we're this closing map. it out, and this is going to be a little bit interesting. We haven't really done this with any of the other maps. We're going to be doing a starting room challenge, and there's this is mutually agreed upon. Lex and I both agreed, <laughs> yeah. both agreed that the two of us on TOG, without any restrictions other than no dying wish, isn't enough. We're probably going to last several hours, most likely, with all of the stuff at our disposal to help us. So, we're going to restrict ourselves to the starting room challenge, which in and of itself is kind of a map anyways. We, we got rates specialists whole, it's everything this whole, it's this whole thing man yeah we yeah. have we have i think we have a lot of good gear at yeah. our disposal so yeah. i think we could definitely do some damage here. we're gonna get just enough footage with the starting room <laughs> and you know what i don't hate this map i don't but i also wasn't very much looking forward to oh i gotta pick up the dynamite pieces i gotta <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I gotta, I gotta get the tundra gun. Snowballs. You originally want to call the dead for this challenge, and that was taken, so you took, I guess, the next best thing. <laughs> the next best call of the dead, dude. <laughs> the, the next best call of the dead in the lineup, aka the only other call of the dead. <laughs> Listen, uh, man, cool. I like the way this map lays itself out, though. I think, sure, like... Yeah. I think, I think they took call of the dead and made it interesting, because it's like, in the original call of the dead... You can't even play in this area. Like, it's all just, like, mm -hmm. one generator. You know what I yeah. mean? Like, that's, that's kind of it. Thanks, uh, we gotta get the shield part. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna get the shield part. Let's give a round prediction. What, what Which round are one of us going to, to die? Hmm, I actually don't know. I'm guessing, uh, you know what? I'm gonna shoot for a 32. 32 are you dude that's insane i but i've done it with four players i've gotten to mid 30s dude, I, I was gonna say record. like i was gonna say like 13 <laughs> 13 i you know what we'll see we'll I, see i think it's gonna be like a lot less than you think like maybe this this map has a lot of space but it's also like the zombies move really slow in this ice cold water right so like it they act as like these walls that you just can't go through i actually really like the zombies in this map like the way they look with the how they kind of like frozen over a little bit it's so cool actually yeah they do look good the atmosphere does look nice i don't know if it matches what call of the dead really was but it, the sunset ooh, ooh. yeah no call of the dead was like introduced as this incredibly eerie map yeah that was 
like so in tied with the Black Ops One 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 Five storyline. Mm-hmm. So it is weird seeing it like in this beautiful bright sun. I still don't know how I feel about them ending everything with Victus. Part of me is like okay with it because you know it's not a huge deal, but the other part of me is like that's a little distasteful. No, like it's a little like, eh, I gotta end yeah. my entire zombies tenure with Misty, Marlton, Russman, and Stulinger. Ugh. I yeah, like, I tell people though, I think that because they ended the game with Victus, that this next game is going to start off with Victus. Oh, and, like, boy. apparently a lot of the, like... I read, I heard a Dark Ether quote from Stulinger in this map, and apparently he says it's, like... He makes it really sound like it's coming back, like the Victus crew in some way, shape, or form is coming back. <laughs> so, if it's that's the thing, I don't know. Like, I, I would love to see Victus remakes, right? Like, I think that would be sick, but... Yeah, especially Buried. I mean, Die Rise. Oh, fuck you, Johnny yeah. J25. Fuck you, Johnny J25. Really <laughs> Bro, that video he made of you is so funny. It's weird because it's like I every DLC four map is indicative of how the next game plays a little. Maybe oh, apart yeah. from Moon and Transit. <laughs> but uh So you think Revelations was indicative of uh how Black Ops 4 was going to go, maybe? Absolutely. Yeah, like there are a lot of mechanics in Rev that they took. Um into bo4 you know what's interesting about revelations is that it's supposed to be the uh it's supposed to be the chronicles it's supposed to be the hey remember this remember that but then zombies chronicles dropped not too far after and then revelations yeah. after chronicles came out i thought lost a lot of value in the market i think a lot of people were like yeah revelations is basically zombies chronicles but like 1.0 yeah it, it's funny because out of every bo3 map revelations is the one i've played the least i I just, I just have no desire. desire to play that map. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. To me, it's a fun map, but it's so unoriginal and boring that I actually like it the least of every BO3 map. I even appreciate Zetsubo way more, even though it has more shit qualities, because it just tried yeah. better. Honestly, I understand that. Like, I get that. I don't want to die. I almost died already, Lex. This is actually getting pretty intense. I think you're round 13 <laughs> prediction. I think it might come true. <laughs> This whole 30s thing? Jeez. Yeah, dude, I don't I know about well. 30s. We're, we're struggling on round 10. <laughs> it's okay, I have my strife. I whipped out the katan. Oh, shit. If a zombie is already dead, can he drown? Isn't it kind of weird, Lex, how every time we play together in zombies, it's always competitive, whether it's this or Last Man's Day? <laughs> no, we never have, like, an actual, like... Cooperative effort. Cooperative. It's always just, fuck you, <laughs> me versus you, and it's it's always, like, win or Bro. lose. <laughs> I, somebody, somebody messaged me in my stream the other day and was like... The last time you won Last Man Standing was the Shotguns episode, and I'm pretty sure that was our second episode ever. Yeah. And I'm just like, damn, I fucking suck. Well, Lex, <laughs> he, let me put it this way. Season 1 was pick your own fate, and in Season 1, even though you only had one win, I would say for the most part, you you did not come in fourth very often. You you did pretty well for Season no, 1. No, I de yeah, I definitely wasn't coming in last yeah. But like, bro, season two, season what two the is fuck? luck. It's all luck. I mean, you get. Sh I, I, I'm assuming you haven't gotten shit luck in every episode. But man, I'll t I can tell you from my experience, I've gotten flopper twice out of the four episodes. I've gotten. I think the best gun I've gotten was the MP7, possibly. Hey, round 14. Hey. Look at that. Although technically, if we die right now, it's round 13. Oh, we subtract a round from us. Why does this game do that, bro? I hate that. Because, like, every yeah. time I have to get to round 100, it's like, no, you only survived 99 rounds. You got to go to 101. <laughs> and there'll be that one kid in the comments that if you did die in round 100, like, uh, actually, technically, you died on round 99. You did not die on round 100. I'm literally flying around. That's nuts. This was probably oh. my favorite part. No! Lex! Oh! God oh, damn it! Oh no! Wait, I got stuck on. on this fucking plank. What is this shit? Oh, it's a, <laughs> wait, it's a boat. Is this a boat? I can't even tell. Yeah, I think it's a boat. Hold I on. Oh. I got stuck on this fucking. Yeah, if you if you revive me, we can both kill ourselves together as a tribute. Dude, 
I think I'm going to flex on you and just end the round while you're done. So <laughs> congratulations, Lex. You have won. Uh, GG. Now, how do we kill Ooh! ourselves? How do, how do we want to do that? Um, we could oh, leave we the spawn room. We uh, could, uh, we could, uh, yeah, let's leave the spawn room. I need my electric like burst though. before I die. Electric burst. Yeah, you, know, you, know, you just want to freeze to death. I feel like that's a very fitting way to die. Yeah, I think. Let's find it's a nice like the, pool of water to just freeze that's a ourselves in. Good analogy of the state of Call of Duty zombies right now. Yeah. All right, I'm just gonna. Well, I'm here. I'm just gonna. Yeah, I'm just gonna get killed by the 900. Oh! In front of me. <laughs> <laughs> There's so fucking many. All there right, no I think the dogs one. might kill me before this ever does. Am I? Oh. Yep. Yeah. Uh, wait. Oh, I'm frozen. Yeah. I'm frozen. There's dogs. Dude, the I... dogs are going under the water. Oh, there it is. In... <laughs> They were literally just running full force <laughs> through the H2O, bro. <laughs> oh my god. And there it is. Over four hours of competitive zombies gameplay. 1v1-ing. 30 different zombies YouTubers on every single Treyarch zombies map chronologically. What an endeavor that was. It was a very long and difficult editing process, but... I love nothing more than making these types of videos, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Every single participant in this video will also be in the description. And I realize that it is unreasonable of me to ask you to subscribe to 30 different people. But what I do ask is if you enjoyed one particular person or two, drop them a sub. And guess what time it is now? It's reflection time, baby. How good did I do? How well did I fend off against all of these other YouTubers? Well, to be exact, I had 12 wins, 15 losses, and 3 draws. I actually had a couple more losses than wins. Am I upset about that? Not really, but <laughs> it is interesting because a lot of these games could have gone either way. A lot of the games that I actually won, I could have very easily lost, and vice versa. A lot of the games that I lost, I could have very easily won. Ultimately, I'm just really happy with the entertainment value of this video. I don't really care about the results too much. If you watched this entire video from the zero mark to the very end, please pat yourself on the back. Do it gently, don't hurt yourself. But please, give yourself a nice pat on the back. Alright, a little quick golf clap, round of applause. Because that is fucking amazing, and you're a trooper. I love you so much. And if you skip to the ending, I still love you, but you should watch the whole video. Anyways, I think that's it. Again, leave a like, subscribe. I hope you guys have a fucking terrific day. And I'm actually going to head out. See you later.